Birds of the Gammon with the hottest disc jockey. Disc jockey. D -d -d DJ Dork Genius. <laughs> Talking bread, you don't want my 
money, you just want my head, you just want my heart, you just want me put love in my heart. I'm okay with that. I was close to death and now I'm living. I'm just stating facts, the blatant whack, have the Satan's back, have a take a gas, hit up brand and watch him lay a track. And 80 seconds flat, straight attack. Anyone who said they not okay with that, brain so full of acid in my heart and veins were tainted black. Back when your boy was a boy without a plan, had the poison in my hand, and my toys were in the sand. And I ran from all the noises, said I'm poised to be a man. I was damaged from the toil, now I'm oil in a pan. On a stove, yeah. this thing called life. life. We're gonna be alright. Yeah. Went through dark days and we beat long nights. It might be hard to see the bigger picture when your skis on tight. You gotta take that mask off like future sipping lean on ice. I got my whole life in front of me, look at me up in the sky. Me and my wife, she is so lovely. I've been feeling so high. Fly, just like a bone will be feel like the outer box rolling out. Feel like the headline and running out. Rest in peace, I'm going down. down. Of course. Again, we're running to the countdown right now. We got about four minutes left, and then we are officially starting the review show. Send your music to my email, that dorky review show at gmail.com. Yeah. I've been praying for forever. Lord, please don't let me let up. I've been working way too hard for me to really just give up. Every day's a fight to get up. My problems, nothing but hiccups. I'm focused, no, I won't slip up. I promise that they won't get us. Got my family on the side of me. Enemies trying to ride on me. Catch me if you really working on finding me. Took my heart, it was a robbery I was down, but this defined me Be a honey, you shouldn't have lied to me But That's they come good. and go like the days But my night's yeah, long I like to get songs. high, chillin' vibe to the right songs Alone, no snakes, no pythons Cuddled up with a stranger, but see she ain't the right one A rose still blooms even in its darkest moments The grounds of that war, you survived, you better own it That feeling that you hide, do not let him provoke it And never repeat it if you cannot quote it I've been praying for forever, Lord, please don't let me let up I've been working way too hard for me to really just give up Every day's a fight to get up, my problems nothing but hiccups I'm focused, no, I won't slip up, I promise that they won't get us Never let the worst get the best of me Mama, I can feel you running That's how I'm supposed to go Let's go, 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 let's go. We got two minutes and 30 seconds Send that fire and share it up, hit that like for you know what it is Tagging artists they deserve to be heard. That's how it's supposed to go. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Got too many felonies for a job, so I ended up broke. Where you was at when I needed 160 for a ball of coke? My mama and my grandma had to hustle every day, no joke. Yeah. TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington Coke Factory for coke. Yeah. If you wasn't a fan or your parents wasn't broke, then you probably wouldn't know. Uh-uh. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how it's supposed to go. Yeah. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how it's supposed to go. Yeah. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how it's supposed to go. Let's go. Got your life, I got mine, homie. That's how I'm supposed to go. My auntie died from an OD off dope. But it wasn't from the shit I sold her a long time ago. But I'm really supposed to know. Take a minute just to think about it. I'll take a minute for his boat. Damn. Couldn't take a minute, cause the end of the song coming too close. Yeah. Too much rain drop doing me, I'm so. I know how to swim and I got floats. Pussy was so good, I ain't want dope. She lonely, so I gave her dick slow. Ball or cash, nigga, get mo. Don't contribute, then you gotta go. A track, I bust off on it, no cap. You gotta pay me like a hoe. Flamers, like my nigga Meek flow. Grown and sexy like a peacoat. Survive my 30s, I don't need hope. One Big girls in my bed till they get soaked. Roll, roll, roll your boat. Anything I've been through in life in these notes. My angel. Low quotes, EBT stamp, it was hard to get a low. Told my son, don't boast. Thank God that we even made it here, whoa. Catch the sister fed us both. Thank God that we even made it here, whoa. Catch the sister fed us both. Got too many felonies for a job, so I ended up broke. Where you was at when I needed 160 for a ball of coke? My mama and my grandma had to hustle, every day no joke. TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington, Coke Factory for coke. If you wasn't a fan or your parents wasn't broke, then you probably wouldn't know. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how I'm supposed to go. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how I'm supposed to go. Where you was at? You wasn't there, and that's how I'm supposed to go. 38 seconds. Look. Nick say he's finna kill him like the government The question won't be who I am, like but where the them bitches six. went? Hey, new streets is gon' feel me when I drop my shit Every block, every ab, every hood there is Every ear, every heart, and every ab The man hold thread out here Cause I'm better than half these men He ain't even in my league, how you expect to win? Got me laughing cause y'all say I real stupid Make the song cry every time I write a blueprint uh-huh. Cutting up so much of the dome, they charge boo for it All about a dollar, bitch, you can keep your two cents Big girl, big bank, that's the movement I go nuts on every track, I win when I lose it The game needs some change, guess I'ma be that nuisance okay. 
But I want the bills with the blue tint Sorry Nike, everybody just can't do it And this ain't even me at my best Alright, you already know what it is You are jamming with the hottest disc jockey DJ Torque Genius Please send your records to that dorky review show at gmail.com or get ready to die. Ha 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 ha. Oh, let's share the stream. Alright, chat to everybody freaking tapping in with us, man. Freaking today. Happy freaking Wednesday, of course, as we freaking scroll freaking through and, you know, try to get. Some of y'all freaking music freaking play today and, and uh, uh, you know, hopefully hear some freaking bangers and or, you know, gems that 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 we that we should. Hey, come on, man. All right. Let me freaking turn that freaking off. Um, listen, but welcome to that dorky review show. I'm your host, Nonsense, a.k.a. Dork Genius, a.k.a. Chris Nonsense, a.k.a. Nonsense is Dork Genius, a.k.a. Your mama's favorite dork, a.k.a. Dork for hire, a.k.a. Gang Dork, a gang dork play, a.k.a. Dorky So Quince, a.k.a. El Dorky Corbon, a.k.a. Now, you already know what it is. Uh, pretty much, we're live right now on all platforms from YouTube to Band Lab to TikTok to Facebook to Twitch to Twitter. Shout out to everybody freaking locked in, of course, with us, as I said. Uh, it is 100% free to submit to the to the show and stuff like that. Just make sure you get yourselves in freaking line. Can be a little bit of a wait, so try to be patient while you are in that free line as we are going through each song. Um, there is a way to skip the long line if you do want to get played quicker or if you have more than one song that you want played. We try to play at least one record per artist in the free line so we can make sure that, that you guys, you know, are fairly, you know what I'm saying, played across the freaking board or whatnot. But if you want more than one, you, you will have to stand and freaking skip anyway. If you want, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll show you Yo, nice sort of that thing that you Mike, could this do. This song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you or actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit, I'm thinking you were high. Like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view when I'm cool, but her act like you surprised. Head to McDonald's, I'm about to steal your fries. Yeah, at least gives you the eye options and stuff like that if you do get impatient and or again like you might have dropped the album or freaking something like that and want the uh full album review ep different things like that uh we'll see what's up of course and we do giveaways at the end of each episode if we happen to reach at least a hundred by the end uh so we we have fun freaking on here and stuff like that we rate everything on a one to ten scale all genres are accepted do not be shy and feel like you cannot send your record to the show if we get like a lot of rap records or you know what I'm saying R&B or, or freaking rock whatever we play everything just the only thing we don't play is industry music do not send Drake do not send Migos do not send Nicki Minaj do not sing Nar do not send Beatles Nirvana do not send Janet Jackson I don't freaking care like we cannot play industry artists and if the same thing goes Without say, if you rap on or sing over their instrumentals and beats, it's literally the same thing. So try not to send those records. I prefer more original stuff, like with you guys on, you know, actual producers' beats that are that are freaking out here, trying to freaking make it as well, and you know, combining like that. Appreciate you for the likes over here. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to freaking Basics, of course, man. Dane was freaking good. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Style was freaking popping, you know what I'm saying? Oh, witty was freaking bleh, which clapping, you know what I'm saying? Sidekick back in the freaking cusp, as you freaking know. You already know. Uh, let me see. Rain six was freaking good. Yes, sir. Uh, you go over here, do a quick, uh, you know what I'm saying? Run through. Mom, mom, what's up? Uh, let me see. Xavier, you know what I'm saying? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Skull was freaking popping. Hold on. We must, well, we must go through and remain. Uh, Mugs Money, Town Mama was freaking good, man. You already freaking know. Hold on. Uh, did, I forgot what, um, what Miss Luck had said she had given you from her, uh, winning or whatnot, but she told me she lets you know. So, uh, you have that. And then again, on the band lab side, we got, uh, shout to freaking SK, uh, YNW, Caleb was freaking popping, Mr. Egg Sandwich, weird name, but you know what I'm saying? We'll see if the music matches up. And uh, goes from freaking there. We'll leave it at that and go into the free line so we can get you guys freaking played. Once again, appreciate y'all for freaking being here. Let me just refresh my email, make sure we are in the right place and we will jump right in. Where are ye? 
Weird, weird, yeah. Hold on. Let me go down a little bit and stuff like that, man. Uh, I don't, I don't read the lineup and stuff like that because we we tend to get a lot of skips on the freaking show. And even when I go, oh, you have three people ahead of you, five people come through and send freaking skips, and all of a sudden the, you know, that freaking escalates to a whole freaking other thing. So I can't keep track of everybody like that. Just try to be patient if you can. We did just freaking start, so we are, uh, you know, what I'm saying rolling in. Just remind, just try to remind yourself and others that we're on several platforms at once we're not just on TikTok. we're not just on youtube you know we're not just on twitch facebook like all that uh you know what i'm saying we're doing it simultaneously so we can you know what i'm saying give you guys your options of where you want to freaking go and for the people who only tend to pop up on certain platforms i kid you not there are only people who will pop up on the uh facebook side sometimes or youtube and vice versa some of you guys will like this like this view right here is the only TikTok is the only one who gets this right close close up you know what i'm saying with the dj kind of freaking situation everybody else gets something different which again i can turn you guys around and kind of show y'all what people see on the youtube side right as we're going freaking here you can see the sort of chat on freaking that and anything that i'm playing video wise we'll go through there and we also have other scenes for when we are, you know what I'm saying, playing videos. Facebook, like that. Yo, check. Non-change with the face palm. Vince Vaughn's been in space loss with his face gone. Still a race cause and a faint yawn. It's his face ball. Stay chill or remain calm. Take pills every day. Nah, I don't take pills. You know what I'm saying? Had a little TV freaking running over the freaking thing and stuff like that. Uh, Y'all know what it is. Anyways, big salute. You can head back over freaking here. All right. Once again, appreciate y'all. So again, just remember, all feedback is welcome for any records that we do play freaking tonight. Uh, and again, we rate everything on a one to 10 scale. We have two different hashtags. If you love a record so much that again, you would hit that run it back button or uh, you know, literally just play the song again yourself in the moment. Uh, you guys know what you freaking like that much. Hashtag run it back always. If you hate a record so much that you literally would almost blow your brains out if you had to hear it again. Hashtag dorky don't play that. Usually if we're in the free line, we will stop that record in its tracks if we get enough people who basically are feeling that same way. Sometimes I don't even wait for y'all. If I feel like what the hell is going on, basically, you know what I'm saying? I'll hit that thing. So let's go. AC Davis, no mix. No low hey, end yet. I mean, you didn't even give I'm me a song title. I'm gonna dedicate this song to my bitch ass mama. <laughs> Wherever you at, Why, I want bro? everyone to know how fucking horrible you are. He has to be in the building. We can only play one. We can't. We can't like split two from. If you send it, you basically can only get Think one. Think about that one kid who said you, that so he, he might not it. have survived without your music while he cruising or, up or not on the drive. Think about that one kid who said that you was gonna be nothing and prove him wrong. Fuck that haters. Yeah, it's fuck them. It's fuck them. Think about that one kid who said that he might not have survived without your music while he cruising up or not on the drive. Think about that one kid who said that you was gonna be nothing and prove him wrong. Fuck debaters. Yeah, it's fuck them. It's fuck them. I keep on waking up out of cold sweats Remembering them days you was roaming Run the road and trying to find yourself some cigarettes Trade your children for a villain made a poet Made a couple it's people bad. angry one was so rich That our bills he could have paid him and you know it But you trade his ass for David with this whole fist That he got from punching ladies ain't that so rich I've got a few things left that gives anger Survived with 
out your music while he cruising up all night on the drive Think about that one kid who said that you was gonna be nothing and prove him wrong Fuck that haters, yeah, it's fuck him, it's fuck him Think about that one kid who said that he might not have survived without hey, your music he while he cruising though. up all night on the drive Think about that one kid who said that you was gonna, gonna be went. nothing and prove I'm him sorry, wrong Fuck them haters, yeah, it's fuck him, it's fuck him I was a toddler and fatherless, TV raised me right I had no positive role models, that's crazy, right? Forgot this bitch watching when her new Davey tried to wrap his hands around my neck Like save me God, these food stamps were mine But then this bastard child took the food out of my mouth Bitch had to try me, I've the mind of a murderer Yeah, that's true, but those words are worth jack shit Working for the worthless person that murdered the mercy I've been your heart and you're searching the dish for her cigarettes It is my last memory of her, I hope she's hurting in bed Earning respect, working in her sucking dick I'm gonna stop it right there. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, Anna, you already know like, where it's gonna go. But I do. Hold on. I need to. I need to take this out real quick. I need to take the audio out for one second. I'm gonna. Uh, I'll bring it right back. I need to bring up the thing on the freaking screen so you guys can actually see that in the back. Cause for whatever reason, okay, there we go. Should now be, okay, yeah, there we go, all right. Okay, bring this back and. Testing, testing, door two, three. Anybody home? Anybody home? All right, so listen, listen, this right freaking here, uh, I do have to remind people, I'm, I wanna do this first or whatnot because literally even though I just said it before we played the song, um, no industry records on the show. The only reason why I did let this one slide is because it wasn't exactly the same beat. Like it wasn't the instrumental for I'm Sorry Mama by freaking Eminem and shit like that, but it was a reproduced version of it. You know what I'm saying? I hope the algorithm doesn't pick it up and still like think that it's the freaking record because that's basically what will freaking happen essentially. Um, you know, so cross your fingers on that. Um, and then there was still like part of me that wanted something a little bit freaking more something something different like it still felt very similar to the original right and the the thing that I, that you did do different you didn't sort of like copy the chorus for you know the same record um you know you may have took you know a few cadences every every once in a while or something like that so there was hot paying homage to it but there was this part of me that just wanted more from the beat to be flipped or whatnot just because i know what i would have done if you had sort of came to me for the you know what hey let's remix um i'm sorry mama or whatnot i would have done something different to the beat so that it would be not the same thing that you know people you know because be, they're going to compare it literally um and that's with every cover that you do that's one-to-one -one. every sort of like let me just rap to the beat of the song that everybody freaking knows kind of situation um there were some extra other elements from maybe like the guitars and stuff like that but then at, at a certain point it felt like it was just getting it was way too much just going on and and you know like every like you know they were bringing they were bringing in more instruments and then the other the other guitar and instrument players didn't leave they just stayed there as well and so everybody was just playing all at once and it just felt like overcrowded so a little bit of a mixed issue there and i'll just leave it at freaking that and stuff like that what did you guys think rhyme storytelling and stuff like that wasn't freaking bad um maybe a lyric video would help this one out a little bit more just to make it uh, a little bit more refined and more energy uh what do you say we do mine now sammy and my cousin both watching us on youtube no so listen 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 I need your cousin to get in the building too. Otherwise, I can't freaking play free, play his. Like, literally, both of you guys have to be in the building. Um, otherwise, it's it's just like you sent one song, and I can only play one of those and shit like that. If you want to send a two-song back-to-back skip, we can do that, and we'll play both of you guys back-to-back. -back. 
But unless he sends his own submission, if he's watching, let him know right now to get himself in the line. Send his record to my email, thatdorkyreviewshow at gmail.com so I can, uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, make sure that you guys are, are both freaking in there, all right? You know what I'm saying? I apologize for any kind of, uh, you know, situation and stuff like that. I appreciate you both for watching or whatnot, but we do have... Uh, a way that we do things around here or whatnot, you know what I mean? You guys are, are of course, uh, uh, welcome to show love to other artists, but the way I do things, one submission per artist and person submitting the song via the free line and shit like that. Skips, you guys have unlimited. You guys can skip that line. No nonsense, get whatever sir, you need this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you where actual worms lie. Don't like my Man. old shit. I'm thinking you were high like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view. You and I'm cool, better, better act like you surprised. Hey, to make and yeah, we accept all genres. Uh, ski high. Let me see. Xavier had said, I. I like it. Uh, I want to hear some original from him. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Uh, I'd give this a five out of freaking ten. Uh, I would not. You know what I'm saying? Not bad there. You said, yeah, it's like a little remix. I feel uh, like you could hit harder with the bars. You know what I'm saying? But you talking, uh, you know what I'm saying? Fire. I see that. He was like Eminem right when the freaking uh, ad popped up. And then you said, so let me see what, what you guys said. You had an eight out of ten from uh, Rain Six Lucy. You already know what it is. Um, cleaning out my closet, you know, I don't know why. Well, you know what it is. I don't freaking care. Relax. All right. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry, mama. <laughs> it's crazy. Yo, listen, I know it's cleaning out my closet. Relax. Relax, man. We can call, we can call any, anyone's song, whatever we want, man. That's the freedom of art, man. It's to, it's to be interpreted by the listener, man. Uh, poetry, rap, Mugs Money was freaking saying. Agreed. Agreed. Let me see. No, it's crazy. Talking about EVT, LMAO. Uh, how you feeling about it? Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. Shout out to freaking Rain. Said, nope, guitar volume needs lowering. Indeed, that's that's where the overcrowdedness pretty much freaking came from. Um, and then you said, okay, you said it's still not done yet. Uh, when it's done, it's going to blow uh, y'all away because the raw performance um, under is amazing. If it uh, is carried, that beat enough or whatnot. Again, I'm saying like, bro, give me your acapella, damn it. Give me your acapella. I will remix the shit for you in the way that I freaking see it. And I'll show you what I'm freaking talking about. Whether I'll make an original beat just like uh, just completely that doesn't even have the same melodies or something like that. Or I sample it and then do something like that. I will do something different that will, you know, at least at least give people a, a, a fresh take of what you're trying to do. Let's go ahead and go back in the free line. But once... Once real quick, I just want to remind the band lab side, make sure you guys send your uh, record to my email. Do not post your links in the chat unless your song is playing. Otherwise, it's just considered spam and nobody pays attention to that. So make sure you send to the email, network in the chat, rate all records, you know what I'm saying, as you freaking hear them. Let people know if you freaking rock with it or not. And you know, we pretty much go from freaking there and stuff like that. It's always better to actually say something versus nothing and then waiting for your song to be played, bird watching in the background and shit like that. Keep us Literally in the crib. Help. We kill right, We got all LB seconding. Better quit talking shit before it's too late. Karma's coming Hater back killer. cause it never hesitates The Reaper's coming for you. He already One man set the crew. Date. It's like no matter what I do or how dope that I am. Haters talk shit and say I can't do what I know I can. For many years I proved them wrong and I'm still going strong. I'm about to sodomize them lyrically on the song. These motherfuckers work a dead and nine to five. Then hate on anyone more successful okay. living the kind of life they've always dreamed of. But Good they'll job. never acquire. They'll probably work until they die and probably never retire. I'm about to track a hater down and then I'll end all his misery. About to hit this motherfucker with a special delivery. About to train all his blood and free his soul till he's history. Even with some lumen, all the cops will never saw the mystery. Click, click, pop, and I pop six shots through his thoughts. It was loud, so the neighbors called the cops. But I didn't get caught, cause I did what I 
was taught with these Gore-Tex boots that I bought me a It's the hater killer season with the keepers of the crypt. We'll collapse your empire with the song from my lips. We'll have a solar eclipse every time we spit these rhymes. And if you start hating, best believe we'll leave you behind. Cause it's the hater killer season with the keepers of the crypt. We'll collapse your empire with the song from my lips. We'll have a solar eclipse every time we spit these rhymes. And if you start hating, best believe we'll leave you behind. Well, man, girl, damn, Benny, heard that you be shit talking about the keepers of the crypt. Now I stalk a dead body walking Boom, that's right high, here. Watching with an eagle eye like I'm hawking. Cause I'm evil like that motherfucker Christopher Walken. Prophesizing their demise with their lies. And they be cocking like a chicken sucking severed dicks up inside of a coffin. I celebrate the anniversaries of haters' death often by digging up the graves and making sure they're still dead and rotten. It's like everywhere I go, all I see is the hate. These whack bitch motherfuckers perpetrating like they be something great. But they're not, man, they're fake. I'm about to put them in place and pay them all a little visit and cut up their face. Haunted house, I'm gonna lure your whole crew. Inside and scare them with the boo. Now they commit and career suicide. I hit them with some floating silverware and flying kitchen knives and pin them on the wall like Michael Myers did when Bobby died. It's the hater killer season with the keepers of the crypt. Yeah, we'll I was ran out of breath right there. there. With the sound from my lips, we'll have a solar eclipse. Every time breath control, these breath lives, control. Hate and best believe we'll leave you behind. Lip, lip, this is the hater killer season with the keepers of the crypt. We'll collapse your empire with the sound yes, from my lips. We'll have a solar eclipse. Every time we spit these rhymes and if you start hating, best believe we'll leave you behind. Welcome, SDL. Death of a hater was my TED talk. That Ruger feeling full of craters was the Red Hawk. With six shots, got him coming with the red choke. Them six out, now they're running with a dead walk. Yeah, I know that they still out there and they plotting shit. And I will not lie, it get a little bit monotonous. But do you want to know the very best way to go stop a hit? Just run up in the living room and straight up pop a bitch. Bloody hit the ceiling, everybody screaming. Fear of God inducing, you don't even know the meaning. Recorded on the stream, it a warning for the masses. Welcome back, Joy. Welcome back the mountain, we are giving you no passes. Classes in session, about to teach a little lesson. Had to prove a fucking point and how to leave a big impression. Don't ever use oppression, let the neighbors hear it spit. It's what they might get if they talking that shit. It's the hater killer season with the keepers of the crypt. We'll collapse your empire with the sound from my lips. We'll have a solar eclipse every time we spit these rhymes. And if you start hating, best believe we'll leave you behind. Cause it's the hater Bring killer the season behind. with the keepers of the crypt. We'll collapse your empire with the sound from my lips. We'll have a solar eclipse every time we spit uh, these rhymes. And if you start I'm waiting to like this incense we'll we'll with a vibe, behind. come on. One of my favorite type of records is Austin and Vibe. This was not a freaking it or whatnot, but uh, Austin, man, you'll know when we get one, when I do light that up. I was preparing it, though. I was like, listen. We need some good vibes on the freaking show. Uh, listen, so very hip-hop centric. One Man Crew often has that sort of sound. He was the first, uh, you know what I'm saying, artist within there. And I've often said he has a very, like, ICP, uh, you know, sort of, you know, sound. Um, ironically, I, I, he has a disc record, <laughs> a disc record to, uh, to ICP. And, you know, for, for personal reasons and situations that happen uh, between, between the two. Um, but you know, his, his style rings true when he gets on, you know what I'm saying? Uh, some of these records and the right beat or whatnot. So it definitely feels proper for that. Um, you know, as for the sort of like chorus, that's where LB sickening is at. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And I think, you know, it's cool. You know what I mean? Like it's sort of one of those things that grow on you over time and you know, you, you become a, a cussing uh, uh, freaking to it. I'm still waiting to get to that freaking point where I'm singing the whole freaking thing along, but it does still, you know, uh, ring in your freaking head. Now, you know, other artists, you know what I'm saying, did a decent job, nothing too crazy. I, I'd feel like, you know, I'd, I liked most of, I think the, the first, you know, verse for me personally. Um, and the mix just needs work, right? It did feel a little bit dry. It felt like, you know what I'm saying, a uh, mixtape record, still a work in progress or whatnot. Not like too, like y'all just recorded it and then put it out immediately and shit like that. But, you know, it still needed a little bit more, you know, reverb and that, that crispness. Like y'all know what I'm talking about. When you hear that sort of record that you feel like, you feel like it's already on the radio right now and shit like that, right? You'll hear just something in 
the way that the vocals freaking hit where it's just like you know you have no complaints you don't hear anything that's too loud anything that's too low everything sort of you know matches well if there are layers they're sort of perfectly panned and you know people are able to uh appreciate just your your approach to the freaking record or whatnot so that's all i'm freaking saying uh but we can still hear and see the potential i still want a music video to this so whenever you get a chance you know go and freaking do that joy said can i uh replay it and stuff like that do we have, do we have a few other running backs in the freaking building do we have a few other running backs in the building and stuff like that part of me wants to like so we don't have a running back you know the freedom about youtube at the very least right uh, is you yourself can simply head there uh, and rewind to uh, the beginning of the playing of the song and then the review or whatnot. So you can catch yourself up, at least on the YouTube side. No other platform that we have does that. I can say that. Uh, TikTok, love you. But you don't. You, nobody can rewind as we're freaking streaming live. Facebook, same thing, give or take, I think. Uh, or am I tripping? Can you? I think you can do it on... PC now I'm, now I gotta freaking double freaking check and shit like that. I think I'm bullshitting on the freaking Facebook freaking one. I know. And now now I'm double checking. <laughs> now I'm trying to figure out. Now wait, does Twitch have anyways? BLG, send your please don't spam in the chat. Send your record to my email. Please do not spam your your uh your submissions in the freaking chat. Like you can only do that if you are paying to have your record played next, pretty much, and and shit like that. Um, outside of that, you must send it to my email in order to get played. Otherwise, you're wasting time. No, but not only is no one going to click the link in the chat, no one's going to care. Like, you need to know, like, what spam is. A, a lot of you guys, if you're still DMing people the moment that they follow you or you follow and then they follow back and shit like that, and you immediately post your link in their DM, you're already doing it freaking wrong. You're still in... A form of, of a frame of mind that literally does not work anytime someone does that to me I literally do not ever go back to the DM again I pretty much you know try to mute the chat so I don't ever have to freaking see it because you can just tell it's it's one of those things they're just gonna post their their link all the freaking time there's gonna be no direct content contact with that person initially uh, and you know it has to be an eye for an eye kind of situation social media has always you know been supposed to work like with real people not fake likes not fake freaking you know comments and and you know all that freaking shit don't try to take the the you know the middle ground and shit like that say hello is there a long line yes there is uh you know what i'm saying but try to be patient if you can let me see so i like youtube uh better but i prefer the chat you know sitting on tiktok you know saying i don't know how we can uh share in like the stream and stuff like that yeah yeah you can continue to do that now you can't do that on youtube too but i don't it doesn't like count the you know, the sort of likes that you freaking do as like a part of the the stream. As, as far as I know, like there's no, this many people like this this many times via that specific button or whatnot. Or it doesn't add to the like, you know, on the exact post and stream and stuff like that, which it should, by the way. I think they should implement that. Music reviews, you know what I'm saying, bio. So, yes, sir, yes, sir, thank you. Um, let, me, let me pin that real freaking quick. And would you say I got some hits for you? That's what's up. We already know. We already know. Let me see. Then you're on early. Of course. Of course, man. Listen, I honestly try my best to start, if I can, around like 420. It's, yeah, rarely happens uh, sometimes. But when I can, you know, I, I, I love it because we get to get you guys, you know what I'm saying, in a, lot, a lot freaking earlier. More of the people who, you know, might have not been, been able to pop up will. Uh, and then, you know, I do want to get back to doing the morning streams as well. I used to start at like 930 in the morning stream for like a few hours and then, you know, come back freaking later on. Uh, so I'd have like two different uh, sort of like shifts. And so we will try to get back to that because I miss playing the morning, the morning records and shit. Let's see where we are at so we can get back in the free line. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep and I'm yawning, waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie, gnawing on a Nazi, probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you've been warned. My brain is sore, it's like a unicorn. All right, let me see. Rain Lucy, you are up next. Let's go ahead and get you up. Right about now, every funk show, bro, 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 bro. You sent a YouTube link. Let's see. What up, Mugs? Joy. 
people from Bitcoin are like a black plague. <laughs> Vegan Joy was in. Listen. I didn't say it. Cause this is Rain Lucy. I don't know if this is an actual music video, but oh shit, a lyric video, okay. Being fucked up with nonsense, lost in the sickness like a maze. Trapped by the pain in the past that remains. In my mind, like a flame, feel so locked by these chains that weigh on my soul. Every day I'm so fucked up, no, I fucked up. Hope you hold on, hope one day I have some shit to fuck a show for. Lately, it's been a challenge for me to go on. My imagination runs cold and it feels so wrong. I'm gone, don't fear, be with you still. Don't worry, I'll be alright. That beat breakdown was dope. About this, how you feel about that? How you feel about how you pick a song? How we rap? There's a lot of time when I freaking go up in the back. People know I don't even know if I'm a freaking flow up on the crap, but a lot of time when I freaking tell you freaking there's a lot of thing when I want to pick a song like a vibe. Yeah, so far, no dork, you don't play that. You know what I'm saying? Happy about freaking that. You know what I mean? If we can get at least 10 songs in without hitting that button, you know what I mean? Uh, it's a good day. It's a good day. Um, but this one right here. So there's vibe. There's a vibe there with the overall, you know, just aura of the, you know, saying track. The, you know, the tempo, the sort of, you know, production within there. How you're singing, the effects that you're using. Um, definitely something I, uh, you know, if you didn't make any kind of video to it, I would have said to do such a freaking thing, right? It is short though, of course. I know a lot of you guys tend to make these, you know, shorter records from time to time. But let me remind you guys about something, right? 100% people's attention spans are not low or whatever you guys freaking say and shit like that. Like you, you said, people, people's attention spans are very short. So you make the shorter records, you know, so they can get that replay value and shit like that. Like the way I look at it is like I look at the shorter songs as a waste of time because I'm like, why would I want to play the same one verse and chorus again just to hear the same exact thing when I could hear possibly or potentially two or three verses from the same artist or features that they decide to get on it. And they do the job as an artist to have maybe a little bit more energy on the second verse or like just switch it up melodically and all that different stuff. Like more time gives you the ability to show people what you can do. It's always about trying to impress on the record. Do you have vocals or not? Do you, are, you, are you good at writing or, you know what I'm saying, freestyling, whatever the thing is. It's about staying in people's minds for the for as much time as you can. And like literally think about this as like if, if this whole show was everybody performing and then after they perform, they just get off stage and then we move the next artist freaking up and shit like that. Literally, you would be forgotten about in the next three or four freaking songs because you only had, you know, a certain amount of thing. You got in there, you did one verse, you, did, you really didn't give enough for people to maybe be like super impressed. Like, damn, I need to hear, you know, the whole album and shit like that. Now, it did have a freaking vibe though. I do feel like it has potential. Um, and, um, you know, again, for me, I just want, you know, maybe another verse, maybe a feature or something like that. Get a get a dope, you know, rapper on there, at least for a remix, right? You guys can do whatever you want with your main song. Remixes are where you can throw all those extra ideas and see what actually works uh, a little bit freaking better and uh, stuff like that. Let me see. What did you guys freaking think? What did you say? He said, why am I not uh, blue and stuff like that? What does that even, what does that mean? Why am I not blue? Why are you? Because you're alive, man. You know what I'm saying? You only turn blue when, when, you're, when you're dead, when you're dead. 
and your body turns cold. Uh, let me see. Mugs, uh, mother's head. Uh, beat because people nowadays, you know what I'm saying, have two minutes, you know what I'm saying. It's a, nope, they don't. They don't. They do not. They don't. Stop freaking saying that. I want you guys to literally get that out of your freaking head right now. Because you know for a fact, we've had six minute records on the show that we've ran back. Literally, whole chat. Tens across the boards and shit like that. Nobody looking at their watch and shit like that. It's up to the artist. You guys have all the power in the world. If you don't do the job, that's your that's your fault. You know what I mean? Like you are the one who are, who's making the excuse to like not have enough energy or lyrics to actually go through with the entire freaking you know record and shit like that. I'm, I'm I, again. I just want I want to call that freaking out because I've heard it so freaking much, and I'm like I never have that short attention span. And, I, and people that I, that I rock with, like, they don't have that same figure, that thing either. And we've had many records where no one's talked about the time. It's been a little bit of a long record, but it was a dope-ass performance all the way through. And we got through it. They did the job. That's what, I, that's what I freaking mean when I say doing the job. Like, you know what the, you hear the beat, you're like, yo, I got to rip this shit. I got to make sure that people listen all the way. Uh, maybe I'll do, you know what I'm saying, this on the first verse have this kind of chorus i'll have a second verse where i do this over here then i'll throw i'll go i'll go into a bridge back into the chorus maybe a third like you know what i'm saying just figure it out figure it out choose the right beats and it's okay to have an intro an outro an interlude or two you know those are the things that are i think okay to be you know what i'm saying freaking short but you know, I just want y'all to get in there and and you know what I'm saying? Like that's that's what we want to pay for. We want to pay for the artists that feel like, you know, like we're worth your actual freaking time and vice versa. And we see he's had freestyle whole songs, you know what I'm saying? One take that don't even sound like, you know what I'm saying, freestyles and we're three minutes long and stuff like that. Hey, and if you can do it, man, that, that's what I'm saying. Uh Cash App, uh, you uh got six minutes long. Hey, there we go. Let's test this, test it out. Let's test it out, man. You got balls right now. You got balls. Let's see. Isolated. There. Oh, let's go. Let's freaking go. We finna roll. We finna roll right up in it. Immediately. And look, one last thing, one last thing, because I, I usually freaking throw this in there too. It, it, add, it adds right up freaking along with it. Pretty much, if you are an artist who basically has no energy, you're very boring on the freaking track, you're repeating the same thing over and over. If you make that type of music where, again, it's very repetitive and people, of course, people are gonna get bored with that for three or four freaking minutes. But if you are, like I said, that is not doing the job. That's just you giving a demonstration of what you can do. Oh, you know, this beat was kind of cool. I liked it a little bit. Spit a little something, something, and then you put it out. That was That's about it. But it's not a classic record kind of situation. You know, I don't know many, many records that I've liked to that extent that have been, you know, that short and that I've appreciated in that same way. So I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep, you know, promoting, um, you know, the... At least my way of thinking for, you know, however long that I freaking can to r remind y'all that not everybody freaking thinks like that. I'm telling you, it's, it's all about the actual song and what y'all do. All right. Uh, by the way, on that last one, we had a 9 out of 10 from STL. We had a 9. S, uh, 7 out of freaking 10 from Xavier. Feels like I'm listening to a ghost for real. Yo. That's funny. Appreciate it. Hold on, did we just throw the, <laughs> what, did, what even just happened right now? Oh, I just went back in the same, my bad, my bad. Hold on. I got it, I got it. Yeah, there we go. I got it. It was, no, wait, you sent a, P okay, there it goes, man. What the freak? What was the PDF of? CC uh, two codes and stuff like that, I guess. Uh, okay, country club. First tournament as a professional. Here we go. All right, man. Beat dope so far. Yeah. Made it through the winter, hibernated when I'm on vacation on an island saying no 
that I got tired waiting, looking for a sign, and then I isolated. Focused on myself, I'm trying to reach my full potential Face my fears with how I dealt, how I came up with two dollars How I trained and got my belt, how I'm about to make a run I'm lapping everyone around, I might have to fuck a bitch She might come up on my couch, roll another blunt When I get distracted, I'm aroused It's a problem with a big titty mama, Benny Hanna Why we chilling in the sauna, full with barbie, not a noun I think I'm going crazy, know the dame, the golden navy out in India Made a fortune, need a portion, pay me by my girl a Porsche. She hate me in my room, record the daily out in full force. You need a court to go and cause me. Maybe, maybe I was wrong and I ain't never wrong. Flying to my heaven, got the level on. Trying to keep my head straight, heard the devil yawn. Hall of Fame player, I'm the better one. Yeah. Made it through the winter, hibernated when I'm on vacation on the island. Saying, know that I got tired, waiting, looking for a sign. Like the style, Yo. Listen, they didn't know your mom owed me $37. You homies with Crespo probably or Crespa. I heard your name is Evan or Connor or Trevor or Devin or Donnie. I already <laughs> forgot it. I got two tweakers with machetes and shotguns and pot shrub. Bumping okay. Fuji's ready or not in the bed of your father's truck Ready to squeeze when he pops up My sugar mama grows medical reefer products Doggy, have a drug fiend that's meth and fall Bust in your freaking window I might put fentanyl in Hus Kingpin's coke You what up, Emma? are Belgrade at all That's treasonous, bro You gotta be tweaking off dope Silver bow, these shitty Bozeman rappers There's, a few, feet, there's a few people on here me approach Made it through the winter, hibernated when I'm on vacation on the island saying know that I got tired waiting, looking for a sign and then I isolated Wise like King Solomon, I'm leading who you're following Fake thugs, they hollering, but really they be posturing Don't fit in boxes, kids, so I just do the opposite Claim you ain't astonished, then your brain is lacking oxygen A true artisan, kill these crews and squads of men Dominant, so confident, I'm toxic when I chop the pen Stand proudly, no foes standing around me Hoes be getting rowdy, they marvel at me like Robert Downey The most destructive, acting wild out in public My meals come by the dozen, all your chicks look like some Muppets I never lack ability, crushing all hostility Blessed like the nativity, the illest in this industry I'm aiming for the title, taking names and trash and rivals Versus remaining vital like the pages in the Bible Spitting tracks of fire, every stage we get it lava We ripping cash with cyphers in this game of might survival Made it through the winter, hibernated when I'm on vacation on the island Saying know that I got tired, waiting, looking for a sign And then I isolated I'm a fixture cause I kick words like scriptures Attract the stripper, relax in the back with them Might be Asian, Latina, white or black women Guaranteed I'm in, hustle look like Larry Flint Magazine, long as the money green Too focused for the funny things And I don't mean comedians Telling tall tales, not believing them Son of niggas might as well be conceiving them All my dogs golden, none of them retrievers Pop up often with Will and JD Red man, the Wu Tang is Mike to the Blickies. Plus, West Rocco, the weapon y'all don't know. But we bout to blow like McVeigh in Oklahoma. Bear witness to the game's implosion. Free curb stop, fuck Bozeman. This is coming from a known goat. Modella with the fraud told, then I wrote a quote. They a joke, can't wait to tell it. Like enough to catch a contact when you smell it. Through the winter, hibernated when I'm on vacation on the island. Saying, know that I got tired, waiting, looking for a sign, and then I isolated. I like that chill chorus. It's the bone battle, me the medicine. I'm in ISO, ball in my court, so I might go, might go. Flying over lines, put your boy on a sneaker. Fitting all coming out your speaker. Spit that shit to turn a bitch to a sheikah. The hottest who the missile seeker. If you stay down with me, fly us out to Mozambique. We done came a long way from skipping rocks. Is the writer or Lord who? Soaking in the motherland to feel the sand is so surreal. Off that candy rain, I'm so for real. Live a legal kid, get your money, fuck a pig, no deliverance. Deliver me from all the wicked shit a nigga did to make sure the baby straight. Fuck fighting for scrapes. I wake up every day out my window, a lobby on GTA. It's gotta be another way till they find they gotta isolate.
and that's it A lot of times freaking the other rappers are freaking fake like some plastic Matter of fact, if you freaking don't fuck with your girl the right way She'll freaking fuck you over and maybe just get a glass dick And I don't even know what to do a lot of freaking times, a lot of rappers freaking never go into school, which is why they don't know if they cool freaking or not. You freaking think that you hot freaking a lot of people and stop listening to y'all. First of all, <laughs> not bad, my brother. Where is the? There we go. We did I know I gotta get it poppin', gun shopping, the end is getting real close. Police killing kids, the streets is no joke. I just jump up in freaking slow motion and stuff like that. All right, so let me tell you these the exceptions of, you know, when it comes to, we, we just got out of the whole, you know, long record kind of conversation, right? Which is what prompted him to say in freaking that, right? The exception for a lot of people will be, of course, if you do have a cipher, right? The ciphers, you know, with many artists, there's a, an actual reason to have, you know, those kind of situations, right? And, you know, depending on the beat or whatnot, like, that's going to be the the thing that, um, you know, will either keep people, li like, depending on the beat and each artist, right? Because, again, each artist still has to do their job. Like, when you add more artists, now you're in that situation where, you know, who's the weakest link, if anything, um... And if there are too many weakest links, like people don't even get to the end of the, the, you know, the cipher kind of situation, right? So often, like, remind you guys, like, look, you guys always have to remember you are, you are Avengers, right? You, you are the equivalent of hip hop or R and B, like, depending on what genre you guys are in, hip hops, uh, R and B, rocks, uh, Avengers. Every single member has to come with it. One person's basically Iron Man, another person's like Hulk, another person's. Uh, uh, you know, uh, maybe a Black Panther, you know what I'm saying, somewhere in there, a Thor. Like, y'all know, y'all know what I'm freaking talking about, right? And that's what helps you sort of, like, get to the end. Now, this one was a very sort of chill, dope kind of freaking, like, hip-hop thing. Not anything crazy in terms of the energy. I also kind of wanted the mix to be a little bit better in terms of the the main track being able to be, you know, cut up a little bit freaking more or whatnot. And in terms of that main master... Uh, second artist, I think, uh, had, you know, people fluctuating a little bit just because of his kind of or unorthodox, uh, very lyricism, almost poetry fest kind of like based performance. But like, I rocked with it. You know what I'm saying? Like I was trying to fit. I'm like, OK, like it's one of those things where it is an acquired taste. But and I was wondering, like, how do you when you rap, when you have a style like that, how do you even choose where to land on the beat right because sometimes you're not it's not a syllable game with that you're sort of getting in with a, a different section of the freaking beat and going in there and then you're still landing on some of the places with some of the things that you need to rhyme but then in other places it'll feel like you might be going too slow for a second then you'll actually you know what i'm saying still be freaking on and and again i, fi I find that still is going to be harder for certain people to sort of like want to repeat that sort of whole verse and like you know they're tr they're reciting your song but um i think everything else that i that i heard was you know sent on point you guys all freaking killed it did your thing we had different styles a video would be nice to sort of um you know see all of you guys that you know whether it's a together or you guys are in different locations and you make like different themes for each sort of like artist it would be nice um, and then if anybody sort of has, you know, a problem and they did possibly or potentially get bored, uh, one way to circumvent that is with each artist, change up the beat a little bit too. add maybe a different kind of drum pattern for one of them or, you know, some different melodies or a different sample that comes in and, you know, just really play around as, as much as you freaking can to sort of get it in there. But I rocked with it. Not freaking bad. And, uh, you know, let's see what the freaking people freaking thought within. You see me, me, Catwoman, freaking uh, Joy was freaking saying, and you, I'm, I'm Deadpool, Deadpool, uh, uh, for show, for show, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let me see. You said you get my 15 on PayPal. You said they skip. I got you. Give me a sec. Give me just a moment. Um, and he said we are people, green, purple, white, mixed up, blue, and shit like that. Hold on. I don't know what the emojis mugs was freaking put in the chat. Outside, me wanting to turn up a little. Oh yeah, that was that was. Oh yeah, that's what I was saying. Okay, so Mugs had said mix sounds clean. 
uh, sliding uh, nice, uh, Joy was saying. Uh, Joy with the uh, super chill from uh, Jason Miles over there. Um, let me see, cool like me. Uh, Joy was saying, uh, let me see, hey yo, uh, guys, what's up? You came back, I see you. Facts from freaking Jason, uh, MO. What's good? Hold on, let me go over here to the band. I would hit up TikTok in just a more, just a moment. Band Lab, Nanu, Nunu Gang, remember to send, remember to send your submission to my email. That's that dorky review show at gmail.com. I ain't got no, uh, hold on, let's go over here. Excuse me, mister, do you like eating beans and sandwiches? Uh, yes. Yay! Um, I'm gonna tell all of my friends and then meet you. Um, at, uh, uh, and all my friends, we're gonna eat all of the sandwiches, aren't we? I know diamond. Oops, wrong skip. Hiya! I just need you to. Aren't we? Can you please just go? We all need you so. Appreciate y'all for the Appreciate y'all for the scores and the gifts Matter of fact, everybody They be roll with this shit Matter of fact, everybody in the Door with a tit Alright, let me pop this in here My friend My friend, my friend uh, what is this one for? You just said keep it the vibe. Jason Miles, let me go get you on in. See where you are at. All right, gotcha. First of the two is Blame. Blame by Jason Miles. Write this one in the chat. One to ten, everybody. Appreciate y'all. Hold on. LOL. Who does that was speaking saying? You never, man. Nicky, man. You think you get funny? You think. You can't get the funny. You want to laugh at my little baby, huh? Okay. I see. Here we go. No, we ain't on yet. All I want to know is like, do y'all like this song? Yes. No, freaking maybe so. People want to be like, there's a lot of times where I cry because I stumped my baby toe. If I came running back, would you open arms with an open door? Would you accept the man I am or would you change it all? I'm fighting fire with faith, self-igniting the flames. I'm watching burn because I like the way I feel the pain. When I come my mind, I'm already gone. I need one more drink and a sad song. I'm not alone, I'm afraid that one day you'll see the same in my eyes. When I die, I'll be the person you'll blame my mind, I'm already gone I'm afraid I'll be the person you'll blame <laughs> Don't let me down Hold me tight and don't let go Wait, not exactly now To escape my pain, this world was a man for me. Yeah, but you will rise, you will fight, you will never burn. You will learn all the lessons I could never learn. You were stronger than I could ever be, and I don't want to see you waste away. You're nothing like me. Game parts had to be hard, man. Run. 
everybody jumping up and down is a let it time when you freaking sing a song wonder how that fucking fucking sounds is a let it time when i always want to freaking stay because i'm always stuck around to the freaking moment everybody wants to freaking ask me if i'm even My going for a freaking in the place no. when i freaking think i win the race and i got it <laughs> i didn't know he was gonna stop damn you You're scared and you don't wanna stay. I left you here to escape my pain. You hear the crisp? You hear the crispness in the vocals? That's what I want people to pay attention to. And when I call my mind, I'm already gone. I need one more drink and a sad song. And he said it's it's unmixed. So he's like halfway there still. I'll be the person you'll tell me. Okay, uh, y'all just know that gets the, that, that's the part, whole crowd, they get hyped. Yeah! You son of a- Hold on, let me, uh, let me play the, of course, let me go to the, where's my, uh, there we go. So, big salute, did your thing on that for freaking sure, man. Anytime I'm listening to like a rock record, heavy metal, death metal, you know, alternative, like the whole genre, you know, all you guys ever need to do is just really, you know, have that feeling of, you know, that battle of the bands, that sort of, you know, and it, you guys have way more freedom than anybody. Understand this. This is why, you know, it, it, it's dope. Cause you could you could make a song that sounds like something that came in came out in the 1920s and people would still rock with it. You know what I mean? And you could take an 80s song in that very 80s The Cure sort of freaking you know style and then upgrade it to sound like a heavy metal kind of record and do do things like that and it'll always work. Um, you know, obviously with the vocalists of any of these situations, they need to be able to you know sing and hold some freaking notes, and then when it comes to the screamo parts, that is often one of the hardest freaking things. Not everybody has the ability to get in there, you know, often scratches your vocal, you know what I'm saying, freaking chord, you gotta sort of like almost train yourself to a certain extent, right? Um, and, you know, my gosh, man, I almost wish Diesel Water was in the building so he could, you know, uh, kind of go, go under your wing a little bit or whatnot. He, from time to time, will try to make a heavy metal kind of freaking record and we'll try those you know screamo kind of parts but it just never works he doesn't know how to get the mixes there and um you know what i'm saying if ever if he if he pops up man i definitely recommend him uh, uh to you and stuff like that now it is just freaking you so i did think about that as i was listening i was like yo if this is just him how is he going to if, if he goes up just by himself how will he perform because he sings at the same time as the freaking screamo part is, is going off too, right? So how is he going to go from that and that, you know, at, unless he gets other, you know, like you are going to have to kind of tour with the band so we can like 
you know, get the live performance with the instruments and stuff like that, have backup, you know, singers and stuff like that, and somebody there to sort of like do that part while you sing the the things and stuff like that. Just let me know. Um, let me say, first time I've seen a song, you know what I'm saying, added to uh, this playlist or whatnot. Now, we have, we got plenty of freaking within there and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying, both on the, uh, 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 within the YouTube uh, section, um, and I have, you know, a whole playlist in the uh, MP3s and stuff like that. I don't know how many we have on the SoundCloud uh, side. Spotify, I know we need to, you know, uh, rank that up uh, a little bit freaking more or whatnot, but in terms of, you know, we do have... We do have uh, the uh, the rock ones, and you know, all y'all gotta do is is send them in. I always love when y'all when y'all are but but brave to do such a freaking thing. But yeah, I like this one. I agree. Somebody had said something about the uh, like a Lincoln Park kind of freaking sound, right? Was that STL? Let me see. Let me see. Because uh, I agree, it reminded me of like you know a little bit, little bit uh. Little bit Lincoln Park, little bit um thinking of trying to think of maybe like System of a Down, just just a tad. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like there's a few bands freaking in there, influence wise. I'm trying to see who freaking said it, I forgot. My bad, but you have your wise man, we love you. We love you, we love you. Let me stop it. Uh what did you say, Daisy? You said I grew up on Lincoln Park so heavily influenced and stuff like that man so how did you feel about the death you know what i'm saying like did that did that affect you in any way you know what i'm saying did you didn't do you know the, you definitely got to possibly do some kind of covers or like homage and stuff like that lincoln park was was you know definitely freaking huge especially when they had uh first freaking came out um you know really mixing that metal sound with hip-hop and doing something like new that that you know really you know of, of course you know there's lots of different you know rocks and, and bands out there but it, it just felt like something something new yet uh familiar that you know we hadn't heard in a while um and i appreciated figuring that oh when he said that's my first metal song my brother <laughs> Bugs Money said, making my throat hurt just listening, right? You know what I'm saying? He said, I like the chorus, vocal switch-ups. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm saying. Joy with the fire emojis in there as well. They're still unmixed or whatnot. And see, like, that, so I did, I did want to at least bring that up, right? The fact that it is, uh, you know, unmixed and we still were able to see the full potential or whatnot. Like, you do have some clarity in your vocals and you know if you can fresh it up even even more then i know it's going to be crazy you know what i'm saying once it's like fully freaking done or whatnot because that was still a great uh you know example of what the song uh will turn out to freaking be coc is head orky this have g gab you know what i'm saying is for you what you talking about uh lincoln park is dope agreed um we got one more song from him let me see jason Miles with Big Bad Mess. Now this one is on Spotify, so I can't put it in the chat. Become all the people you hate. You did it all on your own, but this was not a mistake. You made a few wrong turns, so I started with fate. You don't get what's coming to you. I watched you break down when I was calling you out. I'm so sick of the bullshit that comes out of your mouth. You try manipulate and cry like I won't figure it out. You don't get what's coming. I want to you, God, 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 yeah. Driving to work like a big damn hole in my favorite shirt Like a four-wheel drive getting stuck in the dirt You're just a big bad mess and you're really not worth the time I spend putting up with the hurt You're like a three-course meal but without the dessert You're like an angel and a demon hooking up in a church You're just a big bad mess and you're really not worth that The big bad wolf Out of fact, I am picking up this big bad stuff Up on the floor to that freaking drop But a lot of times thinking you will never open your mouth you really don't like the freaking talk bad. Got no legs so you don't like the freaking walk And a lot of freaking dogs when they don't like the freaking walk
know this was not a mistake He made a few wrong turns, so I sided with fate yeah. You'll get what's coming I want to you me. gone, gone, gone Driving to work like a big damn hole in my favorite shirt Like a four-wheel drive getting stuck in the dirt You're just a big bad mess and you're really not worth the time I spend putting up with the hurt You're like a three-course meal but without the dessert You're like an angel and a demon hooking up in a church You're just a big bad mess and you're really not worth Shit, man, you remember, you remembered and shit like that. And it, that, so again, it there's still a different kind of vibe that I that I look for. Like for when I when I talk about the vibes for the incense, right? It's usually it's usually like something lo-fi, something you know, Erica Badu, Common, J Cole, Tribe Called Quest esque. You know, uh, there is an ability to to get in there via all different genres or whatnot. Um, but this one is more upbeat. It doesn't have, if it was a little bit slower, it might sort of like fit that sort of like criteria, but it was still dope nonetheless. Like I agree with the 10, uh, freaking out of 10, you know what I'm saying? Everything sounded, you know, crisp. It's there. It's on Spotify. I appreciate you getting that work done before freaking uploading it there. Um, you know, it felt like it, it's on the radio right now. And if it's not, do what you got to freaking do. I mean, we go through this conversation almost all the time, man. Do what you have to do to try to get the records sync license because there are so many of you guys that have hits right now and you guys love to continue to make records now what's funny is like you know if you guys had a label depending on on, on the label they sort of like have their artists work a little bit freaking different and stuff like that even if you work on tons and tons of freaking songs they're only going to let you release, you know, a certain freaking, you know, out like, you know, you're you're obligated uh, uh, contractually to, you know, release a, a certain type of freaking thing. But you have to do it in a certain way. Um, and then they'll put that money into sort of making sure it's on, you know, certain movies or whatever and then yada, yada, yada. But you guys can still uh, access some of the. Uh, music supervisors, the um, the sync license, uh, you know, websites and and stuff like that. Some of some of them are paid, some of them are free. I would recommend all of them because each one sort of you know has a different sort of like process for what they do. Um, I'd say the best ones are the ones that you can actually see the opportunities and then shoot your shot, you know, like that. Uh, Song Trader is uh, one of those. It's uh, Song T R A D r.com i think you know what i'm saying y'all can google it or freaking some shit like that now they have both a free and a pro sort of like uh thing or whatnot because they'll have like a certain amount of um like credits that you'll get each time you want to submit your music towards like a certain you know uh, uh sync license kind of freaking thing sometimes it'll be a you know a, a mixtape or a compilation other times it might be an actual you know commercial a movie, a documentary, you know what I'm saying, different things like that, but you can see all of that and what they need, what they're looking for. They'll even give you an example of, you know, a, a type of record that they might, you know, look for. So for a lot of you guys who do like sounding like other, you know, people, or at least, you know, want to get some inspiration for the songs to try to make and then input those, you know what I'm saying? Do what y'all gotta do. But I definitely think that could uh, be on, uh, you know, everything. Let me see, J. Ryan, you said, can I send you a YouTube link? Yes, you can. Uh, any of them are freaking fine, but I prefer... No, but yeah, yeah, any of them are fine, though. Any of them are fine. 
Um, eh. Wave is like, uh, I could kind of sometimes care. This because it takes like a little bit to freaking download or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? MP3 is just freaking fine uh, out of the freaking two of those. YouTube is fine. And I think often better, especially if it's not a private link, because then I can, you know, give people the actual link to the record if they like it. Right. So, for instance, the one that we just heard right now, I am going to post it in the chat. I just posted it on BandLab right now, and I'm going to post it over here on the YouTube, Twitch, Facebook, and Twitter sides. Over here, of course, on TikTok, you guys can only sort of like read the text because TikTok, we love you, but you need to add more features and allow us to at least try, right? Uh, but yeah, no, I know I think I had said it a little bit freaking earlier, right? Could I pin that again, right? Let me do that. Oh, I love I love that. I love that I can at least pin the thing again and then go there. Xavier was like, I'm so sorry. No, not yet. Uh, it's all freaking good. It's all good. Thank you for the apology. You didn't even need to do that. You know what I'm saying? But you know, you know, we know, we know how it did, though. We know how it did. He said, so you saying you need me. Uh, so you saying you need me to uh, submit and something like that. Uh, what are we talking about? What are, what, are we, what are we talking about right there? Um, let me see. Low and slow. Yes. Out to Empress Rain. Back in the freaking cusp. Empress Rain. That's what I'm saying. It's a vibe. It's a great song from freaking Theo Mackey. Theo Mackey in the building, y'all. Oh, shit. <laughs> Demazio. <laughs> Let me freaking go over freaking here. Mugs, what's freaking good? Jay Ryan. We, okay, so we already freaking I said that. Jason Miles, you know what I'm saying? He said the yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? Was thanking y'all for the feedback, of course, man. Mugs Money. You said this is a radio hit all day, uh, every day. You know what I'm saying? Mugs uh, speaks, you know what I'm saying? Definitely needs a video, man. Yeah, that's it. I didn't even say nothing about the video. We was over there with everything else, but freaking that, man. But I agree. I agree 100%. <laughs> It's a me. It's a me. All right, let's go. Uh, we're good, right? We don't have another freaking skip, so we can get back in the free line, right? Let me see. Yes, sir. But just in case. Yo, nonsense and sir, Mike. This song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like. I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you where actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit. I'm thinking you were high. Like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view. When I'm cool, better act like you surprised. Head to McDonald's. I'm about to steal your fries. Standing out. Uh, let me see. You asked if I have a chime too. I believe the chime should be that dorky review show. Dollar sign that dorky review show. That's the only one that, that's like that's like that. My cash app though is pay a dork and stuff like that. You should you should uh, you should be able to find it under under that though. And let me know if and when you uh, send it, and we'll make sure we throw it. Uh, right in and stuff like that. Other uh, than that, we're gonna jump back in the free line for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure that the kids would be happy about that. <laughs> all right, all right. Please send your records to that dorky review show at gmail.com or get ready to die. Ha 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 ha. Oh, let's share the stream. <laughs> Mr. Muggs freaking money. We got you. Then I'm gonna hit a uh about to be freaking skip a little later in the stream. That's what's up. Muggs money with the villain freestyle. Y'all know, y'all know, y'all know, y'all know, y'all know, y'all. Y'all already know. Fuck it, man. Just gonna let this beat ride. You sound tired, bro. I'm down to ride for my A1 since day one. Please say something. Squeeze and pray in Jesus' name. I came from nothing. Self made, health decayed, and the past decayed. A lot has changed. Went from barely just surviving to thriving. Now I'm buying things. I do what I want, I say what I do. Motherfucking boss, bitch, you were you. Telling me the same old bullshit. It's like deja vu. When you wanna tell people hating on you. 
lot of moms waiting on you, nobody. They don't care about you, it's rare if you even found a few. It's rare. Homies on your group, down the clown and pull a move. Don't talk about a be about a bitch, show and prove. I'll go and get the tools, explain to you what I'm about to do. Uh oh, leave you laying in pain at the hospital in the ICU. So you better pray in Jesus' name that I don't see you. Man, I keep on having crazy thoughts, I think I'm evil. <laughs> Don't let this fool jump to see you. Don't let I will beat you to the brink of death and then just leave you. Cause I don't give a fuck about anybody else besides my people. Nah, life isn't like a movie, you don't get a sequel. Nah, I eat these rappers like crackers, I've yet to meet my equal. Nah, I don't trust in people cause they just straight up deceitful. I gotta check, is it that it time where now that rappers wanna come Freaking to my brother ever freaking out, but they never not respect Sometimes I don't even know what the hell I'm a freaking do But everybody freaking it another better What did y'all freaking think about that rap day? I gotta check, that might not be my freaking thing Or at least, Lil Chuck said he doesn't want You don't have a uh, PayPal? You don't have a uh, PayPal and stuff like that. If not, I'll, f I'll figure. Uh, I'll figure it out in a second. I might have to um, to pause the TikTok in order to freaking do it though, because I have it on on that phone. Um, but this right freaking here, in terms of what we heard from Mugs Money Man, you know what I'm saying? I thought that you know the energy needed to come up just a little bit or whatnot. But at the same time, it like the the same feeling I had about. There was a record that um, uh, uh, Miss Luck had freaking sent in of yours, um, I think, yesterday. Um, and both of these records have that same vibe where it's like it's a darker kind of freaking beat. Uh, something that, you know, would benefit from a more hyper, I think, aggressive kind of flow. But I also get the low energy kind of style that you're using on it, too, because it's more of a like it's more of like a you like like as someone's just walking down the street but they can feel eyes looking at them. You know what I'm saying? And with evil intent, they don't know who or what or where they at. But that's the vibe that, that I get from that sort of energy. You're not trying to freaking call attention to yourself per se, but it's freaking there. But I also think it will affect how people freaking hear the song, right? Like if you, more people, they hear something like that, they do want to get a little bit, bit hype, want to jump up and down and you know what I'm saying, do all that. But if you have a lower energy, it doesn't really allow that as much. The beat will get them halfway freaking there, but your performance has to up the ante. And I kinda, you know, like I would rather have the performance version on the record as opposed to them only doing that performance version when they go and perform the record or whatnot. Cause you know, how do you know people, how do you know if people like this version of the song that they don't want to hear that version when you then go perform freaking live? I do know that when sometimes if you tend to change it a little too much, you know, it could throw people off just a little bit. Uh, he said that was not the time, you know what I'm saying? I'll figure it out. Give me a moment. The Cash App though, uh yeah the cash app i can put that in a freaking chat let me uh give me a moment to check out the uh the the chime freaking thing just one second i'm gonna pause the stream on freaking tiktok do not leave stay your ad right now you guys see okay so let me go over here and i will let you know seriously don't tell me how to take this I have to take that out just to get in there. All right. Let me go to my settings. And everybody go the bin. All right, let me do this. When I when I put that when I go look literally it's that uh, dollar sign uh, that don't get review show or whatnot literally and and the thing it says that your tag to help people find boost your thing blah 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 so I don't know what else needs to pop up 
But it is under that. Outside of that, you know what I'm saying? Hit the Cash App, hit the PayPal. Or you can go over to the YouTube side. You can hit the Super Chat in the uh, the freaking chat over there. That is your other, uh, you know what I'm saying, option. Other than that, once again, just to make sure we don't have another freaking skip in there from anybody. Thank you. And now we proceed. See Fresh, let's go ahead and get you on in. You sent demon. Demons again. Pay at Dork is the pay the uh, the cash app. A Dorky review show, but dollar sign Dorky review show should be the other one. Um. And though is there a way to share? Is there a way to? Let me actually see. Is there a way to like request it, maybe? I'm a really trapped. The life that I'm living ain't great. Early doors in the morning, down to work. I'm stuck on the grind till late. I'm a stuck. Is it fate? No rest, stop, break. Demons talk in my ear, room for the silence of voices, keep me awake. Will it change? Will I change? Will the demons take me away? I carry the weight on my shoulders, the weight of boulders, I take it day by day. Listen up close when the demons speak. Got a plot twist, the demons me, plant thoughts in your head. Demon seed, keep it shh when the demons creep. I've got some work for the idle hands. What do you want? How bad do you need it? Want fast money straight into the bank, I need it now, but I've got a bad feeling. So much money won't fit in a band, never had that much, so you know it's a peen. I'm talking stacked to the hundred. Grand, are you talking money that's stacked to the ceiling? Yes. Yes, yes, yes Will you take this off or the choice is yours? I never had much money in the bank Struggling in life, I grew up poor Just tell me, yes, you'll be dripping in sauce To find the things, the whips, the whores The diamond what rings, the chains and all Simple, yes, you can take it all I'm a really trapped the life that I'm living ain't great Early doors in the morning, down to work I'm stuck on the grind till late I'm a stuck, is it fate? No rest, stop, break Demons talk in my ear Room for the silence of voices, keep me awake Will it change? Will I change? Will the demons take me away? I carry the weight on my shoulders The weight of boulders, I take it day by day Listen up close when the demons speak Got a plot twist, the demons me Plant thoughts in your head, demon seed Keep it shh when the demons creep For a simple yes, I would take it There's one thing left that you still gotta do I know that money ain't free, so Tell me the job that I still gotta do Don't really know how to break it Let the demons in and it's basic Money's so close you can taste it Can't stop now, can't rage quit Now I've let them in and I'm feeling new Got lost thoughts and I'm feeling blue Is it really me? I'm another you Feel the pain within and it's coming through Did it take me into my money crew? Demon time now I'm splitting two Miss the old me, I miss old you Can't feed a demon with soul food uh. Listen Can't feed a demon with soul food down you freaking meat Bacon and some greens and freaking cheese <laughs> All the freaking people they be sleeping on rappers who ain't even really sleeping. All the freaking time I don't even know what the point of freaking man. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ah, uh, good job, good job, good job. Freaking overall, man. You know what I'm saying? UK freaking drill, man. Like honestly, with with certain genres, right? We end up talking about this. With certain genres, all they really require to be dope within is to adhere to the standard of a certain way of you know rapping, flowing, singing to the situation. Uh, I always look at reggaeton, Afro beat. Uh, drill, you know what I'm saying, as kind of freaking one of those. Like they don't, they don't knock the artists for, you know, not being completely original on a drill record kind of situation, right? You know what I'm saying? You're not, you're not looking because it just feels like there are, there's a certain just way to get in there. There's maybe like three or four different styles, right? Because UK, you know what I'm saying, has one. I've heard like you know LA sort of like drill and different things, you know what I'm saying, from all over that uh, have different sort of, um, you know, styles and approaches within it, um, you know? But uh, this one was, you know what I'm saying, on point, did his freaking thing, felt like a record that would be out there, mix was freaking cool, didn't have any problem with that. Felt like somebody would also be able to see and hear a video, uh, you know, possibly uh, from. Uh, and so, you know, I do hope to possibly uh, get that in the near future from you you know what i'm saying you do come through bring it send to the show we'll see what's up we'll see what's freaking popping 
Uh, let's go back into the land. Yep, see what you say. Uh, he said, yes, cheese. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, who is this? I put it in the chat in the one in one moment, but I do have the thing right there. See, as fresh, of course. Welcome back. Um, we see Maine, you know what I'm saying? We just have recorded at my freaking house. I'm more laid back in a cynical way and shit like that. And or, no, nah, uh, let me see, because I know what I'm talking about. Just, uh, sit my dear Ryan was freaking saying. Hold on. Let me go back over here. Oh, wait, it was like, okay. Check your email if you have. Yes, sir. Hold on. Hold up real quick. Hold, 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 hold. Oh, look, look, look who it is. Right in the free, right in the free line. Right in the free line. Oh, witty. Oh, witty. All right, here we go. So far, so good, man. Don't let me down. I told her that I'm over saying no more. Emotions overcame Superman. Why I'm saving money, think it's low as lane. Hide in my head space, I saw my eyes to drop a game. You and I are not the same. The loose will eyes is not the game. I remain. Oh, witty. Yeah, that is a proper name. Oh, it stands for obvious. Like, obviously, I'm the brains. Obviously, I'm the range. Obviously, I am father. Where my head at? Obvious strange. Obviously, I'm just property. Who wants to be exchanged? Can't Here we go. What I'm done in vain. Lessons sometimes come with pain. Listen, it might come with lames. Living always come with lanes. I've been living.
right. So uh, that's a good example of what I was what I was talking about freaking earlier. Something with a vibe, you know, that neo soul, very jazzy. Uh, 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 you know, just just you know it when you hear it. Um, and you know, like you can get Devin the Dude on that. You could get J Cole. You can get Kendrick. You could get you know what I'm saying some some really freaking tribe. Some you know that there's there's no shortage of freaking you know things that could happen. Uh, but I liked it. You know what I mean? There's maybe a small effort that could be done in the mix to bring it to a more professional sort of, you know, level. Every, every time I listen to a song, I try to go, you know, does this feel like an official on the album pressed up in stores version of the record? Or does it feel like something that's still being worked on? Maybe something on a mixtape or a demo or something like that. You sort of know when you're hearing it at that full professional level. So it could get on uh, uh, up there just a little bit, but I love the uh, performance. It is a little bit. Let me just check and make sure what the actual um, timing was. Uh, this one. Ooh, full song structure! Three minutes and 12 seconds. I like that. Make a video if you can. When you get that mix, you know, do what you do what you gotta do. I like that though. Don't don't let that fall by the wayside. That's at least how I feel. STL with the fire emojis, freaking of course this fire from Teto. Theo, of course, we can say freaking vibes. See you with that. Appreciate y'all with the uh, likes, any freaking gifts, and the follows, man. You guys are amazing. Um, so far, we have five k freaking likes over here on the uh, TikTok side. Appreciate y'all, man. Listen, we gotta have we gotta have each platform uh, go head to head for the you know the the likes and stuff like that. Though I don't know if there's a way to sort of you know try to compete. Like again, because YouTube has a different thing when it comes to to the likes. They don't they don't allow the same. You know what I mean? Like they'll count it every time you freaking tap. You know what I'm saying? They'll add. They'll start freaking adding that and, and stuff like that. And I'm like, uh, you know, but yeah, if we, if we had a, a more surefire freaking way, that'd be dope. That'd be dope. Let me see. what do you say? This song is okay. What it slides? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Switches are freaking nice. Joy was saying and stuff like that. Girl, you know, I love this stuff. You know, listen, if I had the, th okay. So back in the day, when I, when I was three years old. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep and I'm yawning. Waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me in school. I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie, gnawing on a Nazi, probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you been warned. My brain is so like a huge All right, back in the free line, back in the line, we in the free line, and blah, 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 blah. Xavier, you are now, my friend. You sent two, but of course, we play one, so we play this one. I don't know each other, too. I just grabbed the first one, to be honest. I just feel like the first one is the one you really, you know what? Let me, uh. Oh, shit, hold up. This is Big Hobby Mikey Lord. Big homie, there's a lot of time when I freaking really get lonely. I don't know what the hell I'm. Oh, come on, man. Forget you, bro. I did what I did. I got it. My shot him. I die in these streets by the comma. Oh, mama. Been acting the fool with the ditches. It's Chagumba. My drip coincide with the op. Link way when it comes to a couple of K in the toddler. Popping off shots like it's glitching. The switch manipulated nuts on the shake of Morocco. You better check on your partners. A magazine in them. He broke Madonna. That dollar. Got thoroughbreds licking they choppers with switches and choppers. I drench his pajamas. Blanking on them like the clip from Bahamas. The D got the Grim Reaper checking his nostrils. Yeah. Tasting the drain on his tonsils. Fuck a 12, even Jesus was crossed by apostles. Uh. I'm like the window wiper with the sweeper when elevated. These fuck with me cause I'm melanated. Mm. 30 or 60 gets you levitated. Mm. Sanitized, uninvestigated. Mm. Though the stainless accomplice mm. is separated. Drive by me shot and I dip. Drive by you shot and your ass got deflated, nigga. 
Zuh. Don't get the pasta peed in mausoleum. Slick a bird, I beat it. Mikey Jackson jacket, chemical reaction, elitist. Uh, shorty suck me, I'm depleted. They slide and repeat it until it's completed. Look, got the whole town on my penis. Put that on my fetus. I got it, you need it. Uh, $500 a bottle of wine. Expensive for a bunch of fucking grapes. Just hit a lick on me later. Smoking on Vegas at once while I thumb through the cake. I see so much through these Versace reading glasses with the pull. Take a tour to the lake. He a peon interrupted our conversation. Conversation with a Glock, he got put in his place. So many blue faces got me thinking Ben Frank was a crip. The high tech got me drinking on blood. Talking raspy, I'm fading on sip. I'm reacting off impulse to see them niggas anywhere and I'm painting this whip. You get booked, you be quiet. Go get you some commissary and go make you a dip. Ugh. Let that beat freaking too. Man, this rocket sometimes I don't even really know if I knock it out of the thing. We not even know what they heard I'm a freaking too. When I was a kid, freaking that out of this freaking shit, and I don't even really know, but I'm on this shit freaking matter of fact, you know what I don't think if I'm wrong, but I'm freaking over here. I can like I don't need to know if I'm a sick come to your freaking house and I go for your arm and I'm gonna I don't even know what's going on with like the audio freaking right there and like what kind of sound bite, but Honestly, he should have just kept going. Call me Mikey Lord, Doomba. First of all, you sit. I'll say like, uh, at least title-wise, right? You send the right uh, record uh, to the freaking show or whatnot. I'm huge gamer, uh, and even though there's no like full-on like full video game references all throughout the song, you know what I'm saying? Which you you would you would think would would have been even doper too. Um, it was still dope. Um, and the name still, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, rings. And I uh, like that. The mix was actually freaking dope, too. Like, when the actual beat just freaking popped on, right? I was like, okay, I like this right here, right? You know what I'm saying? Trying to figure out if it was a beat or a freaking song, right? As it comes on. Uh, and there was this split second where before he started rapping, I was like, please don't let it just be with something like whatever, you know what I'm saying, kind of shit, where you, you know, you're not really rapping about nothing, you ain't saying nothing, there's no energy, yada, yada, yada. Maybe there's like a million, you know, effects and stuff like that. And I was glad that that was not the case. He got in there uh, and did his freaking thing. Full, full three sec, three minutes, I guess. But like, it's a little bit of a cheat code because he stopped a little, you know, early to a certain extent. Didn't put like a little... You know, soundbite, it's cool for like an intro, give or take. Um, but like, I'd, I'd rather, like, honestly, I the way that I personally work is I don't like wasting a beat. So if there's a certain section, I'm going to make sure I'm saying something or the beat's already starting to fade out and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't got nothing else to say, you know, you know what I'm saying? Or if I'm going to add a soundbite, it's going to be in a strategic place, but I'm also going to make sure to be a, as much of a part of the record as I can. And especially with a beat like that, like I wanna, I wanna keep going, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's so, it's so uh, dope or whatnot. Um, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate that. There was like LOL snapped. You know what I'm saying? So I had to figure who to say. Uh, you said it's a sample from, you know, what I'm saying a movie, but I forgot what movie it is. Set it up. You're not a negotiator, man. You know that. Come on, man. You like the ladies more than you like the money. Can't be Scarface, can it? What are you talking about, okay? I'm your partner, okay? It is. You're not gonna trust me with that kind of thing. Who the f are you gonna trust? <laughs> it's either Scarface or an uh, unaired episode of I Love Lucy where Ricky Ricardo, you know what I'm saying, was, was a mobster in his, in his previous life and it was a flashback episode kind of thing and shit. But yeah, big freaking salute. Let's go ahead and jump back in the lineup. Yo, nonsense and Sir Mike, this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like, I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you where actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit, I'm thinking you were high. Like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view when I'm cool, better act like you surprised. Head to McDonald's, I'm about to steal your fries. Standing outside. Hold on real quick. Uh, or hold on. Uh, 
Tucson. I guess it's just reversed kind of freaking situation. All right, let's go ahead and get back in the lineup. Mike Sense, we got you up freaking next with your sound cloud submission. As we proceed to give you how you say what you need, uh, we see. Let me see. When the credits end, co produced by Create the League. Listen to your mama. Listen to your dad and your mama. When the credits end, you know the show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. Why? Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. Oh, put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. Oh. When the credits end, you know the show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. You know it's over. Most underrated MC. Niggas really won't be, leave them lost in the beat. Locked and loaded and focused. Overween with the steel. Give a fuck how you feel. Give a fuck how you feel, nigga. Killing your team by any means. Shatter bones and bleeding. Pulling off in the Nissan speed. Give me a reason to crash out. Doper than the crack house. Keep it chill like a jazz lounge. I'm a battle tank, ready for danger. Beware strangers, y'all in danger. Still the unfavored with more flavor. I'm suited for the shit. Y'all need to be more tame. When the credits end, you know the show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. Why? Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. Oh, put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. Oh, when the credits end, you know the show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. You know it's over. Gunslinger, kind of with green finger, stop playing. Y'all not killers, I move still like Magneto. Cause an onslaught, I'm an outlaw with a sawed off. Knock your head off like a guillotine. Huh. Smoking like cruise Magneto, like nicotine though. on a killing spree. Uh. Can't be seen like E. Hunter on a diet. I'm Mega Man, bringing trouble to your base. Don't try it, them wolves gon' riot. Heat leave rappers dressed like thou seem. Uh. I got your block surrounded, getting rid of you cowards. Cow. The king stay with a stick. Like gambit in case of spite and malice. When the credits end, you know the show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. What? Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. Oh, put, put the, the mic, mic down, down, boy, you know, know it's over. over. Oh. When the credits down, man, end, you know, you know the Yoda. show is over. Got them paranoid, looking over shoulders. Put the mic down, boy, you know it's over. I'm you know it's over. People would be like they sitting and chilling. Matter of fact, I don't even think I did. I like that. I Everyone wants to be so weird. Everyone wants to eat your hair. Everyone wants to. Uh, this was when the credits end. Co-produced by the Create Charlotte. No, the Create League. Um. My freaking mic sense. Listen, that was freaking a dope kind of freaking record. I almost felt like that would have been almost like a Dr. Dre kind of, you know, produced kind of situation, right? With those keys and sort of uh, the hard hidden uh, sort of freaking thing. I mean, like, you, Dre would have had probably even harder, you know what I'm saying, hidden freaking drums. But uh, this definitely felt like some, you know what I'm saying, decent. You know, one thing that I don't tend to hear from you when it comes to like the choruses and stuff that, now, that I'm just now noticing after all this time. Is that you don't really add too many like layers and stuff like that you kind of just like wrap your way freaking through uh you do always you know have a chorus but you'll go from you know chorus verse chorus verse and it'll be like a single sort of freaking take thing i guess as it, it makes it at least easier for you to you know if you're gonna do a one take o overall performance no sort of ad libs no no uh you know doubles and and stuff like that you know it'll definitely help for people to be able to fill it in that way um you know but i definitely would love to see that freaking live you know what i'm saying live piano sort of like playing and doing uh its thing as you say give me a second i gotta open up my i gotta open up my heart to your mom she wants to tell my uh, let me see. What did you say? Earl Zander was freaking good. 
Just came back in, uh, but feeling the vibes. That's what's up. Shout out to freaking uh, with the door squad. What did Joy say? When my beat on, uh, oh, you said this song, you know, so okay, this is very nice. I'll be on the free line. Thank you. Scotland and Ireland say TA. Me confused. I don't know. Um, I don't know what it means, but I want to start it, figure it out. Hold on, let me. Okay, can you let me? All right, it let me log in once again. And as I attempt to figure out once more, uh, give me a second. I'm going to jump back in the free line in just a moment. Is it actually going to let me do it from here or no? Uh, we'll see what's up. Let's multitask with the freaking time. All right. I'm going back in the free line right now. Yeah, who the sec with Big Wolf? Make sure that I'm saving to the right folder. <clears throat> I can't even do it. It's too low. Hey. Mm. What up? The frick they trying to act like this, they don't believe me. Huh? We don't How the believe frick they trying to act like they still don't believe me? When I just know that they still just believe me I've been on a whole nother level It's like I'm on a skateboard or a trampoline And I'm balancing while doing magic tricks They can't understand how my passion lives Ay. Best friend shut up with the dog went fake I've been posted in the jungle with the wolves and the snakes How they gon' really try to take my plate Hold it with a minute, don't make me call wait Passion lives inside of my soul Don't comprehend it if you don't know That I'm out here getting it Working like seven days a month, freaking week I don't even really even just need no sleep Don't take breaks, the whole family eat Can't trust these hoes, they beat for the streets Like freak you, me, we need these cheese I'll make a good load and crawl on knees Now let's get chubby, I'm back in the stoop Or maybe in the kitchen, I'm whipping up pops Can't fold these knots, now back to block Switch on my energy like off the frequencies Levels are changed, I like fade no concurrencies Rappers are dissing, they sounded like kids to me Trying to compete with wisdom I think that you need to go back and just write my rhymes Versus I'm being myself and I know that it's hurt can't look me in the eyes, I like don't that go blind But I don't know the love, but trying to find my mind Hold it with a minute, she bad like a cougar But she's still young, so she's trying to use it Can't trust nothing, I know how she moving People stay begging and always competing They sounded like they're trying to find out their reason If you say you got it, then why is you feeding for something to help you understand You sequence it, let me deprive, so I turn to an even Trying to satisfy Something that could never really be satisfied Unless you tapped into the ultimate certified You summarizing Everything that I already summarized Hold on I'm alive <laughs> What's Say she? Wait. I thought that I told you I'm locked in with patience We get it, you're trying to break the foundation To win where they realize that they cannot break it I'm built for these ultimate civilizations Reverse and disasters with lyrical magic So please do not touch me, my people get frantic Is anyone out there the quote from Titanic Who simple minded even know the mathematics I wanted to learn but they kicked me out classes <laughs> Now teach them my teachers on how to just manage Send me in the right direction, Empress Just focus on whatever you wanna be good at And they keep a practice until you get passion It's technical footing to get to the greatness When you start to tune in, you'll get understanding So many days I feel lonely Too many times can't trust homies It's a long way down, keep rolling It's a long way down, keep rolling What you say? What you say? What you say? So many days I felt lonely Too many times can't trust homies It's a long way it's a long way down, keep rolling. I don't even know what to do with the chicken. I don't even know if I'm over here acting like I don't know what the hell they're doing. Alright, big salute. Let's go. So. Big freaking salute, uh, you know what I'm saying, to, I'll, I'll freaking say this, right? There are certain areas where it needs a little bit of freaking work, and then certain areas where you did, you know, impress, right? Um, where it needs work are just in the overall freaking approach, right? There are certain elements where it does sound like you're, you know, reading, and, you know, essentially what you always want to freaking do. This is why, this is sometimes why most artists have moved over to, like, trying to freestyle most of the freaking things, because when people start saying, Oh, you sound like you're reading. And in most cases they are. They're like, you know, looking at the freaking thing or whatnot. And it's and it will feel like they're going through the motions as opposed to feeling the record, right? Essentially, all you have to do, like you can use this version of the record to to listen to it over and over and then practice the actual song. Then go in and re-record it again. Cause now you're gonna have a 
uh, a more of a perfection, more of your personality, confidence, and everything like that will come out. Basically, if, if you can't perform the song live, like in a live setting without your actual record freaking there, then like, you know what I'm saying? Figure out what you need to do. You, you should always try your best to get to that uh, before sort of like getting on a mic. That way everything feels, you know, uh, natural. Um, and where it, where it sounded the best, where when you, you know, did the sort of like more chopper flow and, you know, very Bone Thugs-esque, you know, without the, the sort of melodic thing that they would do. Um, but I appreciated seeing you, uh, you know, go within there and, and, you know, try that freaking stuff out because it is always, it's a job. It is a job when you got to have a certain amount of syllables and not fall off the beat beyond there and shit like that. Um, but yeah, just, just perfect everything. Anytime you either run out of breath, maybe you say a, a word like a little bit wrong and stuff like that, but you got all the way to that freaking part. So you almost don't feel like re-recording it. Always put yourself in that mind state that look, this is my job. I want to get paid to do this. I want to get paid to perform my songs in venues. And so I have to have this same amount of work ethic of someone that I would expect to have to pay to do the same exact thing. And if I see like imperfection from certain artists in any way, like when they're, especially during a performance, it doesn't make me want to then ask, hey, you want to tour with me? You want to go in and hey, I, I own a venue. Do you want to perform at, you know, it doesn't make me want to sort of, you know, do those things. So you got to perfect every aspect of yourself, even though like we're on this journey as an artist to just sort of like experiment, try new things, see like where, you know, each beat sort of freaking takes us. Like if you are going to put the record out, right? Because we can do all types of records. We don't have to release everything though, right? But before you actually officially release it, make sure that you do all of that work. Figure out every single thing that it needs before final release. You know what I'm saying? Does it need a feature? Does it need a two, three verse kind of freaking structure? Does it need background vocals within there? Possibly a different freaking beat or, or something like that to set it apart and uh, make it be something freaking bigger. That's all I've got. What do you guys freaking got? Let it be, let it be known. And uh, as I was saying, Empress, I would love to do voiceovers um, I just haven't ripped off that band-aid yet. Like, I don't know. I don't, I barely know where to freaking start. I've been trying to figure out what would the best sort of like program be to freaking, um, you know, like attempt it. I barely just now figured out how to on IG do the voiceovers for like, you know, like a, a visual thing that'll pop up or something like that. And if it lets you sort of like record audio over it. Like it used to be where like every time I would try, it would only let me record one audio. So I'd be like, well, how do you do the thing where one person's reacting to the other person and shit like that? And you're doing both voices, uh, you know, that. So I might start to gear up slowly, you know what I'm saying, by starting freaking there and then like, you know, taking different footage and just doing random shit. I, lo I always love a good like bad lip reading, as they call it where they sort of take like a movie scene that you know, but then they make it seem like they're saying stupid stuff the whole time. Um, no, Tato said, you know what I'm saying, it was an IG. Said the first show I ever uh, did, you know what I'm saying, I used three beats and I, I never heard. You know, I, I used three beats I never heard and freestyle three songs and people loved it. Uh, you know what I'm saying, crowd was freaking hype. Um, let me see. Da, da, da. Facts, appreciate you. Anyone saying anything? Let me see. And let me get in the overall cuts. You got a 6.5 from Ozenta in that. Other than that, uh, this one, definitely a freaking cool track on some levels. Uh, J.O. Moo, I don't know what you were saying, Joey. Shout out to the real Mike Sins, man. You already know, you know, man. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm telling, hey, bro, you better sit, listen, start making your records and just always make an extra freaking open verse version because you always have beats that I'd be wanting to like spit to and you only take it out. You don't you need don't another, man. All right, let's go back in the thing. GCS, again, you got to send your record to my email, not in the chat. 
Man, table manners. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep and I'm yawning. Waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie, gnawing on a Nazi, probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you've been warned. My brain is soaring like a unicorn. Stop it, bro. Right now. I will. No, you won't. You lying. I am. Okay. All right. Well. And hold on, quick. Let me throw this in here. That's what she said. And I said, why, thank you. And then I was in it. Uh, all right, diesel water you sent existence machines of war. Alright. Yeah. 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 It's the piece I offer prior to hell One drum, the story to tell, lace my stick well I'ma put the pound down up on that leather Work at the round out the drum, I tell ya Be the pack that started up the fire When you learn the code, you become the fighter We took the oath, blood soaked the great oath Left smoke great all up the coast to coast We don't post the toast, we pack the pop the village Lead the way to the land and pillage Learn no less from a man who has fallen Took the hand and made the world feel that life Bury me deep beneath that solid mother of her If the neighbor spirit don't make it beyond the world Made this out mana You can hear a hit, let it retell ya Right direct to the meat like when I scalp ya Ain't no help when I lay you the rest Fresh stress from the glory it tastes well, my face tell I'ma play a sound now to the weather Clouds that spill together, we pray the victory stack You lack such path up in history True foe, my enemy down ten in front of me The skinwalker, a wind talker Pray now that the night don't stalk you down Turn your ghost just into another foolish spirit Steal your faith through a cross written image I take no test, but from life I'm polished A man I stand, the land I stand forever Roll back my feather, may we fly together But until then my world drums rest upon the field That distorted thing To the seeds of war. If you like half of the first half of the video and want to see some more, you can make sure that if like you ever watch any movie that has Marvel in it, you're also seeing Thor. A lot of times there's a lot of people freaking who wanna fight me, but like after five minutes they see the floor and I don't even know what the hell to do with a rapping. Everybody be like, how the heck this nigga black and also freaking like first of all, big freaking salute. Let's go ahead. I like that. The seeds of war. The son of Frankenstein, these niggas be taking lives. I created a monster, world's ready to take their lives. Frightening, it's like it's still in this game. I'm, I'm just, just writing this pain, used to write on the train. No bars, just sad names. No it's not even my song. Uh, big salute, man. Listen, I like that. Beat was freaking, you know, proper. Uh, rhyming was freaking cool through the uh, verses and shit like that. The only criticism I have is honestly with that freaking chorus, which I like. But also, I feel like there's, you know, it still needs this one extra element, you know what I'm saying, within the mix or something like that. I feel like the distorted part might be still a little bit freaking much. Um, but I know exactly what sound that you're going for. As soon as you hit it, uh, you know, this record could be definitely near freaking perfect. I love that type of freaking beat, by the way. It reminds me of, like, Johnny Quest. Uh, if anybody ever remembers that, you know what I'm saying, uh, old, uh, uh, you know, cartoon, you know what I'm saying, from back in the day or whatnot. They had a dope theme song that... Like, it reminds me of that, because they're using the same, like, you know, horns and, and stuff like that within there. They actually freaking worked, uh, uh, you know, so, big freaking salute. Theo was like, yes, you know what I mean? Yeah, Johnny, man, Johnny, Johnny Quest, man. I am surprised they 
there are some, you know, cartoons they just haven't, you know, brought back, remade. But all the remakes and like revamps and reimaginings or, uh, you know, like bringing back shit like X-Men, you know, has come back, you know, in its exact form, but better. I feel like the animation is a lot freaking uh, better. Like the action scenes are top notch or whatnot. Uh, and honestly, man, the new X-Men is willing to go into some very interesting places when it comes to the freaking content. Like, they know that we've grown up over these, you know, many years, you know. So while 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 it is a cartoon, it will still deal with a lot of, you know, adult freaking themes and stuff like that. Things like, I'm a, at one point, I was like, bro, I'm watching... I'm watching a drama at this point and shit like that. Like, they talking about some real shit. It's, it's not like, you know, again, people are used to Marvel being like moment to moment. There's some some funny line that freaking happens or something like that. But like, you know, like Marvel knows what's up, man. They know the characters that like they can't play around with. You got to take Captain America seriously. You got to, uh, you know, you can sort of fluctuate with freaking Thor a little bit, right? Depending on where you go, you can't go too far, right? You know what I'm saying? Love and Thunder was a little bit freaking too far in terms of the freaking funny. Uh, Thor 1 was a little bit freaking too serious. Thor Ragnarok was just right. We're just, just in between. And there were a lot of changes within that movie that we, you know what I'm saying, got to freaking see from him getting his, you know, haircut to his, his eye, you know, cut out to the new hammer, you know what I'm saying, and shit. Or, well, no, actually the hammer getting freaking destroyed and shit like that. Y'all know what it is, man. Anyways, all 90s cartoons had the best theme music, man. And yes, they did. I remembered every single one when it came out, even if it was some, something as simple as like Gumby and shit. It was like, Gumby, doom, 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 for the Gumby, doom, 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 easier, and he will be sure to play Gumby. Doom, 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 doom. Let's all see what magic <laughs> things he can play. Y'all like, bro, are you seriously singing the Gumby? Listen, bro, it was a part of my childhood, all right? I went through the, the very kiddish shit to eventually... You know, us growing again, what did we what did we freaking have until Dragon Ball Z was a thing, right? And that finally became something. Maybe Speed Racer at a certain time. Uh we had of course all the shit that was on Nickelodeon and uh, you know what I'm saying, uh uh freaking Disney. But when I figured out about Cartoon Network, it was done. It was over. I was like, yo, there's freaking cartoons all fucking day. You know what I'm saying? Let's go, man. Scooby Doo, freaking Looney Tunes, uh, you know what I'm saying, Ed Grimley, eventually the cartoon cartoon stuff, which were like Powerpuff Girls, uh, uh, Johnny Bravo, uh, Ed, Ed and Nettie, uh, uh, Dexter's Laboratory, freaking stuff like that. That eventually led to, you know, more uh, Two Stupid Dogs, uh, uh, more Adult Swim eventually, right? Like uh, they had the, the the Brack Show and Space Goes Coast to Coast. Uh, man, there was, there was just so many dope things that, uh, actually allowed me to see cartoons as not just a cartoon like you know if you're just wa if you're watching a cartoon and honestly you're just sitting there and it's like you know not something like the freaking next minute and shit like that right you don't want to just be sitting there just staring like not saying like i never laughed once at like the smurfs right when i when i really go back and think about it all of the earlier cartoons like that never really like laughed out loud and shit like that you know what I'm saying? Um, until Family Guy, you know what I'm saying? Certain episodes of maybe like The Simpsons and, you know, a lot of the Adult Swim cartoons, Disney XD, you know, and some of the stuff that they did, you know, that was actually funny. I love Gumball and uh, what was the, ama the, ama the imaginary world or whatever and show that. There's just a lot of good things. Anyways, y'all know what it is. We have to take a break for one second just to, you know, geek out for, for, for a minute. This is that dorky review show after all, right? Hold on. Hold on, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's not forget where we're at. All right? It means you're safer sitting here. Okay. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep and I'm yawning, waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie. Dude, power, power, rocket power. Damn. Reboot. What happened to reboot? Out of your mind. Three, two, one, 
Oh what God. happened to freaking Dang. reboot? Also, also, if we're still going, if we're still in this conversation right now, because I see like y'all want to get nostalgic for a second too. You know what I mean? Uh, there are a lot of long-standing freaking shows. I feel like Sesame Street had lasted the longest. You know what I'm saying? As they are still, you know, uh, uh, all of the Muffet characters, you know, are, are basically spin spin off from that show and still exist to this freaking day, right? But then I think about like whatever happened to Eureka's Castle, uh, the other ones that were in the cave and shit like that. I forgot what which one that was. All the, the puppet freaking theme shows and shit like that. Uh, Eureka's Castle, though, felt like it definitely would have been something they could have kept freaking going and shit like that. The characters were like unique. I remember the Magellan, that fucking dragon. Uh, yep, I'm an adult now. I can say fucking dragon. All right, let's go into the... All right, now crash out that boy zip. Let's go ahead and get you in. Thank y'all. I appreciate y'all patience as we are rolling freaking through. And uh, let's go ahead and load this up on him. But you didn't know Tommy Davidson was the voice of Ren and Stimmy and shit like that. Right, yeah, Foster's home for imaginary friends. There we go. Shout out to Foster's. Yeah. Real, ah, real monsters. Man, I love that shit. I'm having my eyes on this little bag before I know. And when we drop it up, I just wanna make you mine now. Every time I see your face, you make me Frank wanna Yankers, smile now. Damn, I really son. appreciate the way you make me grind now. Really on that time now. I can't be focused on the whole shit. I wanna grind now. And if you think it should be sweet, you can find out. Hey, I be in twos with three. You know what I'm talking about? And that's on season and every time we fuck your ways, it be amazing. Little mama with this fuck, she know that shit amaze me. Honestly, man, I'm gonna hit that button just because I want you to correct that freaking auto tune and shit like that, man. I wanna be able to fault you guys for the right reasons and stuff like that. Just so you know how serious certain things are, right? If it's a, if it's a severity of like, look, what makes or breaks your record? Your beat selection, your performance, the effects that you add, the actual right or wrong amount of said effects, right? You never want to sound like you are underwater. And so with that said... Oh, no, 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 let's get me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I had to do what one time? Oh, hey. Uh, my, my bad. You know what I'm saying? So... Me apologies and stuff like that. But listen, listen, listen. Let me freaking give it. Let me let me let, let me let me let you know. The record is not necessarily freaking bad. You had good melodies within there. You know what I mean? I feel like you know. I kind of want to hear you without the auto tune. You know what I'm saying? Just to see how that might freaking sound. In most cases, I want to recommend Melodyne over auto tune for most of you guys, unless you know how to freaking use it and you use it sparingly at the very least. Don't go full robot. We're already competing with AI these days that can sound exactly like a whole human. And it makes no sense for us to go backwards into like, you know, like, oh, uh, we need to infiltrate because if they can sound like us, like, why? You know what I mean? You need you need to just be just be your freaking self, live with your own freaking talent and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? You can perfect everything with Melodyne uh, to sound, you know, a little bit uh, uh, better. But if you're going to use Auto-Tune again, Add the right effects on there. Uh, make sure that you um, put it in the right freaking key and that it's just not so uh, crazy and stuff like that. You'll be freaking good, though. And then send that back to the show. I'd also say, I mean, even though we kind of cut it a little bit freaking early, it was 1 minute and 30 seconds. Uh, the beat is freaking dope. I, I love a good sort of like vibe mixed with the melodic and instead of, you know, just it being sort of like outside of that, there's sort of like a, a blend of two kind of freaking different things. Uh, he said, what's up? You know what I'm saying? I have a new beat to submit. That's what's up. That's what's up. He said, Codename Kids Next Door was a hit too. Yeah. Listen, keep them coming, man. Get nostalgic in the chat. Talk about what you're doing and talk about where you're at. Let me see. Where is RV? RV for Desi said, you guys are sitting in my new freaking track. Hi, from freaking late. That's what's up. Uh, so what says, nigga? Um... Really got clear skin and stuff like that. Clear skin, clear. Is that a, a good a good thing? Cause that's, that's natural and as as shit. I can tell you that. Uh, 
And then um, what do you say? You said uh, you always uh, make me tear tear up with the the 4K and shit like that. Sensei, South African so what in the building? Um, what do you say? I remember all those cartoons. I was in there. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. What do you say? Smoking the Bear said yes, but do you remember the show HR Puffin Stuff? Hold on, let me look that one up or whatnot. I feel like I remember HR Puffin Stuff. Uh, yo, I do not remember that. Well, hold on, let me uh, let me pull that up over freaking here so you guys on the YouTube and stuff can see what he was talking about. HR Puffin and stuff. Like it looks ever so slightly remember for familiar, but also like um is not because my mind says it's the stuff of nightmares for a second. You know what I mean? Like hold on. Can I no yeah, let's look here right now. What did they go to freaking Oz in this episode? Hold on, uh, how can I make this bigger? That's what she said. Oh, okay, let's plop this in here. Uh, I guess we can just load the screen like this, right? Uh, and then how can we zoom in without doing, nope, that didn't work. Uh, da, da, da. But anyways, I mean, you guys can technically freaking see it. You guys over here. And do you guys remember this? Because I do that. And I feel like, yo, that is crazy, man. Was he was he the equivalent of what? Like Barney or... Uh, and what happened to... Binya, Binya, Barney, whoa! Binya, Binya! Binya, Binya, Barney, whoa! See, look, hold on. Let's go. Binya, Binya. Binya, Binya, <laughs> Binya, Binya. Pollywog, Gullah Gullah Island, you know what I'm saying? What about him? You know what I mean? What, what about, what about uh, Binya Binya? Hi, we're Binya Binya. I want to see like a, where are the kids now? Kind of freaking thing. Hi, we're the kids from um, Gullah Gullah Island. And, and today we eat bean and cheese sandwiches every day while watching that dorky review show, everyone. So if you want to eat them too. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep and I'm yawning. Waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like, like a, a zombie, zombie knowing I'm a Nazi, Nazi probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you've been warned. My brain is so like a unicorn. All right, next up on the MIC. Let me freaking plot this freaking in here. What the freak, bro? Can you? What did I do? Like delete the whole? I guess that makes no sense. But we'll take it. Okay, let's throw this in here. And your YouTube. Uh, here we go. All right. Silver Hawks. Silver Hawks. No wait, wasn't that? He man, he man or something. Who done sinner? Skip a Roni. Sometimes this dick is phony. I don't know what the hell to do, but this chip is on me. All right, we got the coolest, the cool, the cool, the coolest. Stuck up. Official music video. You wanna watch this, man? Make sure you pull up a device with your with our YouTube on it. And we will plop that screen. Looking like a great day, never what I've been through. Got it out the gutter, I ain't got nothing against you. Bread with the butter, I'ma spread it with the kin too. I'm allowed to window, hold the cool shit offend you. I've been independent, but I'm balling with my friend too. My nigga doing dirt, high alert, right ten two. I'm making a shirt, selling merch, right. trying to get through. Stab me in the back, get your name in the print too. I ain't never act no account for attention. I was fucking bitches even before I got a mention. I fucking with my bitch now, I don't need a mistress. I'm living my best life, can I get a witness? Hit it from the back, pull a weed, give an inch. My brother got a rat, he bought a bitch stench. Police killing blast doing. Holiday legend, but enough of all that, cause I'm round for my niggas. Homie, I'm up, yeah, stuck there. I was living broke, tell me anywhere but there. Dripped in the cloth, fit cause I ain't cut fair. D niggas soft phone, God, none tough there. Always on call for my dogs, like, yup, where I was down bad for a minute, I was stuck there. Gotta get a bag, life, everything but fair. Nigga, I'm up, yeah, stuck there. Homie, I'm up, yeah. 
yeah, stuck there. I was living broke, tell me anywhere but there. Dripped in the club, it cause I ain't cut fair. These niggas soft, on got none tough there. Always on call for my dogs, like, yep, where I was down bad for a minute, I was stuck there. Gotta get it back, like, for Oh my gosh! Y'all scared the crap out of me. Whatever nigga piss about it. Rich Polly, I'ma speak it to a zis about it. Big Sally, you don't even see a bend down him. Ten down a bad bitch since you been bout him. Big pile when the money come with jealousy. They got beef for the street, but gonna let him be. Niggas holding their clothes, are you telling me? On the bros, when I blow, I'ma let him eat. But he thinking he a dog in the I deliver on the job, I need time. This whole pussy is a boss on the rewind. Rewind, yeah, kill about three times. Quit the cut a nigga off when I peace sign. A fake shit, I ain't involved on peace signs. All the facts had a cause, you ain't see how I do that again. <laughs> Keep running your teeth now. Nah. You ain't never seen a nigga cool as me now. Nah. Cause I ain't never been y'all in my own lane. I give Always me one like more a in home game. I'm the boy boy and you don't even know James. Call me Roy 27 into old man. Slick talk, get you knocked, there's a no name. No gas, but I'm foul for the propane. Hey. And now I'm up on God, but I know pain. That's right, that's Homie, right, that's up. right. Yeah, stuck there. I was living broke to me anywhere but there. Dripped in the club, fit cause I ain't cut fair. <laughs> Don't call for my dogs like that. Where I was down bad for a minute, I was stuck there. You gotta get like... it back, life, everything but fair. Nigga, I'm Whoa. up, yeah, stuck there. Homie, I'm up, yeah, stuck there. I was living broke to me, anywhere but there. there Dripped in there. the club, it cause I ain't cut fair. Fair, fair. Niggas off on God, none tough there. Always don't call for my dogs like that. Where I was down bad for a minute, I was stuck there. Gotta get it back, life, everything but fair. Nigga, I'm up, yeah, stuck there. Homie, when I'm up down, there's a lot of time when a lot of vegan people wanna come and say what's up now. I don't know what the hell I'ma do with it at a time when I rhyme. I don't even know what's up now. I be talking about the direction. Everybody knows that when I get erection, I bet 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 I you said that plugin is not it. So it was not a plugin. And we'll freaking talk about it freaking right now, man. It was a live performance. That's a good thing, but look. So first of all, song is freaking dope. Record is a banger. Energy is on there. Mix is freaking decent. You know what I'm saying? Ain't got nothing to freaking say that I would, you know, sort of like mentally improve what I feel like for the type of record and the type of beat that, that you got on. Like you did the overall freaking job. I feel like people who love, you know, these kind of freaking records definitely gonna rock with it. Love the aspect of, again, you know, a record that bangs, but also has a little bit of a sample with it and stuff like that. I feel like it gives you a little bit of a leg up for certain people who, again, we look for that sample within certain records, uh, um, you know, to sometimes pique that, that interest. Um, uh, video was very professional as well. Outside... Of every time you brought in the sort of live performance aspect of what everybody was, you know, saying and shit like that. It's a good thing to be able to see how hype everyone was, right? So we know that everybody's just not lip syncing as they're jumping up and down because we all know how that sounds. And <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just breaths, people jumping up and down, making sounds and shit. Uh, and you've seen the videos that make fun of those moments and shit like that. You know, maybe we need one of those. Uh, but everybody was extremely freaking hyped. They were singing the freaking actual song and shit like that, right? And that's essentially what they wanted to get forth and uh, at least get across in the video. I get that. But you need to mix that. <laughs> you need to mix that too, all right? Understand that when you do video footage, it is no different than your actual record. That has to be mixed just the same so that everything feels and sounds natural. So always listen to the video on several devices just as you would your freaking song and shit like that so that you'll know. Because easily, you know, you could have took out some of the freaking lows and, and shit like that. And, and, you know, it's just it just it feels like something that just randomly comes out of nowhere. I, I'm glad that you did it on beat at the very freaking least. Um, but it is very startling because you are not expecting it. And I do feel like there's there's definitely a better, uh, you know what I'm saying, way to freaking do that. But overall, you know what I'm saying, not bad. Give your freaking thoughts in the chat. We got a three song coming back, coming up right now from Smirk It Up Bear. Uh, so we had a freaking nine on that, said freaking gas uh, and shit like that. And he said, I've been scared since the song started. <laughs> Just like that. Shout out to KZ, man. Welcome freaking back, man. Long time no freaking see and stuff like that. You started, of course, over here on the uh, TikTok side, I believe, and stuff like that. You were always uh, over here. You finally jumped over to the, uh, the YouTube and, you know, found yourself a home. Uh, let me see, and uh, what else can we do? Let me make sure that we are still cool with Band Lab real quick. 
Yep, Band Lab is still freaking uh, and running overnight. Now, just a heads up, Band Lab only lets us go live for about four hours before they decide to cut the stream. Um, around that time, I'll see how I feel, whether or not I'll restart it for you freaking guys or whatnot. But in most cases, remind yourselves at all times that we are live on all platforms. So if anything happens to any platform, again, we don't know how any one of these, you know, streams will treat any situation that happens. Sometimes you send a record that gets it, you know, kind of flagged on the stream and stuff like that. And then they'll cut the stream on those certain platforms and then, you know, other ones they won't. So we'll just have to always, you know, see what it is. One of those main things that do get it, you know, blocked and cut or when you guys can't find the previous stream that, you know, maybe we, we did. If you can't find it, it usually means that somebody sent one of those kind of records. They sent like an industry record or, you know, something on an industry beat that they shouldn't have. And then, you know, the the whole stream just like, I got to watch out, man. So what mic is that? This is a Samsung G Track Pro. Uh, it's the basically second version of this one, which is the Samsung G Track. Hold on, let me turn this around so you can at least read it. That was the wrong button, sir. Can you uh, do that again? There you go. Samsung G Track. Uh, and this is the pro one right here. Uh, both mics I would vouch for 100%. If you guys are trying to look for a decently um, affordable mic at this point, uh, they are not new, which means they are possibly a little bit cheaper now than they were when they first, you know what I'm saying, started. Like when these first came out, uh i think that the the g track was about like two three hundred this one same thing 250 uh you can probably find it for like maybe a uh, uh, hundred give or take maybe the other one like 80 or something like that if you're lucky maybe on ebay or freaking amazon um you know you can probably find a uh back order on you know sam ash or guitar center if you're lucky as well so can you change the view back uh, I can see the screen, you know what I'm saying, behind you freaking, uh, uh, less glare and stuff like that, man. I'll fix it. There we go, man. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah. All right, uh, we have a three song freaking skip. We gotta freaking take care of, so we're gonna go ahead and jump in here, like. Searching for the master sword. You guys are really bad at spitting rhymes, and you ain't real and have no skills, and so I mastered George. I could have been killed running past. When I crashed the card and smashed it, blasted four magic doors And man, you know how all these bastards are I'm like Aladdin when he chops your bar inside a lamp for acting hard When all he had to do was spit a rap or just beatbox to go distract the guards I got a hundred rupees planted on my MasterCard Don't make me taste a chicken, take it, make it, take a listen to my new mixtape And mention it to other raven pigeons I'll take a sword and stick it into any dude who's out there pillaging and I don't like this women. view though Don't make me make you come up missing cause that ain't the mission I used to date this fat girl who I brought home one time But then she up and ate the kitchen I used to feel safer on cops until somehow we all became the victims Now let me try and paint the vision Now let me try and paint the vision I need uh, uh. <laughs> That sounded like a monkey having sex Um, Let me throw this into the cusp That puts us at 50 a monkey having sex with a parakeet randomly and shit. Uh, <laughs> let me see. In a in a in a rocking chair. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so we got three songs. This is a three song back to back. If anybody's wondering, oh shit, man, I want to put one in one of those. It is twenty five doll hairs. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Whether you have Cash App, PayPal, and or. Chime and or super chat and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Three songs back to back, unequivocally, unaffectedly, right now in the freaking cusp, man. We're about to get to it immediately, man. Let's go. I see y'all. Say holy shit, yeah. If that's your bitch, better come get her. Yeah, can't stop. Yo, check my time. I'm a non-stiller. If you're trying to keep her, you 
better be Hold on, man. That shit just started. Uh, me, that, uh, I didn't mean it literally, man. Hold on, man. Hold on, hold on. Let's get ready. Get it. Let us get ready for that real quick. He just starts right, right when the freaking beat starts. Okay, okay, okay. Close your eyes and then one, two, a one, two, three, let's. If that's your bitch, better come get her. Yeah, can't stop swiping. I'm a known stiller. If you're trying to keep her, you better be gone with her. Can't trust me around a bitch like Bobby. What's wrong with him? I'm like Womack, I know. You might need a low jack, cause I jack your hoe. For show, connect like tic tac to toe. Thick like grits, I got some coal in her. She my type like AB, AB and O, nigga. She get it? She yeah. tight, she yeah. tight. She obey. Like a sprite, like a sprite. She do what I like, what I like. Yo, chick, my type, my type. She thick, she tight, she tight. She obey like a sprite, like a sprite. She do what I like, what I like. Yo, chick, my type. Uh, have no fear, Mr. Fresh here. You can hate, I'ma keep it clear. I'ma keep it clear. Join the club, don't be a scrub. You just mad cause I get love. From your chick, she be jacking. She cute, her boots, I'm knocking. I be knocking. Uh, on the regular. Every day she hit my cellular. Every day she texts me. Every way she sex me. She sex me. She wet like a deski. She wet like a Pepsi. She thick, she tight. She obey me like a sprite. She do what I like. Yo, chick, my type. She my type, she wanna drink, she looking nice. I'ma buy it for a right, just to see what show they like. Listen, if I didn't, I'd be tripping. She a thick and tight print on the mitten, had to play a smitten. She looking like Robin Gibbons, no stress. I'ma play it, Mr. Press, like Clinton. Few times I almost fell apart. Think about her arts, looking just like a question mark. Truly, wonder if she likes movies. We can head to the spot, watch a tubi while I rub the booty. But I can't say that That's when she asked me If I had my own spot We could stay at Told her yeah Now you're talking If we head to Long Beach I got a rooftop apartment Go bottles in the bridge Let me take her to the crib And give cutie Hit the biz Love She thick She tight She tight She obey Like a sprite Like a sprite She do What I like What I like Yeah, needs to grab that chick, energy It tight, started tight, with tight. Shot the freaking way and then it times like I always be telling my freaking chick Every time that she sees something cool, she can't get me Don't even know if a freaking off or freaking when to get high like eight hippies People will be like, I don't freaking think that the lines that you freaking is say this can't slip me Uh, first of all, let's go ahead and hit this over here So, shout out to Mr. Fresh, uh, you know what I'm saying? Again, he is the artist that is on the freaking chorus, essentially one that, uh, you know, came with the, I forgot what uh, verse essentially freaking you had. Was it was it uh, second or freaking third? Essentially, though, I like the uh, the blend of artists on this freaking track. And my criticism, you know, comes from the fact that it just immediately starts, right? I feel like it needs a, you know, like a good kind of like drum breakdown or something like that. Like, I want to feel like a live band almost is playing, you know, the production kind of thing. And then for it to jump into, you know, maybe the freaking chorus first, then the verse. I don't freaking know. You know what I'm saying? But the verse did set it off, you know what I'm saying? Essentially, while we were in there, uh, you know what I'm saying? He did have a good energy that that I feel like... Um, did elevate and uh you know saying give that that record you know the life uh outside of being startled you know just, just right there um but right so where you come in of course right we talk about this from time to time with certain things mr fresh uh and it will be a little bit of the the repetition with the you know melodics and you know what i'm saying the energy and stuff uh i am used to sort of you know just knowing what uh what his style is the type of thing that that he uh, sort of freaking makes or whatnot when you hear more and more records from him in the different styles and see the consistency you know you sort of get used to to certain things but 
it still is very prevalent. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I impart the same advice on you that I do any other melodic artists in that, you know, it's okay for a chorus to have repetition, but then once you jump into the verse, you wanna change it up. You wanna have that variation so people have more to look forward to. If everything is that same sort of melody, you know, it sort of stays at a steady sort of freaking level as opposed to, you know, going here, going up freaking here. Ooh, I like this freaking note, this one over, you know what I'm saying? It's sort of like going, going up and up you know what i'm saying because oh over here no let me on the second eight bars let me maybe like do a do a little bit of a fast rap sort of freaking thing real quick or whatnot like it's all about just figuring out that variation so that more people can uh you know what I'm saying get in the thing uh and you know not sort of either get bored or just feel like you know what I'm saying something else uh, I said, just shit my uh, two song bite bay. Okay, man, we'll put you on on there now. The dish run right free in here now. Uh, she needs a beatbox, you know what I'm saying? Pouring a soda and sh Ooh, listen, I, I think I hear that. Oh, wait, are you talking about for the intro or like what are you, what are you, what are you suggesting and shit like that? You know what I'm saying? Beatbox, pouring a freaking soda and stuff like that. A little bit of a beatbox and then you know soda soda pour at the freaking end leads into the freaking song actually coming in um hold on make sure we are freaking good we're good we can go in with the second one again out of the three which one would be your favorite that's what we're gonna always do with these various skips here this is probably one of the first records i remember him sending to the show now hold up, hold up. Let me give let me give let me give people the the other freaking setting, right? Because for people who are hearing you for the first time, the other thing that I always sort of think about is the most of the records I heard have heard from him are in this vein of like, you know, you see that bad shoulder across the way, you know what I'm saying? That 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 you know, that that cutie or whatnot you want to go talk to. And it'll almost feel like these songs are the soundtrack to that moment of you like being at a party or a bar or uh, a, a barbecue, a, a, a pool party, a freaking water park, whatever. You're at all these different scenarios while you see somebody you kind of want to freaking talk to. And, you know, you'll have this these songs sort of like on in the background. So I've said like, bro, you need to make music videos to all of them, right? Make music videos to all of them after you get the, the right freaking mixes and stuff like that. And, you know, make a themed sort of project where either each one has a different girl in, in the video and stuff like that themed after each month or something. Or, uh, you know, maybe it's the same girl and you're always somehow meeting her at all these different random locations and you keep, you know, shooting your shot or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? And, you know what I mean? So this one right here, definitely West Coast vibes. Everybody light up that, that incense and barbecue pit. Go talk to her. Go talk to her. Go talk to her. 
I see it walking all around I don't know what the hell freaking you drop something freaking on the ground And I pick it up a lot of time you freaking booty be shaking I dig it Hey, come on! Stop barking over there! I've even heard was that joy <laughs> did it randomly go through a joy uh record right after that shout out to joy you see so um uh big freaking salute to that <laughs> tough i agree now that that is that is probably you know, again, as far as if we're listening to, and we have done an album, or at least half of the album, you know, kind of a review on the freaking show that he's, you know, sent over time. Um, and within that, we've been able to hear a lot of the records, which ones, you know, sounded consistent, that felt like they belonged on the album. Again, a lot of them freaking are, they're of that same, you know, sort of like, man, like you kind of do feel like you need to listen to it as a, Full freaking thing and i'm always like yo with these with these kind of situations man do videos to all of them package it as a visual a visual experience um the last artist to freaking do that and you know it'd be so interesting was of course tiara whack and she had uh you know very unique songs on there you know what i'm saying for those who might have been you know she had records before that but you know, I think she was at a point where she was finally crossing that 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 threshold of, you know, being more more freaking noticed or whatnot. And that project, you know, sort of freaking did it. All the videos were just like crazy. Uh, they led into each other and stuff like that. So there's something that he can do to make these freaking proper. But this record is, you know, I think ranked among some of the best that that he has, you know, sent to the freaking show. I definitely put that in the top five and top ten for him um you know what i'm saying he knows some of the other ones and stuff like that man like the ones that come to my mind the beat the bk one the uh man what are the i gotta look at i gotta look at the uh the the playlist for the ones that i was able to figure out or whatnot but we got one more song from him before we move back on into the uh actually i think we do have a two song skip that we got to put in right after this one right so we'll see what's up. Ah, yo way. Here we go. Here's that BK one. It's yo way. Like Burger King, essentially, right? This one got a good vibe, freaking too. What not? But you guys be the judge. Leave your feedback in the freaking chat. Mr. Fresh with your way. Uh, you can have it so way. Produced by way, him as well. Yeah, like BK. Time, but I don't even know what I'm gonna say 
game when I was really freaking always trying to rhyme and like the teens that you be trying to say in all the freaking games that you be trying to play in all the freaking time when I be rhyming. Hey, it's freaking cool and beat the deep and cool and when I speak to you and beat the cool and beat the deep and cool. You know the deep is cool and beat the cool and beat the cool. I used to fall asleep in school and uh, no, I like this one. This one is definitely a vibe. I'm glad he sent that one because that was literally we had to just talked about, uh, you know, send that one as the example before we even, uh, you know, got to play it. And I knew that it was the the sort of freaking one or whatnot. And like I always say, man, you know, you set yourself up for the sync license. You know what I'm saying? Even uh, uh, what was it? Uh, Empress. Was it was it Empress? Who, who was it who said? Who was it who said something about the sync licensing thing? Hold on. Let me go back. Let me go back. Let me go. Shit might be able to be single license. Man, the thing was we're just going fast in there. Holy shit, that helped a lot. Hold on. Where the oh you were talking about that. Okay, so we can go from there. Just send my two song. Okay. Can uh the pup feature in the stream? <laughs> I got two so there's two of them down here though. You know what I'm saying? And the problem is they like to eat everything and so if i bring them over here they're gonna be just trying to eat stuff they're gonna be barking they're gonna jump down and then just start running throughout the the freaking house peeing on everything and you know like i gotta i gotta be able to monitor that you know what i'm saying um but i i can uh i can bring i can bring it for a moment at some point you know what i'm saying i'll freaking uh I'll, I'll do that so you guys let me see uh what else was i gonna say though but look once again and by the way so i said in the freaking chat like you know i was uh, uh letting them know how i've said about this record that you need to do the music video you know at like a burger king and freaking stuff like that uh, you know what I'm saying? Just, I, just, I somehow on a on a romantic date with a, with a you know a, a bad chick. You know what I'm saying? At Burger King or whatnot. Originally though, right? My my mind went to you know just a regular, you know, uh, uh, not regular, but you know what I'm saying? An actual bad chick. You know what I'm saying? And but you just happen to take her to, and you know, like usually the 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 ladies gonna complain about that kind of shit. Like, oh, I can't believe you took me to like they. They do it for, uh, you know, Cheesecake Factory and, you know what I'm saying, this and freaking that and blah, yada, yada, yada. Um, but the extra idea I sort of threw over freaking here that I, I said it like I freaking had said it already. But then I thought, yo, what if she works at Burger King and she is, you know, again, bad chick. She just happens to work at Burger King. And then, like, again, you go up, you're ordering your freaking thing, and you're like, damn, what can I order for you and shit? You know what I'm saying? And so you're over there, you know what I'm saying, singing your freaking song. There's, and there's scenes where you're talking to her at the register, and the other ones where you're sitting down, <laughs> you're sitting down on the freaking seat, uh, you know, where they're just eating and shit, and she's just smiling, and you know what I'm saying? She likes it and shit. You know what I mean? Just, just, just you know, and by the way, there are those, those, they exist. They exist or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Everywhere. You know, any any kind of profession you look, there will be a, a bad a, a bad chick, you know what I'm saying? Uh and uh uh yeah, you know, some some are, are possibly a little bit more high class, but there are some who are indeed very simple that are down to earth, you know what I'm saying? And you know, they, they treat them right, man. Treat them right. That's all we gotta say. Uh, what do you say? I keep it basic when I lace it. <laughs> uh, when you say number one all day, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? KZ was freaking saying. The Cali vibes, you know what I'm saying? All day. Yeah, you know I'm saying. Listen, I'd plop up a barbecue right there. <laughs> you can have it some way, way. Yeah. Like like BK. BK. You can have it some way, way. Excuse me, can I get a number four? Like can I get a number four and a number three? Matter of fact, you know what, girl, can you come with me? There's a lot of time when I just want to come and see. There's a lot of time when you always want to... Whatever. Let's go to the third song and see. Oh, no, wait. This was the, the last song, right? Uh, anyways, we did it. Uh, which one was your favorite? You guys got to be the judge. <laughs> Between that one and the second one. But then that first one has, you know what I'm saying, potential freaking two. 
Uh, he's in the wind and dog. He doesn't know killing. <laughs> yeah, he just I said sink, sink diesel and shit like that. Is that an actual freaking thing? He said I see on oh, oh, never mind. And just wanna wanna see wanna see. All right, hold up. Let's hurry up, man. The G's. Jeez, Louise. I just need you to. Can you please just go? We all eat pizza, so. Music, I got pizza if you need a pay pal me. You see me on the playground, just yeah, I'm a dog, but I stay grounded. They call me in cause I stay clowned you wanna stay down then. I feel like I should also make a different kind of well people know people that watch the show on the other platform they'll always know what that sound means when the you know what I'm saying it's it means we're putting in the you know a or someone has put in a two song back to back uh skip whether they have won it or Something like that. Okay. Bread and laugh. But I feel like I do need to make a specific piece of audio. This is a two song skip. 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 Uh. Oh. This is. She got on my phone. Sorry. She got on my phone. She got on my phone. It's STL. My she be blowing up. She won't leave me alone. She call on my phone, she call on my here phone. Here we go, here we go. She call on my phone, she call on my phone. She, she call on my, my phone. phone, bitch, quick she call on my, my phone. My she be blowing up, she won't leave me alone. She call on my phone, she call on my phone. She call my phone, she always takes my line. And I ain't picking no little bitch, I always hit the climb. I keep the money on my mind, I love them dollar signs. But you're a free code, so I just get you on your grind. Huh? But I'm just tired of you calling me. Callin this me. harassment, bitch, why you always stalking me? Stalkin Talking foul in the field, but you walk with me. Walk with I was trying to make a meal, you can't stop a G. You can't. She called my phone, I don't wanna hear it. Uh, like why you call me when you always tripping? Uh, see I ain't really with all that shit. Uh, so I'm gonna find somebody else for it. She called on my phone, she called on my phone, she called on my phone, she called on my phone. My shit be blowing up, she won't leave me alone. She called on my phone, she called on my phone. She call on my phone, she call on my phone She call on my phone, bitch quick call on my phone My shit be blowing up, she won't leave me alone She call on my phone, she call on my phone The call, then a the text, then another one I don't even understand what the fuck she on She blow my phone up every day, I'm like, what you want? What you want, some weed? I swear I got one packaged up Just pull up just as long as you stop calling me, stalking me, harassing me, always talking foul on me. Uh, but I've been popping shots like you free throws. I knew her. when I met you that your ass was a free code. See, I just tried to skip the line with a cheat code, but she know like he know. I'm balling sub zero. Hold up. Damn, man, look, here she go calling me again. This bitch don't never leave me alone, man. Fuck, 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 fuck. She call on my phone, she call on my phone She call on my phone, she call on my phone My she be blowing up, she won't leave me alone She call on my phone, she call on my phone She call on my phone, she call on my phone She call on my phone, bitch quick call on my phone My she be blowing up, she won't leave me alone She call on my phone, she call on my phone no matter who she be calling, she call a lot of time with all the people need to fall in. If you can figure out where the heck to go, a lot of time when you go up to Mexico, people freaking out, figure she out, freaking some of these chicks will not have sex with yo. <laughs> and then you figure out ways. Uh, Alright, so. As I. 
Make sure they stay to be four and stuff like that. First of all, there's a decent mix on this. Overall, good performance. Everything that you sort of did, you know what I'm saying? Performance uh, uh, wise, you know what I'm saying? Uh, was decent. Again, I didn't have no problem. You had a good energy in there. Uh, chorus, I always end up saying that he needs to add that other tone that I keep adding every time I hear the song. It's because I, I hear it every time. Even if I don't want to freaking do it, it just makes me want to do it. So even if I'm listening to the song off the show, I'm always going to. I'm calling my phone. I got my phone. You know what I'm saying? So figure out somebody that, that you know, can go in there and do that if not you. Uh, and, and figure that out, you know what I'm saying? Verses are a little bit freaking slower in terms of the performance. Again, nothing too crazy, but again, I'm not mad at it. Uh, and I feel like you have an overall concept for the freaking song, right? But what is the song missing? How about uh, the sound of her talking shit to you over the phone? Like you... Like basically going through your messages and and you keep trying to like you'll go through one for a second, then you'll hit the you know the skip button and go to another one because she just keeps leaving messages and calling and you won't answer them because she's just you know crazy, uh and you know there there needs to be moments like that especially at the end you know what I mean or or beginning where's the the actual phone ringtone and shit like that like there 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 should be certain elements that you know uh, allow us to really get along you know or go along for the freaking ride at least um uh, but uh you know let them know what you think about that when the freaking tenant and all feedback is of course welcome he said or even in the background of the verses you know can, you can hear like you know a text messaging going on. exactly exactly you know what i'm saying or like a part of the production or something like that like you just want to to add an element because you know like we get exactly what you're talking about and i feel like you can you can visually take us there a little bit more with a few you know the right place the you know sound effects and possible freaking audio from Sid Cheek uh let me see what type of music do you react to all music man except for industry music so you can't send anything that is on the radio or if you're rapping or singing on a beat that is on the radio do not send that please please for the love of god please do not send that to the radio no please do not send that to the show uh anything as close to original as possible your your records can be on spotify that's that's okay I just want you to not send some Drake or some Jay-Z or some Migos or some freaking, you know what I mean? Like when you guys get on some of those beats and then try to send your record, the only time I'll accept it is when it's a freaking skip because at the very least, you know, you paid to have it freaking happen. And, you know, it will always just, you know, bring the live back. But I don't like it to happen. You know what I'm saying? We stream for a cool freaking minute often, man. I do like often eight hour, you know, plus freaking streams. And it sucks to sort of like do that much work for a lot of you guys. And then for only one record to really be the thing that gets the, you know, the video not, you know, seen on the platform or something like that. So be careful with what kind of uh, music you guys do send to the show. All right. You know what I'm saying? You said did this little uh, Kayla Nell sample flipping so that. Yeah, you flip it. That, that's freaking okay. That's what I usually freaking tell people, man. You have to flip whatever you're doing in some way. You can't just like, oh, you know what? Let me let me rap to the same exact beat that, you know, so-and-so rapped on. Like, you got to do something different or have somebody, have a producer uh, flip it so that people will look at it like a, a new song that's paying homage to the original a, a little bit. And sometimes you guys don't even do that. You'll just like, oh, let me just make something brand new and act like the original song didn't exist. I'm like, man, you know how much love you would get though if you did pay homage to where the the actual thing comes from? It, you know what, it is? It, it's often like if you hear somebody sample the Walking Dead theme but they don't mention a zombie at all or any of the characters from the freaking show. No Michonne, no freaking Rick. They don't say, I do some shit like Rick Grimes or, or nothing, you right? They just do use the beat, but then they make their own freaking song to it and shit. It's like, dude, that's so much of a waste, bro, because if you were to say something, right, make a little bit of a story or at the very least, like throw some bars in there that then relate to characters on the show, everyone who's a fan will promote the shit out of your record. You have no idea. I be telling y'all that all the time. Do not just name your record 
after an anime make a song themed to the anime like go go full nerdcore with it and shit like that just try not to make it you know corny you guys know exactly how to freaking get in your own lane and do your freaking thing so pretty sure you're good let's go ahead and get the second song from him and then we'll jump back into the free line this one is w g g a f which of the two shout out zealous for making it another music video video for <laughs> I'm just trying to write seats with client with the windows up. I've been getting high, roll a blunt. Yeah, we lit as fuck. I be in the coop, rolling up. We don't give a fuck. Uh, uh, see, we don't give a fuck. I'm just trying to write seats with client with the windows up. I've been getting high, roll a blunt. Yeah, we lit as fuck. I be in the coop, rolling up. We don't give a fuck. Uh, uh, see, we don't give a fuck. See, we don't give a fuck. Henny poured in double cups. See, I just gotta ease my mind. I roll another blunt. I'm on a purple plane. This cause they always rolled up. Hold up, Brody. Yeah, we bout to smoke some. Yeah, it's a session. Better grab the reverend. Count your blessings. I swear to God, I smoke to ease the pain. Man, shit be stressing. Huh. Yeah, I need to pull up, then roll up, don't slow up, no, I can't ever hold up, huh, I stay so lifted, I think that's why I'm gifted, they play with me, man, they might need a tissue, I'm about to bless these bars, see, I've been aiming for the top, but surpassing the stars, I'm just trying to ride seats with client with the windows up, I've been getting high, roll a blunt, yeah, we lit as fuck, I be in the coop, rolling up, we don't give a fuck, uh, uh, see, we don't give a fuck, I'm just trying to ride seats with client with the windows up, I been getting high, roll a blunt, yeah, we lit as fuck, I be in the coop, rolling up, we don't give a fuck, uh, uh, see, we don't give a fuck, I grab a switch of sweet and roll a blunt and sour D, uh, Pass it to my squad, you ain't smoke if you ain't team Switch the sweet field of the green, I keep it by the pig I roll it by the OZ, you ain't fucking with my team Cause we blaze up, keep one pulled up, always in the chamber Don't try to play us, cause them boys are armed and dangerous I stay pulling up, the double cup stay filled up Yeah, I'm getting drunk, high as fuck, we turning up I'm just trying to ride seats with client with the windows up I've been Getting high, roll a blunt, yeah, we lit as fuck. I be in the coop, rolling up, we don't give a fuck. Uh, uh, say we don't give a fuck. Music, music, everybody. Big mm. <laughs> mm. salute. Now that one did actually feel a little bit more freestyle, you know what I'm saying, out of the freaking two, just a little bit outside of you actually freaking having a chorus and stuff like that. I did wonder about freaking that. I was like, so if it was freestyle, how did you remember the chorus, eh? You know what I'm saying? That has to be the only thing like you sort of might have done, you know, the first time and then you sort of like, all right, let me repeat that for the actual chorus part. But every other part, I'm going to go in and do the verse. But if you're good enough to sort of like just off top, uh, you know, go verse to verse, think of a chorus, come back in with that chorus. Because I've tried that before, and I've never been able to remember what I freaking, you know, said that first time around and shit like that. It always, you know, sort of switches. And, uh, and you know, I'll be slightly similar, but, like, you know what I mean? Changing it up. Just send something that's what's up. Shout out to e uh, Music. Sir, put down the spear. Hold on, okay, let me go in here. Yeah, what'd you guys think about freaking that one? Out of the two, though, I think out of the, the... That first one, that first one, I think, you know, is the one I would pick to, you know, put put that time, effort, and moolah into, you know? Uh, Will Smith said he's gonna skip two. Let me freaking see what you did. Let me see what you did. We also had a two song from Mr. Miles, I believe. Let me look. Let me look and take a cook. Uh, let me see which one came in first. Will Smith. Okay. 
Let me see, man. You guys are almost tied for this. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Bruh, are you freaking Cat at me? That's, that's why I need to have it wired and just keep it on the freaking side. Uh get back in there. What the where did it what did it just do? Okay. Alright, let me see. What what are you what you didn't you just said free you didn't tell me what kind and stuff like that, but you have two things in here, so I need to know what you what kind of skip you're even sending. Foist and foremost, my brother. Um because basically it's a choose one. Choose one. Choose your poison, my friend. You know what I'm saying? Uh let's go ahead and throw that. I'm floating in the air, drifting all alone in the zone, and I don't care. Please leave me alone, everybody leave me there. Yeah, I don't know what did you actually send it with the thing? Uh let me see. And then you okay, and I see yours freaking too and saw that. So we got a we got a few different ones that we gotta take care of. Uh right freaking now. Let's go ahead and load. Pick a bag, battle cry. And let me see, beats. I guess you put two because they were they were beats. You figured I would wanna rap to both. Music gotta come to the email. You gotta make sure that you send it. A lot of times, all the freaking people ain't about the business. They don't know what the hell to do or neither know what this shit is. I don't know if they are Baba Duba Gabba Laba Duba Taba. Look at my bio. You'll, you'll find the information. Also, a lot of y'all need some medicine because you have some inflammation. And when you go to the hospital, you're not sitting. A lot of people are freaking standing in a hot kitchen and also they not wishing that freaking the thing that they are freaking say is like cool but not itching it. I don't even know what they had to say but sometimes a lot of freaking people they will spit in your eye. I don't even really really think that you, I don't even know what the hell I'ma do but I wouldn't survive. I think more needs to happen with the drugs. With the drums, as a little time where I get some gum and then I chew it. I'ma throw it up in your freaking face until the moment that you say I'm stupid and people will say I don't even really know how to do shit. Also, you know I'm a dork and a doofus. People are freaking ask for freaking scripts to come to the show so we can send another song from Rufus. Sims, he'll be dope and make tight freaking shit and I don't know how the hell that they write also. When it comes to the song that they might freaking send, I don't even know why, but they like cool. Let me see, what do y'all think of this one? I thought the other one has a bonus. Said low in is lobby, man. I mean, look, it does feel like it's freshly squeezed. I will say that. It does. It does feel like it's freshly. Like, look. I've heard beats from you. I'll say this, right? I have heard better beats. I have 100% heard better beats, uh, you know what I'm saying, from you or whatnot. The sample is freaking cool, and, you know, I don't mind the sort of the structure of the drums. It's just the type that are freaking used or whatnot. It seems like stock, you know, kind of freaking shit or whatnot. Um, you know, and so find it's one of those, like, find the right drums, just replace them, uh, and you'll be freaking good or whatnot. But, you know, these kind of records are often good with that live band kind of freaking sound. Uh, and stuff like that, you know, just envision, you know, again, a Kanye West, a Nas, you know, somebody like that on that type of beat, you know what I'm saying? And see, uh, you know, how they freaking feel initially. Need that bonus. I remember this one. I remember this one. You know, freaking that I don't know what to do, but man, I'm freaking going into the sun. That attack, I don't know. No, let me stop. Let me go and stop it. A lot of times you can send a beat that is knocking. I don't even know if I need some banaka. There's a lot of times I'ma freaking hit you in the face like Baraka. I'ma slice your freaking ass like I don't even know what the hell happened, but I'm freaking listening to this shit and I know that that's tight. Also, he sent this shit last night. I'm lying. I'm 
niggas making this shit up to be rhyming All the freaking time when you send a dope freaking beat to the show I'ma do this all the time and freaking I am cool And I look up in my mind and I don't know what to do But man I over here and acting like you ain't signing I don't know what the hell I'ma do but I can't define And I am like making my thing go down It's something I wanna rap to Also I need a freaking tissue right now Because I'm about to go say at you Also when I freaking had a cat it was kinda cool To that freaking moment it was scratch you I don't even really wanna stand here like a statue Everybody freaking knows and I'm about to like rap to Every freaking beat that you said Also shout out to all of the people up in the chat Whether you are on freaking YouTube or TikTok Or all of the platforms that befriend you And all of the times that I had played Shenmue you don't know that I am also a guy that I freaking have a PlayStation 5 and a Nintendo and freaking Xbox. People know that I want to get a Death Fly. This shit is this though. This needs Twister, man. And Token or some shit. You see, Melody is freaking uh, dope to get the drums. Uh, this one, the, the drums are better on this one right here for sure. This one, I think twi- uh, Timberland would fuck with. Timberland. Everybody knows this. Once again, this one is called Freaking Battle Cry. Both feats produced by, you know what I'm saying? Same producer as Will Smith over on the Facebook side, right about freaking now, or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and, uh, you know what I'm saying? Link up, link up with a freaking there. Uh, also goes by uh, Mo Tracks, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, and, you know, big salute. Out of the two, I like this one, you know, a little bit better, just because uh, I can tell what, like, a ludicrous you know, featuring Kendrick Lamar would, you know, sort of freaking sound like. Like, this this would be that beat for sure. Kendrick Lamar and Ludacris, if we haven't had that record, this is what I would, you know, imagine it would uh, sort of freaking be. Uh, you also think about Twister for freaking sure. You can get in there. I know, like, he'd, you know, write that freaking beat uh, pretty much freaking perfectly, and I appreciate freaking that. Why do you guys think about if you like that beat or not? I just need you to... And he goes like, who is yeah, Will Smith, Facebook side. So, I make weird music, I got beats, so if you need a pin, pal me. You see me on the playground, just, yeah, I'm a dog, but I stay grounded. They call me in cause I stay clowning. Will Smith ain't ish without Jazzy Jeff, man, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. Uh, it's a different Will Smith, that's just his, like, real name and shit, you know? Somehow. Somehow, some way. Somehow, some way. Keep coming up with funky ass shit like every single day. That sounded so weird. Uh, let's see. All right. So this is the. This one right here is the uh, Jason Miles. But hold on. Okay, there we go. Silence is the first one. And then after that, uh, we have the free one that uh, was it Wayne? Who was it that sent? It? Yeah, Wayne. Wayne, yeah, you should be after the uh, after these two right freaking here with your scheme. There's a lot of freaking people in the barnyard. K dot Luda track, exactly right. That's what I'm saying, man. You put it on something like that. I'ma let the silence speak. I'm terrified to breathe. When I'm outside feeling like an outcast, outcast it. Feeling great, but it won't last. If I keep doing what I'm doing, trying to hide the fact that I ain't done with the past, can I rewind it back? I need a second to build and redevise a plan so I can figure out a way to try to understand. Why I push away the feelings that I hate the most? Instead of trying to find my demons, turn them into ghosts. I got poison in my veins, no antidote. And you can tame this beast, I'm an animal. You better run, run fast for a gain control before I run right past and reclaim the throne. I wasn't born to run, but I was born to rule. I wouldn't change a thing except for loving you. I don't know who I'm supposed to be. It feels like every single day I'm playing hide and seek with the person who I am and who I want to be. I keep fighting myself, trying to find my peace. So please don't tell me that you understand. Sympathize, try to lend a hand. I don't need your help. I'm a broken man. Past feelings made me who I am. I'm a little bit numb, but I feel the pressure. I feel all the pain divided by the effort. I feel hopeless, scared. I'll be sad forever, but then I moved on. Got stronger with everybody telling me that I ain't ever going to be the person that I want to be, that I ain't just the one to be. No! 
You just mad cause you ain't who I'm gonna be yeah, That's okay, that's okay When it comes to my dreams I don't play Nah I ain't giving up, giving in, giving all that I got Cause I know that one day I'll be king I'll be the best, I'll be king Come on, banging on my chest, this world is mine You better choose a side, I'll fight the world while you run and hide That's okay, that's okay When it comes to my dreams I don't play Nah I ain't giving up, giving in, giving all that I got Cause I know that one day I'll be king I'll be the best, I'll be king Come on, banging on my chest, this world is mine You better choose a side, I'll fight the wall while you run in Hi. Tick, tick, tock on the clock When your time's up, better not regret what you thought Cause you only get one shot, only get one chance Only get one life, live it up while you can You're gonna make mistakes, you're gonna feel the pain You're gonna grow to learn that we're different but we're all the same yeah, that's right, we're all the same it Don't matter what the color of your skin is no. Don't matter what we choose to believe in no. Just love one another, show some respect Cause one day we're all gone and there's nothing left So we kind of people, don't lie to people Just face the fact that we're all equal No need for war, no need for pain Just remember that we're different but we're all the same Yeah, Everybody trying to run from the money Cause that's all they got, not all we have Trying to right the wrong, singing all the songs About things that we wish we had It's hard, it's fake We were built to make mistakes So we can grow and learn and when it's Time to take our turn, we'll rise against the voices in our heads that say we won't and we can't. We'll show them that we can. I say we'll, we'll rise against the voices in our heads that say we won't and we can't. We'll show them that we can. Yeah, that's okay, that's okay. When it comes to my dreams, I don't play. Nah, I ain't giving up, giving in, giving all that I got. Cause I know that one day I'll be king, I'll be the best, I'll be king. Come banging on my chest, this world is mine. You better choose a side, I'll fight. The wall while you run in Open up an elevator, never been more dedicated Every single part of me is burning up, I really hate it I'm it, it, activated, celebrated, complicated Mess I, renovated, yes I'm animated I'm a joke to you, yes I generated Thoughts and thought that you left here devastated See you at my funeral, I hope you like my decorations Oh why in a nice guy, goodbye Tell me I'm wrong when I'm right Demons are the reason I'm alone inside my mind Always keep me up at night Tried to tell me I can fly And when I step right off the edge They just sit back Brand and watch me die why do I run from things? Why am I incomplete? Yeah. Why do I overthink? Wait, is it only me? No, it can't be right. I don't want to be alone in this average life. I gotta stop and take a second to assess my situation. I'm on top of all my dreams, but feel like I'm in the basement. It's okay to be complacent. No, it's not. Shut up, Jason. It's okay to be deranged when all your fears try to resurface. Just remember that they feed off all your pride to make you nervous. But that's okay. That's okay. When it comes to my dreams, I don't play. Nah, I ain't giving up, giving in, giving all way, that I got. Cause I know that one rap. day I'll be king. I'll be the we best. I'll cat. be king. Come banging on my chest. This world is mine. You better choose a side. I'll know fight the war while you run in. Hot. You say he don't even rap. But he wanted to hit up all genres, so he attempted this. I don't believe it. Cause it's so good. You sound natural within it, right? Like, as we're listening, like, it doesn't sound like it's his, you know, first rodeo into the the the, the fray. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, the just the the approach, the the actual topic, the subject matter freaking throughout the, um, you know, switching it up throughout the song, the song length. Uh, you know, like, you actually put some effort into this song more than a lot of artists, you know what I'm saying, with even Lester kind of freaking telling freaking Wood and shit like that. And, you know, they want they want the spotlight, yet they, they're they not willing to put in the same amount of freaking work. And I always just find that freaking funny, man. I'm like, look, if you guys... I, as a matter of fact, here's another freaking aspect freaking to this, right? The beat is very much like, sounds like something that like Eminem might have freaking hopped on, but like he doesn't sound like a fully influenced by Eminem kind of freaking artists and stuff like that, right? So you don't immediately go to that level and you're able to really hear him for him as well as the content that's within there, um, which is always what we want to do as a freaking artist or whatnot. So it felt real, you know what I'm saying? And, and like something I'd like to see a overall video to. Um, and, you know, just again, put in the same amount of time and effort that you did, uh, you know what I'm saying, for that uh, with the visuals and we'll see what's up. Now look at some of the scores within the freaking chat because STL was like 10 out of 10 on that five star freaking track. Um, what do you say? Yeah, that beatboxing it sounded good with the beat and stuff like that, man. Yeah, I be, I be trying to throw stuff in there. But yeah, I be I stop early sometimes 
just because I never know when the stream is going to decide to, you know, cause some latency between what I'm doing vocally and what the audio is sort of freaking doing. Because sometimes it'll do it. It'll make me feel like I'm off beat or, or something. So I like try to sometimes, you know, only just uh, attempts at certain things. And uh, we had put that in there. Appreciate you. Hold on. We got one more record from you coming up in just a moment. Let me refresh the Benelab side. We got um, give or take uh, maybe 30, 40 minutes left on the Benelab side specifically. Every other platform should be still uh, good. Uh, let me um, put this in the chat real quick just to see uh, what pops up. If anything has not a check mark by it, it usually means it's been cut we should be freaking still freaking good all right uh and what you say you said i'm gonna work on getting this out soon that's what's up do that oh uh if you were wondering maybe a lyric video kind of situation um you know one of those where you, you get to see the, the lyrics come out but if you want to show the visuals to like what you're talking about i think it would have a lot more freaking weight as well um and there's also not a link to this song and stuff like that but people are asking for the link in the chat. If you, you know, I guess he's saying that that's what he's saying. He's going to take some time to release that soon. Yes, you are on the list and stuff like that. But we are in the skip line right now. If you do not want to wait in the free line, uh, that is pretty much what the skip line is for. You can always pay at any time during the stream um, to have a certain amount of records, you know what I'm saying, played also in a back to back fashion. So it doesn't feel like you broke the bank for like just one record and stuff like that. Uh, we, so we have one more, of course, from him that we're going to throw in and then let's see. Girl Like You is that. No, Girl Like You is the second one. I thought I downloaded this one right now. I guess not. He said, yo, T-Pain, uh, just signed an artist, you know what I'm saying, from my city. His name is Nano STL. So that, that's what's up, man. Congratulations to said artist. <laughs> Girl, you're like a, girl, you're like a, girl, you're like a piece of cheese, and you're making, all for you, and you're making, give it up, wasted time for nearly six whole months, last night you called me, then you hung right up, 2 a.m., you're out there getting drunk, and every time you leave, I didn't miss you once Yeah, that's fucked up, I know this isn't love You scream and you shout, I guess you've had too much Blaming me for all the things you've done Oh, girl, you're like a Friday night on a Wednesday morning It don't make no sense I'm looking at you high as hell and I still feel down And I hate the state I'm in if only we could stop time, rewind, live in a past life Maybe we can make things work But I don't really know why we try act like we're both fine Only go and make things worse Girl, you're like a Oh, girl, you're like a sudden stop to a rolling stone You keep me from moving on And every time the sun comes up Why does it still feel dark? The part of me is dead and gone Girl, you're like a Friday night on a Wednesday morning It don't make no sense I'm looking at you high as hell And I still feel down And I hate the state I'm in if only we could stop time, rewind, live in a past life Maybe we can this make things work But bit. I don't really know why we try act like we're both fine Only go and make things worse Girl, you're like a You like something I can't think about A lot of times I gotta figure out ways that I can make a trick the house of Put it in my pocket a lot of times I don't even know what I'm gonna stop I don't know what I'm gonna Oh, girl, you're like a Friday night on a Wednesday morning I'm looking at your highest cell and I still feel down, down. Do, do, do. 
If only we could stop time, rewind, live in a past life Maybe we can make things work But I don't really know why we try Act like we're both fine Only go and make things worse Girl, you're like a Uh, so this one right here. Let's get with it. Let's get with it. So this one, uh, completely different track than the freaking last one, right? Allowing us to freaking see the you know many different genres you're universally able to freaking hop on. Uh, sounds very freaking nacho. Sounds like a record that would be out there outside of certain parts still needing to be mixed. I'll say like in the production. Um, you know, it did feel like at a certain point there needed to be, you know, we, we talk about that real live band kind of freaking sound and allowing the actual drums and stuff like that to, you know, come, come through like that. It almost had a small essence of like a country, uh, you know what I'm saying, record at that sort of like, you know, chorus freaking area and stuff like that. I just started, I started thinking about uh uh you know a country artist you know what i'm saying like male or female or something like that coming in with their sort of you know dialect and vocals same melodies that you have but just you know singing it with that country sort of like slang and adding a you know a different side to it and it like literally fit just like naturally or whatnot i don't know if anybody else sort of like heard that um but just as, as the sort of that certain part coming up that was right around the time when well, uh, when STR had said, uh, or who had said, I like that chorus a lot or something like that. One of you guys had said that, like, oh, I like that chorus a lot. Um, why is it when I look, when I want to recall back to something, I can't freaking find the freaking thing. But y'all know what it, y'all know what I, um, I'm talking about. And then there's also a small essence of, you know, a, a tiny, like, boy band kind of feel or whatnot right you know if you think about like early justin justin timberlake uh and justin bieber uh all the justins <laughs> you know what i'm saying just throw them in there uh and again what no matter regardless of how you feel about especially like bieber you know as a person or whatever you know what i'm saying like i always find it like crazy how you know just like people tend to not like you know saying justin bieber but like honestly this he can sing like at the end of the freaking day he has vocals right that's what made him so it was like the fact that usher had you know basically you know discovered and put him on a little bit you know, was kind of, you know what I'm saying, dope because it was like him seeing himself in another kid. Of course, he was not, you know, African American, but he can sing, right? And so essentially, uh, I find if you're ever being compared, like it's still a good thing. Uh, he was good enough to be able to make a song with like Chris Brown and, you know what I'm saying, hold his own and like vice versa with any sort of like other artists. Anyways, uh, what do you say? I said that. Yes, yeah, it had that little twang and some of that. So yeah, man, we you on you on the right path. You on the right path. What do you say? Like Gunna concert last year was freaking great. That's what's up. You said there's eight. Shout out to freaking Joy, KZ, Trouble, uh, to be exact. You know what I'm saying? The auto tune makes me think of Bart Baker trying to sound like her or something like that. Uh, and then Jason's uh, Miles was like, that's because it's about my ex uh, too. The, I heard some Taylor Swift. I heard some Taylor Swift in there. You know, you said, I guess I could, uh, oh yeah, that's right. I could, uh, hear, uh, uh, you know, a little, little bit of influence and stuff like that. So there's, there's a few different things in there, right? Um, and Hook, shout out to freaking Wayne, who we got next up by the way. I just need you to. Can you please just go? We all eat pizza, so. I got pizza if you need a pay pal me You see me on the playground just Yeah, I'm a dog, but I stay grounded They call me in cause I stay clowning You wanna stay down Alright, so this is a two song that he won on a previous episode as well 
anybody is wondering how some of these artists are winning and or well, obviously you know how people are paying for them and, and stuff like that but if you want to win some essentially the way that people do that is by uh you know helping us get to that freaking giveaway that we usually do at the end of every freaking episode essentially all we ever need is uh to earn up to a hundred and or 200 or 300 if we do get to 200 and 300 prizes and the amount of spins that you get are doubled and tripled meaning if the wheel that you spin lands on let's just say it's you you land on the wheel that allows you to double it right and then you land on the prize that says you win five skips essentially you'd win five no you win you'd win 10 or 15 skips right in that freaking case right or you'd spin the wheel if you're lucky enough to land on five skips or like a takeover skip or something like that, that's basically like five skips. And then you spin it again. Maybe you win like a free beat, a free mix and master, a free feature. You know what I'm saying? Different things like freaking that or whatnot. So hopefully we're able to freaking get there. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Tonight, every episode, that's pretty much what we... Uh if it's profitable, I'll part you in two See which half is marketable Operable with a dagger Carving it through your heart Then remove your bronchial tubes I'm not finna lose when a spark in his shoes Rather chop your legs off than walk in your shoes Fuck is you talking to? Talk some more See the silhouette and still reflect off your marble floor Before you can lock the door All the war, connoisseur Bondage, pure carnage, gore, bars galore Harder to follow than Amish law The llama roar like it was bread with a lion make you squeal louder than a leopard that's dying you lyric deficient so i fed you the iron every record is violent could break your neck with a light hit and wreck the alignment without putting effort behind it y'all get dumb and dumb i never read through the fine print i can sell a parrot without a fucking head to a blind kid finesse my environment it's been set in my hybrid fine tune the motor my shooters blow your heart out your chest and find you a donor i move the coca fuck a high school diploma fuck is you talking to talk some more See the silhouette and still reflect off your marble floor Before you can lock the door All the war connoisseur Bondage, pure carnage, gore, bars galore Harder to follow than Amish law What the law. fuck is you on? Respect it like the dawn So no these doubles up like I'm bomb Reach for the stars when we go to war Screaming I gotcha I, 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 I think barking like it's Chewbacca Stupid as fuck you out here running out of luck Read the burp My silhouette will make these things hit up I'm swinging a quarter ton so there's nothing left for them to pick up. Your bitch been slut. I've been in guts, been on the front line. Waking niggas up. Before Red the gimmicks and the image, I've been in it. Don't get it fitted. Your bitch all in my business. So I fucked the tramp. Sitting home with her a pussy damn. Got you bugging. My name coming in. I ain't just speaking. They fit ain't money. It hardly matters. I've been up top of the ladder. These days will crush your bones and make your face splatter. Fuck a cold. Yo, I ain't no program. I'm the whiskey. I go ham. I squeeze these throttles until that throat jam. You can get pressed in all black. Smoke a blood to the end. To the finish, we still out my silhouette moving the groove and doing the business. Mass up, can't see the image. Count numbers was more than business. The way they was moving, was looking suspicious. Just the way you talking to talk some more. See the silhouette and still reflect off your marble floor before you can lock the door. All the war connoisseur, bondage, pure carnage, gore, bars galore. Harder to follow than army yeah. law. They say a rally trending up again, never fell off. Just the industry ain't wanna fuck with him, so I ain't fuck with them. Bars like I fuck with Jim. Tricking captain, stop handcuffing them. Bring home the bacon, break bread with cheese. You egg big muffin me. <laughs> See the McGuffin is you told to get a degree. To find a good job when the goal is to live self-sufficient. Look, God, my group in nine, X9 on a shooting range talk. In a ray afraid of black niggas becoming the marks. Matter of fact, why the silhouette always dark skin? Invert the color, shoot whitey by Glock 10 MM. Leave you missing a limb like a Mr. Old Little Kim. Before the plastic surgery, motherfucker, I spit committing adultery. Come to shake it, rich won't die till I live you talking to talk some more. See the silhouette and still reflect off your marble floor before you can lock the door. All the war connoisseur, bondage, pure carnage, gore, bars galore. Harder to follow than Amish law. Out of freaking times, man, your arm is small, which is why you don't know what the hell I'm about to do. But I always freaking undo alarm at. at oh, 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 I fucked it up. Who cares? 
Uh, <laughs> yo, that wordplay, the wordplay is freaking crazy. I'll say this, man. You know, I liked the, uh, basically, even though, even though, you know, it's a, it's, it's, it's an approach. It's an approach, right? When you take the more lyrical approach then sort of like let me try to actually ride the beat and get in between the pocket in that way right you're gonna go you're gonna feed a certain listener as opposed to another one right they're gonna be those that are like nah i need you to be completely freaking on beat every step of the freaking way and sort of like again get in that freaking pocket but the lyricists the mcs the the hip-hop heads you know what i'm saying they're gonna appreciate every single bar um because it, there, it's that approach that you can rap with or without a beat. And it sounds, you know what I'm saying, decent or whatnot, right? And we have, we often have certain artists who will come to the freaking show and they will send, you know, cer certain records where they'll have that kind of approach where, you know, maybe it doesn't even feel like they're rapping to the freaking beat. This one did a better job. I'll, I'll freaking say that. And man, I'm still stuck on. There are so many lines in there. But the one that stuck out, you know, the most was that the I can sell a, 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 a parrot without a head to a blind kid. You know what I'm saying? That shit, that sh I, 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 my, my guy, my guy, my guy, you know what I'm saying? That's the type of shit that I, that I like to freaking hear and shit like that. Get wacky, get freaking crazy, do your freaking thing in there. Second verse I thought needed a little bit, uh, you know, uh, more work and, and stuff like that. Like I wasn't necessarily uh, impressed by the performance of freaking lines in there and stuff like that. But then, you know, it, it, you know, escalated a little bit as it freaking went on. Um, you know, there's there's a lot of different energies and situations in there and stuff like that. I'm still trying to figure out like what it fully is, right? You know what I'm saying? Do you consider that a uh, sort of uh, uh, a three or four horsemen kind of freaking track? You know what I'm saying? Cipher and stuff like that. And like again, Razkaz, man. You know what I'm saying? So that was another question that I did have, right? The uh, was it a Razkaz? Was it an official rap? Like, were you in a studio with him? Did, does he know that he's on the song with you kind of situation? If he's asked in an interview, will he know what, what you know, people are freaking talking about it exactly and, and, and stuff like that? Or is it one of those, like, came with the beat, you know, situations where, you know, you, you buy the feature with the, with the beat? Um, and all that. We end up having these conversations, you know, saying every now and then the sort of, you know, give you guys the ups and downs of the kind of scenarios depending on what it is. Uh, which one? Which one is it? Which one is it? Which one? They wanna know? I don't tell them no. I can tell they be telling no. That's why I don't talk on the telephone. Jet X said you said skip. I see that. Tell them I'm with Cinderella for real. What? She bad like Corella Deville. She got a job yeah. in the medical field. She won't kill yeah. you, but a relative will. I keep a bitch open like Moses did the ocean. I keep a bag wood rolling in my ass in motion, yeah. Now who you know that's doing I that? My mood is on cool, a bitch, the only thing to ruin that. She was ordinary, me, I'm more than extra. Watch me disembark a jet and hop aboard a Tesla. Going for the head, I hold they neck, I got they breast up. For the best till they dead, I'm the next stuff. I got bitches yeah. that got no cars. I got bitches that got no hearts. I got bitches right, that pick right, me wait, up. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I do got to talk about that then. You know what I'm saying? That's why I was, that's why I was asking. We will get, I, actually, I'm, I'm going to run this record back as well. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm talking over it. But I want to say it before I forget it. And the reason why, the reason why, and it's not to sort of like, you know, hate on the freaking producers that freaking do this situation. And again, it get it the benefits of those again. Beats, you get you get the package of freaking beats, and then you also get the feature from the freaking artist. The reason why it sort of doesn't make sense for a lot of cases is that there are a hundred other artists who have this same shit, right? Unless it's completely exclusive to where, right, as soon, the first person who buys it, they get it. Nobody else does. The moment that two people have a different song, maybe a different beat, but the same verse, 
Rad, you know, the artist looks dumb, and then you also kind of look dumb too because people are like, oh, you're just trying to get clout off of something that is not, you know, as original. So always, at the very least, what I try to freaking tell those people, the producers, is to create a package where we can get a Skype call with that artist you know what i'm saying so that way they know about us as the art they know about they know what the song sounds like in full like all the artists we might have got on it with us and stuff like that and if they like it they will literally they can promote it right along with us and shit like that it means nothing if i'm promoting this shit by myself and i have a song with eminem or something you know what i'm saying like literally it kind of feels you know a dumb in, in in some cases so i do want to you know, try to get you guys to be a little bit smarter about it, or at the very least, put it in when you're going to make those purchases. Ask them, ask the, ask the people, hey, can I get a Skype meeting with the, you know, what I'm saying freaking artists or something like that? Because I want them to be able to hear the song after, you know, what I'm saying I'm done with it and and stuff like that. At the end of the day, it's all about making the best record with that sort of situation. Yes. But again, it loses its sort of it's it's more of it's more like you guys are buying challenges, right? Everybody knows when there's a challenge, there's already a chorus on it, there's already a verse possibly, and all you're doing is spitting your own 16 and shit like that and adding the extra sort of, you know, uh bells and whistles or whatnot, right? So if uh, if you know for a fact other people are also gonna have the same beat, same freaking verse, it's a challenge more than it is an actual Sort of song, even if you can, you know, put it out there. They wanna know I don't tell I them just no. don't wanna. I can tell they you know be mean? telling no. That's why I, I get don't it, talk though. on the telephone. Tell them I'm unavailable. Tell them I'm with Cinderella for real. She bad like her brother Deville. She got a job yeah. in the medical field. She won't kill yeah. you, but a relative will. I keep a bitch open like Moses did the ocean. I keep a bag wood rolling in my ass and motion, yeah. Now who you know that's doing that? My mood is on cool, a bitch the only thing to ruin that She was ordinary, me I'm more than extra Watch me disembark a jet and hop aboard a Tesla Going for the head, I hold they neck, I got they breast up For the best till they dead, I'm the next stuff I got bitches that got no cars, I got bitches that got no hearts I got bitches that pick me up just to hit the lick and then drop me off They ain't never got no serial killer, might just pop off like a serial killer Catch him while he in cereal, put a hole in his body like Cheerios killer Now that you see the scenario, you feel inferior cause you ain't Really no killer. Give him that eerie imperial feeling. The hero you feeling is really the villain. A real one is rarer than one in a million. For real, man, you barely can deal with your feeling. Believe me, I came from the life and a thing in the fridge, but a bottle of ketchup. You voted for Trump, I don't give a fuck about presidents, less it's dead one. I keep a bitch open like Moses did the ocean. Keep a bag wood rolling in my ass and motion, yeah. Now who you know that's doing that? My mood is on cool, a bitch, the only thing to ruin that. She was ordinary, me, I'm more than extra Watch me disembark a jet and hop aboard a Tesla Going for the head, I hold they neck, I got they breast I'ma slide in them, slide out Drop shorty off, you know I'm smoother than lubricant Give me that money, that power Smoking and drinking and fucking for hours As you getting rich, as you going broke They always be capping, be throwing smoke I been in little mommy for hours I don't want nothing right after the shower But I got the chowder My skis, they be flipping, they whipping through powder And she put the line up her nose I want the line with nine zeros And I be whipping in and out of the city When I'm in town, she want me to come and pet her kitty And if we talking benefits, know that I'm into it She always be coming with the extra shit These niggas actions, looking for traction Think he be gripping through traffic She like the top up, whoa But she can flirty when the top down they said I look like the future when I'm sliding in The way my R3 just be gliding in I get the money, the money can't make it, I'll bring the bag She do an extra in the sheets I got an extra under the seat Now watch me just embark a jet and jump aboard a Tesla And I need the best from you, that's what I told her That's why she invested in you, dude I keep a bitch open like Moses did the ocean. I know, Keep SDM. a bag wood rolling in my ass and motion, yeah now who you know that's doing that? My mood is on cool, a bitch, the only thing to ruin that. She was ordinary, me, I'm more than extra. Watch me disembark a jet and hop aboard a Tesla. Going for the head, I hold they neck, I got they breast up. I don't know shit, there's a lot of time when the eye wanna go and hop all up in the ocean. I don't even know if I'ma go get it. There's a lot of rappers that are full fit. Figure there's a lot of time when you figure come through the show and say no hits and... Let me see. How do y'all feel about that?
So this right here, uh, the beat was a freaking banger and shit like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Something, uh, you know, that that felt freaking cool as it was going freaking in there and stuff like that. After a while, I did feel a little bit, you know, saying repetitive somewhat and kind of a little bit all over the, the place. At some point, I was like, "Wait, where are we? Where are we on the the or what side of the beat are we on?" And and shit, you know what I'm saying? And you know, then it took almost like a freestyle, you know, kind of uh, a conversation. But this one right here has still a good energy, um, uh, you know, to it. Definitely, you know what I'm saying? Of course, more, uh, you know what I'm saying? Trap centric. But I think, uh, you know, the whole point is for us to hear and, you know what I'm saying? See the capability of what you are able to do. And it is good. Why are you sorrying about that? Why are you... Why, well, who's apologizing for what, man? You know what I'm saying? Uh, no, nah, but yeah, that that right there, not a bad. <laughs> what was the... That one was a full song structure, too. I appreciate that. Three minutes and seven seconds. What kind of video would you guys do, if any? Uh, or do you feel like that's just uh, some straight for the freaking album? Give your freaking thoughts. And just to close off the conversation about the whole, you know, feature aspect and stuff like that. Again, I get it. Like, there's a there's a past version of me that would have 100, because they've had, you know, those situations for, like, Papoos, for for a lot of artists that honestly were on my, my list of, you know, bucket list freaking stuff. But what I ended up deciding was, you know, if I was gonna make a song with the artists that I've always wanted to do and stuff like that, I wanna be in the studio with them. I wanna, I want to have the experience of like, we both know we're on the song, we're working on it together, as opposed to they've already done a verse for the freaking shit, they have something, here's also a provided beat. Like I produce my freaking self. So like, I'd wanna make something and you know, really have that kind of input to, to, to it. So even if, and like even if that was an option, you know what I'm saying? Like it's stuff like that that I would sort of freaking ask to just see like what else, what can we freaking do? Even if I have to pay extra, um, so that the artist you know knows that they're on a track, and you know if anything, you know you want them to be able to promote that with you, um, so it at least can feel like it's an official kind of situation, um. Uh, otherwise, again, I, d I personally just can't feel comfortable, you know, with it again. Like, if even if, again, if the situation was, oh, yeah, we can get a verse with Eminem, but he still doesn't know that I'm on the song. Like, again, it literally doesn't have that same, like, oh, I finally made a song with it. Like, no, it's, it's not the same as, like, all the other ones that he does. He knows when he's making an album with Royce, you know what I'm saying? And so, like, I want to have that kind of experience and stuff. And he said, he said, and, but if you... You are at least right about if you can get the record out first, if you can make sure, but you have to like, then make sure you do that, right? You then have to put the money, the effort, the time into making that song freaking blow so that yours gets that exposure more than anybody everywhere. So that includes like all this, the world star kind of freaking stuff. The, the the blogs that either people read or freaking don't the email blast that kind of situation the review shows the freaking uh, uh everything that you can think of you know you have to sort of you know push that freaking out there and honestly like you know what if you wanted to like i'm not i kind of like wouldn't do it if like and and then not do a music video right so like what happens if you you want to do that and then like what do you do for the artist part if you can't actually have them in it, if they're not going to like record their part? Um, you just want to know if you have options for those kind of things. Like what happens if it, the record does go big and I can go to the Grammys and, you know, performing and stuff like that. What do you say? He said, I'll just call up, you know, send Ozzy real quick. So like and then uh, KZ was was laughing, though, because he was like he was like, great, I'll just call up. I'll just call and get a, I'll just call and get a Skype call with Marilyn Manson. It, that should be easy and shit. And I'm like, look, I'm not talking about, obviously, it'll be a little bit harder for certain freaking artists. But we are talking specifically about the producers that provide the beats that come with the artist feature. The artist knows that they're doing that situation but they don't know who are the other artists who are gonna hop on the songs ultimately, right? 
they did they want to do it for the chance uh you know to give us the chance to sort of like be able to put out the record and have a song with it but the aspect of that that falls apart is when there are several artists who have that same shit that's what i'm saying so if we're not able to get something original like at the very least have have like bro yeah pay the art pay that artist to do at least like 20 different verses or some shit or whatever you can do 20 to 50 and shit like that give them give, you know bring out the bag and shit like that if y'all serious about it right and then let us buy what's available and shit you know what i mean that way i know if i buy whatever thing i know that nobody else is gonna have that beat that freaking artist freaking verse and shit like that so i can put it out i can you know take my time freaking with it but i'll know that i have that situation It'll be connected and linked back to me, yada yada yada, and stuff uh, like that. Uh, cartoon facts. Oh yeah, cartoon video. That's a good. You, you shut me up. Uh, and if you go with the new tools and marketing, you know what I'm saying? So grab, uh, freaking songs like that. Then you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, you could also put it on a whole different beat, too. Because again, it's that it's the combination. Uh, hold on, let me go ahead and see what we got. I think we just took care of yours as well, right now. We should be back in the. Okay, so we have two different skips. We have STL with one, and then we have another paid one. I got you. Thank you for your patience. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Hold on. Let me get this in here. We got you guys. Uh, SDL, then Chris, then X, I got you. It's called Mumbling, featuring Topic and MC. Topic MC and Silly. Homie, speak up. I might need to purge. I'm fighting this surge to fuck you up for thinking you tough. I hear you mumbling, mumbling. Now, homie, what's up? Now, open your mouth. Or shut the fuck up. Now, homie, speak up. I might need to purge. I'm fighting this surge to fuck you up for thinking you tough. I hear you mumbling, mumbling. Now, homie, what's up? Mumble rappers wanna jack us, but if they really wanna top us. We sitting at the top of the food chain cipher. We the best Midwest Wu Tang. Listen up, we hot. You ain't kinda like Tupac versus you lames. MK nigga, watch my new game. Who can fuck with Baraka? Okay. You don't really wanna let the dragon out. These flows got your girlfriend flashing out. Your flows got your girlfriend passing out. And it's only cause you open up your dragon mouth. I see that you got far, but think that you not hard. Unless you went to prison, you really ain't got bars. Sick of these insidious city and pop stars. Think you illy, but you really the shittiest by far. Step into the vicinity and feel the beat. By the way, I mix you lean with a little bit of bleach. Cleaning you right out, you sipping it right now. I figured you might clown, you niggas should pipe down. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Or shut the fuck shut up. The fuck up. We hear you mumbling, mumbling. My homie, speak up. I might need to purge. I'm fighting this surge to fuck you up for thinking you tough. I hear you mumbling, mumbling. My homie, what's up? Now open your mouth. Or shut the fuck up. We hear you mumbling, mumbling. My homie, speak up. I might need to purge. I'm fighting this surge to fuck you up for thinking. Don't even rap no more, they just mumble like somebody cracked their jaw. It's a master's fault, it's what they asking for. These lines hold it up, I'ma blast the jaw. I keep the mic to my right, never pass it off. What they like ain't tight, it's ass for sure. Me and Sife getting hype, bring it back to bars. I do more than just motherfucking act the bars. I'm looking at these rappers, you write the shit. I'm looking at the masses, you like the shit. I can't understand the line you spit. They nod they head and they buy your shit. It's mumble, mumble, beat and hook. And with these two songs, it's a week of luck. Got a pot full of bars that I need to cook. And pull lines on a spot that is deep as fuck. It's like, well, Never heard a track that yeah, I done never email. came we gone. Half these rappers cheap, I think I need a fucking refund. I could do this easy, but that shit wouldn't really be fun. I came to spit bars, but I guess that's just me, son. I do 60 per song or 100 for two. homie, speak up. I might need to purge. I'm fighting this surge to fuck you up for thinking you tough. I hear you. Honestly, like Tyler Tyree could have been on this. 
topic is often a touchy subject But the truth is I couldn't give a fuck less Fuck mumble fans that are upset about the fact that I call out dumb shit I'll be running through the beat like forest They slow on speed like a tortoise I'm low on the scene but it's plain to see that my flow is just enormous Yo, let me take it back to the days when they used to blast classic rap on the radio Ways to the masses back when the radio play was a challenge to really make happen I've been rapping, looking for the right way through the maze in the sunshine state where they play for the race All I really wanna do is rap and play some tracks like a rap you saying Nowadays you can find me in the battle rap scene Reppin' MJKG's battle rap lead for the craft I don't rap for the cash or the greed Never put me in the ring with a trash MC So I'll be who I have to be In the land where an orange man has to lead I don't plan to abort my plans for the sport I just place this beat into a casket Now open your mouth, open your mouth. Or shut the fuck shut up, the fuck up. We, you mumbling, mumbling. My homie speak up I might need to purge I'm fighting the surge to fuck you up For thinking you tough I hear you Mumbling, mumbling. Homie, what's up? Mumbling. Need to talk for the mumble rappers. You can freaking listen to this song like this, and hopefully, like, none of y'all are mumble after. Cause a lot of freaking time when I don't know what the hell I'm about to do. But you know what? I am not a pastor. I will freaking tell you that I don't even know what the hell I'm about to freaking say. But I know I blast a freaking gun. Then I put the phone. Then the bum, then the bum, then the bum, then the bum. The, the, the link is in the bio. See, I know freaking what I'm on. I know, I mean, at the link. Uh, the cash app is pay, pay a dork. Cash app is pay. A, I don't even know if they're gonna, if they'll be. Uh, yeah, but cash app is that right? Freaking that pay a dork. Um, this right here, not freaking bad. You know what I'm saying? He did a freaking great job with the. Uh, well, everybody, you know what I'm saying? Essentially, did their thing. You know what I'm saying? With the overall energy, the performance. You know what I'm saying? Mix was freaking decent and, and stuff like that. As you freaking should. Like you can't make a song. Talking shit about mumble rappers and then like, you know, it be a mumble rapper as well and, and shit. It don't make sense, right? So you have to come in there with the, with the energy. You got to actually make sure you're spitting, saying, and, and, and doing some shit or whatnot that actually brings up the uh, the genre, you know what I'm saying? And, and, you know, hopefully, hopefully, like a best case scenario is just like artists hear songs like that and then they get inspired to make better freaking songs. It's that simple. Like whenever anyone is talking sort of like bad about a certain genre or style or way of sort of like recording or performing or something like that, we're not really hating ever. We just want you, like we've, listen to me right now, all right? We have had the, the kitchen sink, all right? We've had everything in the kitchen sink by this point and in the 90s it was so dope because every single artist would be completely different there were no two artists that sounded alike because if they they did they'd get blackballed they get you know they people would talk shit about them and they'd make disc records all that kind of shit right so everybody even if you were on the same label as somebody else you couldn't there could not be two tupacs there could not be two freaking master p there's one master p man one dmx one freaking you know, uh, 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 rock him one freaking like, you know, like, like there, there, there was a, a, an honor to sort of having a new style to sort of pull from a new producer to come out of the woodworks and have nice production. Swiss beats is the only Swiss beats. Like, can, can we just keep going down that freaking line? You know what I mean? Scott Storch and like Dre together forced to be reckoned with straight, straight up you know what i'm saying i'd also say like uh timberland when he gets with scott storch as well like like scott storch brings out something different in people with when he you know gets on the keys and shit like that um but like i said essentially it, it's all about the skill level that you guys decide to have on a record some of you guys will just get up and then like immediately just throw on the beat and then make whatever to the freaking song and then move on to the next song you really sound like exactly what you do when you do that you sound like you rush through a song. You don't care about the song that you're on. Sometimes you don't care about the energy that you're using, the cadence, the sort of the, the confidence that you freaking have. And you don't take the same amount of time that the big artists that a lot of you guys look up to actually freaking take. They don't just rush through freaking shit and then that's it. They go through and they'll be willing to re-record records too. 
if they have a like a sort of like first performance and shit like that, they're not gonna always just keep that. They'll go back into the record and redo things if they freaking have to to make sure that their lines are a lot freaking better and you know they won't be ridiculed and and you know it's really about trying to trying to make sure that you don't ever really say the same thing freaking twice uh in the same album the same song uh let alone just the same freaking anything you should never really say the same thing twice you should always be looking out for new sort of things to get out there um so we'll just leave it at freaking that and he said if you ain't going uh, to compare that rapper uh, with Eminem, you know what I'm saying? Well, freaking does. Why are you? Why are you freaking? Uh, why does that need to be a freaking thing and shit like that right now? Um, I did not hear Eminem while I was listening to that shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, just because a rapper may be in the Caucasian descent does not mean they're suddenly Eminem. I don't look at it like that. Uh, I need that very Eminem specifically. All right. He likes to get in as a lyricist, as an MC, talk shit while being a little bit funny and quirky all at the same time. I didn't hear funny and quirky with this freaking record like that. You know what I'm saying? There wasn't like tremendous moments where I'm laughing my ass off and, and oh, that's, he's crazy. He, he beat him with a with a, a stapler, with a uh, 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 whatever. Anyways, big figure salute. Uh, let me see what you say. You know what I'm saying? Knowing all of those guys freaking since high school. Main artist is also the lead singer of a rock man. That's what's up. I know diamonds are the things that you wish that you had, but homie. I'm, I'm, go. I'm playing old school games where it's all up for grabs. You know me. Speaking of. We got Jim X. All right, we got Gen X coming up freaking next right now. Simply a one song, get that in there. We are three song, three skips away from hitting that first tier giveaway. Uh, and whoever specifically sends a skip that gets us uh, to 100, they will get to spin the giveaway wheel without having to wait till the end of tonight's stream. I think I've taken too many drugs and I'm in another universe and I was trying to get buzzed in a studio and do a verse, but now I'm seeing an image of Coolio on Jupiter. If I was in the hospital, I probably want to do the nurse. Out of all 80s movies, I'm watching Ferris Bueller first. I'll walk right up to a bully and be like, homie, do your worst. If you don't got any gas, a freaking Razor scooter works. This one ain't for the kitty, so Super Steve, you can curse. I really I'm wanna grow up, cause I don't wanna go down. Yeah. Someday I'm gonna blow up, they love it how my flow sounds. Yeah. You hate on me, but so what? I know you wanna throw down, yeah. but I just wanna throw up. Someone give me a bow now. Yeah. I just wanna be a doodle chillin', but I'm always dealing with the madness. Yeah. I just wanna be up on the beach, up in the white, chillin' with a bad bitch. Yeah. I just wanna live up in the city where they hear me and they go bananas. Yeah. I just wanna hear the world and every little girl is dealing with a sadness. Yeah. I wasn't nice in class I would always like to laugh And always get in trouble from my teachers Cause I'm writing raps my bad. Vanilla ice was trash I'm never on a righteous path nope. I throw a diaper at my wife And then get sliced in half Alrighty then, man I'm back in the freaking cusp right now Roll on my grave Gen X she said, roll out, she said, roll out, she said, roll out, roll out, roll out, yeah, go to my grave, roll out, roll out, yeah, go to my grave, yeah, yeah, look at that face, uh, got me dismayed, yeah, when you look at my eyes, you got me out of the chase, out of my misery, so I put on some shades, yeah, these bitches be killing me, mm, stop with a steak, Pain, bitch, stains, pain. 
How do y'all feel about picking that right there? Give it one to ten. One to freaking ten. There's a lot of freaking kids who just really want a freaking friend in the letter line. Um, all right, so I see why you were a little concerned. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We're, trying, we're kind of being put in that freaking category or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to say this, right? There were some things that I couldn't hear. There were some things that I could hear, right? And elements that I thought, you know, were nice with the freaking energy and melody and sort of where you were going. Then there were some, again, where I couldn't hear things. And that's where sort of like it fell apart, right? And in some parts of the mix where there's just way too much going on with both the uh the the production and a lot of the synths and things like that that are going on at the same time that you're also doing your thing vocally with uh your vocals at the end of the dollar and then you have at the same time the ad libs doing something in the background and shit like that it's way too many things all at the same time to sort of try to pay attention to without feeling like it's just sensory overload so uh rule number one is you never need to add ad libs uh if like you're like add your ad libs in between your 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 verses and stuff like that like if you stop to take a breath for a second and you know what i'm saying and that what i did with it too uh and then let me let me uh you know what i'm saying in between the things are where it's okay to have freaking something or whatnot. But if you keep a whole thing going and stretching it out, and then you have it almost at the same level as the main vocals, like it's just gonna be way too much. So if you're gonna have what you did in there as an ad lib, turn it down tremendously, have it filtered so that we can hear it, but like, you know, uh, subtly, um, and you know, a certain amount of delay, reverb kind of situation. Again, you just gotta make it sound freaking good. But sometimes it would just sound like there's just like way too much, you know what I'm saying, going on within there. Um, but yeah, I think there's potential for getting to this. This wasn't like an all, uh, uh, you know, like let me hit a dork and don't play that immediately and shit like that. Uh, you know, I don't know how, uh, outside of if we hadn't came to it, you know, before the last record and if it was also in like the free line, I don't know what we would have sort of, you know, felt about it. I might have hit a dork and don't play that, you know what I'm saying, due to the, due to the mix. Um, but I do think that there was, uh, you know, potential freaking in there. Just, you know, do what you got to freaking do to get this to a more prominent freaking level. Please do not re release it on Spotify until you get the proper mix first, because I'm just going to say the same thing, regardless of the platform that is freaking on until the mix is right. Like we basically should hear your vocals on any record and feel like I like his vocals. You know what I mean? And that's with that's with anybody. We should always be we should always be listening or be able to listen to any of the records that we hear and forget that we are in a review show, right? So the moment that something happens and you go, "Oh, that's too loud. That's too low. What did he say? Uh, oh, he messed up there. He was off beat." Or da da da, whatever. Any kind of mistake that happens that takes us out of the fact that, you know, all you know, the song is complete or whatever. You know, you need to go back in and make sure you fix those. That's exactly what review shows, you know what I'm saying, are really good for, you know, here, having other people sort of like point out our mistakes and then, you know, figuring out the way to fix them and then, you know, re-sending uh, it back in to see if we did the freaking job or whatnot. Um, but yeah, you know what I'm saying? What do you say? Big Bird lyrically changed. Yeah, you got to send it to my email, my brother. Nine out of freaking 10 from STL. Hold on, son brought the uh, energy, you know what I'm saying, it's 12. Uh, what do you say? Um, but yeah, you said it was unreleased. So whatever tips you guys are going to have, share to help out, man. I went to uh, Bad Lab, I uh, cut off after that four hour mark and stuff like that, but we're going to keep everything else freaking up and stuff like that as we roll through. We just make sure that we don't have another... Uh, skip that we need to take care of and we'll jump back in the free line for you guys in case you guys do want to send a skip yourself Yo, nonsense and sir mike this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes birdman will talk to an actual bird like i'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite don't make me put you or actual worms lie don't like my old shit i'm thinking you were high like me when i'm looking down at a bird's eye view when i'm cool better act like you surprised all right let's get back into it did i actually load up the record turn it up galactic
Turn it up, turn it up. There's Galactic Vibes and Robbie. Turn it up, turn it up. Produced by Tosh. Turn it up, turn it up. But there's Turn a lot it up like the flowers, so I chew my blooming in the moonlight. It's music, medicine, tuned to the moving sounds on new heights. Scan horizons when we vibe and see ourselves in true light. High alignment on assignment, we can only do right. Humans on the dance floor, ancient plays and ritual. It's fluid, druid, stands core. Patience and the mystical, moving true with a fist is full. Can't resist the pull, the force and trip Heads are spinning, sick of gold and intervals. Then an eye scan upon the core of over, over, yell. It's all about it. Turn it up and pull the chalice. Wonderland, the Alice talents dripping down the rabbit hole. I found a balance. This love is so bountiful. I found it now, no doubt about it. So what you feeling when we turn it up? We serve it up. This earnest love you never heard of us. Still catch a certain buzz. Feel Honestly, like a man. Of okay. Copernicus and leave you spinning like a dervish does. Yeah. Honestly, that song is I. You know what I mean? It's I. I like the beat probably the most. Uh, let's just hit a clap for a second. Okay, there we go. Um, <laughs> it was it was this I. There was something. There was something. And again, I don't mean this in the wrong way, but you know, there was just something like slightly corny about it at first and and stuff. It didn't feel like. One of those records you would have put this much sort of like time into for like both of the vi like you put a lot of effort like the the video is great quality you have backup dancers and shit like you know what I mean you have a whole thing but I personally probably wouldn't have chosen that song to do that kind of video freaking too and shit like that like I get it it's supposed to be something that's might maybe give or take give give or take like hype and shit like that because you're saying yo turn it up you know what I mean but like you can't make a situation freaking happen and shit like that I don't I don't predict that the uh, that people react the way that that you know I think we'd want them to 
uh, with this song and shit like that. Like, I feel like you guys would be up there rapping. You guys have whatever kind of energy for you to have and sing your song and stuff like that. But, like, I feel like people would be standing still with this one just because the beat is a little bit freaking, you know, different. I feel like I liked it because it was, like, almost video gamey and, you know, something in there, you know, reminded me of, of, of something. But uh yeah i mean and your raps weren't freaking not good either like i kind of would if it was me i would produce a different production completely around y'all vocals right you know what i'm saying you gotta have the same video do whatever you gotta freaking do or whatnot but i would produce a different beat and again it's not that i didn't like the beat i didn't like sort of like what you guys had specifically sort of like spit freaking to it but i could hear you know the what you were saying sort of like you know what if it was on this or freaking this i think uh you know people initially would freaking rock with it in that freaking way so whatever you feel uh do what you do and do what you do all right we got jam dog sessions finally come up in here let's go back in the freaking cuss Let's keep it rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Just send in, welcome, welcome, welcome. I am glad. How did you, uh, how did you send it? All of the time when I don't even know what to do But you know what, I've ended my freaking life In a freaking like video game, not in real life I don't know what I'm saying, but all the freaking time When I be freaking telling you that you think that You think that I'm playing with all of this shit that I talk about All of the time when you doing things Everybody knows that I'm, no, I'm not gonna rap Um What I was gonna say was How did you know where to send it? Cause some people Have no idea and they just end up requesting their song in the chat like that's how you do it. I'm just wondering if you got to see the uh, the notification thing. Or... I have no idea of the actual freaking time frame and stuff like that. Guys, it's wherever. And however, again, it, I could say there's a certain amount of freaking people before whatever the, the submission is, but if people are coming through and sending skips, it takes that out of commission until we get back to the free line. So it, it's harder to freaking literally let you know how much time or anything like that. I remember this beat from you, man. I remember this beat from you. People popping up like, bro, this beat is cool. Matter of fact, you know what? There's a like little kid somewhere always getting beat in school. I don't even know what the hell the freak can do, but I'm about to eat my shoe. Cause all of the shit that I'm talking, I don't know where the heck that I am going, but all of this shit that I'm walking, y'all freaking over here acting like y'all Christopher Walken. And all the times when I know, I don't even know if I'ma tell y'all freaking about the door that I have in the background. You were thinking it's barking and asking the question about. Let me stop. Chill out the stream. Appreciate you, man. This is not the time. So we are streaming live on all platforms right freaking now. And there's a, a different view for like the, you know, the YouTube and, and you know, Twitch, you know, Band Lab, freaking, uh, Facebook, freaking Sides, all that good stuff. You guys are the only one with these sort of like straight up freaking close can even see. Like, I think nobody else really gets to see the keyboard that we are always freaking typing on. You know what I'm saying? You guys get that view at the very least. Uh, okay, so in terms of the uh, production, you know what I'm saying? Not bad. That definitely felt like some actual dope kind of like waiting music. As a matter of fact, if you're on the uh, YouTube, Twitch side, all that freaking good stuff right now, see how this freaking sounds as one of these or whatnot. If we were starting this show and this was simply a beat that we, that we played as we were doing such a thing, how did that feel? Yeah, I lose the chance when I get hit. See, senor, uh, 
but yeah, like I, again, I think it sounds like you know perfect sort of like startup music as you're sort of like waiting for the stream uh, to freaking start. You can also get a you know more pop centric kind of freaking artist freaking in there. Uh, you know, what I'm saying doing their thing. I think you know alternative rock. You could also have that more melodic emo centric. You know, kind of freaking artist, auto tune or melodyne kind of situation. I can freaking see and hear that in there. Uh, and lastly, a more in between Drake, Cole, and uh, Jay Sean kind of freaking artist or whatnot. I can freaking get in there and stuff like that. I played your song. No, not yet. We are still moving through the free line right now. And so like that, we've had to take care of, you know what I'm saying, quite a few freaking skips throughout. And we are, of course, back in the. Free line, you know what I'm saying? Running freaking through your freaking things and stuff like that. Of course, to every artist such as yourself, man. Good luck as we go through. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Continue to be freaking patient. And, you know, again, if you don't want to wait, that is pretty much what these skips are often for and will help you just immediately get played without having to wait. We got little tracks right out freaking right now with Wake Up. When to ten in the chat, any and all feedback is welcome. All genres are accepted. Hey, yo, Slay, is that you? Every day, yeah, I just wake up, cold sweats in the mind, my heart body anxious. Yeah, I need it, yeah, yeah, I need it. Them drugs in my body, yeah, I need them. Yeah, I ain't got my gun on my side of me. Yeah, I'm gonna do this, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing right now. I just can't do all this shit right now. Don't with everything with my life, but these drugs, man. So this one needs a mix and uh, I did not like the energy, uh, you know what I'm saying, how the auto-tune was used or the effects or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? We're just gonna get straight to the freaking point with this one right here. Uh, it felt like you were bored, depressed, you know what I'm saying? Which, you know, by all means, if it is a more of a depression kind of situation and a lot of you guys make records to sort of, you know, to, to make sense of what a lot of you guys freaking go through, by all means, like, you know, make what what you need to, but do know that, um, you know, you need it to, you need a certain amount of energy to sort of resonate with the crowd and stuff like that. Because if you're too freaking low, and then you're also kind of like in and out of, you know, slurring certain freaking words, not everybody's gonna be able to understand what you're freaking saying. So they won't know if they can relate to the actual song. Um, and it, again, it just sounded like you were kind of freaking bored with it. And if you're bored, we're going to be bored. Uh, and so I will usually freaking hit that button, cut the freaking song freaking early. Um, uh, but you can, uh, always simply go back in, do another performance, see, uh, how that one freaking plays. And then, um, you know, hopefully, uh, it will be, uh, hopefully it'll be another, uh, you know, a better situation, I think, next time. Uh, let me see what you guys are going to talk about it. Again, the chat doesn't have to always agree in most cases uh, and vice versa. Uh, you know, give, give, give yo freaking dance, right? You know what I'm saying? Beat. No, beat was freaking cool, but like, it was all uh, right, man. You know what I'm saying? You don't pay. But I always think about it, I, I always think about it like this. Every time we're playing an artist on the show, all you ever need to ask yourself is, would I pay for this artist in any aspect? Would I pay a dollar for the song I'm listening to? Would I pay up to 60 to potentially $100 to see this artist live performing this exact song at a show, at a really good venue, you know what I'm saying? But it's still that artist and just that song that we're freaking going to freaking see and then that's it. Uh, would I freaking pay to get to feature that artist based on that freaking song on a, another freaking song and stuff like that? That's what takes us to these certain freaking places and really, 
you know, gauging how good the songs are that we're listening to and stuff like that. You know, the better the artist, the better the recording, the better the uh, performance from you on it and the selection of, you know, production and all that good stuff, you know, the more people are actually going to be willing to actually pay for those situations. Let alone with the, you know, you're, you're always competing for people's time. That's a currency right now. Just simply having somebody sit down and listen to your song for, you know, two to three freaking minutes and care about it enough to want to hit the like button, share it and stuff like freaking that. And, and you know, only the, you know, I guess the the best of the best, you know, and, and performances can sort of freaking get there. You know, we'll always let you know what we're hearing and, you know, you can, you know, try again always to see if you always uh, can make and do something better we'll go ahead and get back in the line again we got never mind that's a vera no money this is joy with a beat i think i think joy Was random. Once again, I asked the question. What is that? How sway? Negative. Oh my gosh, man. Listen, Joy, we love you, but I also gotta hit that. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, hey. Uh, my, my bad. Uh, listen, this right here, it just kind of like felt like a lot of random parts put together or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? If you're dragging and dropping, you know. Uh, sequence of a freaking beat or something like that, you know, into a, a program, you know, you got to quantize things, make sure that things are actually on beat and feel like it's a part of the same beat or whatnot, because you can't just drag any uh, pair of, you know, uh, or sequence of freaking drums into any kind of thing without making sure that it matches up, you know what I'm saying, beat wise. Um, you know, you need the right combination of sounds if you're going to do the more abstract kind of uh, way of freaking producing. I've heard better situations from you and stuff like that, so I know what you're capable of. But this one right here, honestly, was not it or whatnot. If I have to think about the aspect of, again, paying to see you sort of like, you know, perform this one, you know, it gives me that awkward eye. Um... And I'm like kind of like mentally confused on what what it's supposed to be, you know what I'm saying? Uh, at least from from you or whatnot. You know, you can give your own thoughts, your own thoughts in mind. Big freaking salute. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Freaking to that though. Oh my freaking gosh, can I freaking give me a second on the TikTok side? I gotta remove my thing so I can load up my thing on this side come on my brother all right and, oh my gosh i'm so freaking sorry sorry about that man i was trying to unplug bro it's two in the morning fell asleep and i'm yawning waking up on the lawn i'm seeing blue and orange people follow me to school and copy me until i stopped and put my music on i'm just crawling like a zombie gnawing on a nazi probably in his uniform born identity homie you've been warned my brain is so like a used <laughs> theo we got you up theo Mackey, let's go let's go right down Matter of fact, a lot of things I say that I really I gotta figure right now. I don't even really know. Oh, let me freaking see. Mr. Theo, I would have you know that when you eat a slice of chicken, 
I almost forgot I have chicken in the thing. This is something that God gave me when I was at my lowest point to let me know that everything that I want and need was in His Word. And in case you don't have your Bible, listen to this. Everything you need is in God's Word. Such a great freaking song, man. Such an amazing record, man. You know, the power of what a choir can freaking do. And, you know, a lot of people get together to, you know, lend their voice to a, you know, a, a single cause. Um, and, you know, you need that sort of, you know, that Kirk Franklin, um, you know, like conductor, uh, essentially, right? To sort of, you know, guide the 
uh, the conversation, if you will, as you go through that freaking song, right? And and it's like you know, acting as you know, pastor, and um, you know, it's 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 definitely a a genre that you know is always full of freaking talent, man. Let's not get it freaking twisted, man. We had two artists on um, either X Factor or The Voice that I remember. Both of them were like church raised, and. <laughs> If you guys remember which one I was, t- it was a long time ago. It was two African American sort of artists. I think one might have been like a little bit more yeah, bald headed. The other one you reminded me more of Tank or something like that. But they were church raised, and they were they had to do like the the sort of battle where they you know they both had to you know go back and forth and and they were my gosh man just like the it, every time they'd have the best sort of you know melodies and stuff like that it was very hard to choose either one uh in that round that they freaking did and you know it reminds you just the the power of you know the human voice now this again it sounds like a proper you know gospel record you know what i'm saying um and uh you know i i definitely always think about a music video kind of situation potentially when i hear this song um you know whether it's just you guys performing the song and then it is being filmed professionally uh or one of those where it's both sort of you and the choir uh you know singing and, and performing the freaking song but then equally there's a story to tell right so you didn't start having the footage of, you know, sort of people going through situations and, you know, coming to freaking God to really, you know, get things freaking right and, and knowing that they're not alone. Yeah, you know, like, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, so big freaking salute to that. And of course, you know, Elephant in the Room, it does sound very much like the main song, the main theme song, the, the you know, one of the classic Pokemon uh, kind of freaking things or whatever. It's not, it's not completely close, but, uh, just the aspect that they use, like, some of the same, like, instruments and stuff like that, it, it just, it brings that sort of, like, nostalgia figure in there. So if you ever hear people, you know, talking about, you know, uh, Pokemon or something like that, it's 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 simply because of freaking that. Um, and honestly, there's an element of that. Like, you could sort of, you either sort of, you know, you try to fight against and, like, just kind of you know feel a way about it or you embrace it and you go you know what let's (laughs) let's make a like you know pokemon in church kind of you know situation or whatnot where we like find or make footage where we do it but uh, honestly i don't know and now like it's going to be interesting to see how the community would even take something like that right like the actual creator of uh, no, never mind. It's Dragon Ball Z. We're talking about some some different. Never mind. Yep. Go ahead and do it. <laughs> but yeah, Pikachu. Pikachu right at the end. Like it, all the all the performance, and then Pikachu just pops up out of the of, out of the bottom of the choir. Pikachu. <laughs> And then, you know what I'm saying? And just shocks Ash. And then, you know, you get on to the next freaking video. Anyways, big freaking salute. Good job, good job, good job, man. All right, we got Gabriella Jacobs up freaking next. We're going to see what you got. We're going to see what you got. Yeah, mama. Uh, would you say, yeah, good son. Uh, appreciate you. STL's like freaking yes, man. I uh, got to catch them Pokemon. Pokemon. Pikachu! I thought you were a goner! It's a Pikachu! It is not a goner! Let me see. I already know. I know Pikachu can't talk, really, for real. You can do anything. But still. A Pikachu! Hey, Pikachu, listen to this! I don't know. Y'all rap. Y'all so slow. I think this is a beat. I think this is a beat. I think this is a beat. 
I really think this is something fast. A lot of freaky people want to whip your ass. A lot of times I want to dig up in the trash, but I don't because I don't need to do diet. Every time that I walk up in the street, I don't know why the hell I'm about to get the heat, but every time I die, really try to rap though. One at a time, thinking people to go fast, slow, and you don't even really know about freaking people or eat too much, then you call them a fast, so freaking I don't know if I need me a lasso, but freaking shout out to the people who rap so freaking cool, freaking that when you freaking go in the thing and you freaking get up in the morning and get your shoes and <gasps> when I had to breathe, shout out to the freaking who left who had to leave, that's me, the matter of fact, master P, and also freaking got the whole master key to the freaking house, to the vegan, the vegan down, with the vegan, the vegan up with the vegan in your heart, and your out. <laughs> I didn't say anything. That's too fast. Uh. I know your mom and dad and you, granny and your big and sister and your cousin and your. I don't know how I do that. So so good. I'm so confused with that. How the heck can I change my voice shit, man? Matter of fact, man, I need a whole joystick so I can freaking make sure I enjoy this game. I'm about to freaking play, but you know my name. It's freaking nonsense. Also, when it comes to the fact that I ain't got a conscience, also freaking I know I ain't got a bomb threat to make people don't freaking say that Two Face was cool, but freaking I don't know who to hate. Also, when I freaking freestyle, they like you great, and also freaking you eat two plates when it comes to the thing that you do. do, do, do. And in fact, shout out to the people who came to the show Tuesday. It's Wednesday right now. I'm about to sit down and shout out to the freaking people who talk of their shit. Uh, what do you say? Uh, what do you say? Yeah, can't hate on the spiritual vibes. Uh, yeah. That's why I sit to see what you think. A lot of people know that you drink. I don't know how. Who sings like that so I can like make a reference song with this shit and then send that to them and then you know what I'm saying? We gonna double it up. We gonna double it up, Gabrielle, okay? Uh, you know, but no, but that was actually really good production and stuff like that. You know, if it was to be for like a rapper and shit like that, man, you know what I'm saying? Most rappers would need it a little bit freaking slower for sure. Uh, singer can get on it, you know, easy peasy, fresh and squeezy. You know what I'm saying? You want that R&B soul you know, neo soul kind of bass artist. Uh, I, I was gonna say Abracadabra, but uh, Erica Badu would be <laughs> would be would be dope on it. How the, how the hell did my did my mind want to say Abracadabra? Abracadabra. All right, let me uh get let me know who you, who would y'all put on that man? Who is your choice on that production? Tribe Conquest. J. Cole I can't do a good J. Cole Can't do a good J. Cole People be like, y'all only like hip hop Cause they old, listen I always be talking about all of this shit All of the artists be all like, all the time with it Hollow dick, we pick a chicken wobble and tent. Then I figure be like, all oh, of the shit. This is cool, but also figures, man, all of these artists are shit. First of all, big figure salute. Let's go ahead and go into the figure next one. Let me see what y'all saying. Say, hey, this me and shit like that. It is indeed you. And uh it was amazing thing and whatnot. Did the whole thing, you know what I'm saying? Go rewind that. Go rewind that on YouTube. Go rewind that. Yeah, but that 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 do. I don't know. Go on YouTube right now. You know what I'm saying? So you can rewind you can rewind that whole uh freaking shit but yeah that shit is freaking dope you definitely need to uh plop that toward a you know erica badu freaking type as i was freaking saying it is an amazing it's a little bit fast for like a rapper kind of situation but way more suited for you know singer soul you know what i'm saying kind of freaking thing like that uh and then if you slowed it down man you know what i'm saying uh, but let's freaking see what we got, man. RB Productions this time. We got a lot of producers in this section. Hey! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. RB Productions with time. Flat beat, flat beat, flat beat, flat beat. Uh. 
right. strobe light settings on the freaking thing i could have put that on while i was on like listen it ain't rave it ain't rave music it is not rave music without that freaking we need that shit first hold on man hold on let me put that up let me put that thing on we're gonna have to fix the freaking setting after and shit like that but you know we can't we can't go through that without the official yo there's a lot of nice colors freaking in here ah it hurts every freaking time Hold on, let's go to the... Okay, so the pacifier. Hold on, said the pacifier. Okay, can you stop that? Free is like I promise I never had a seizure, but like to be freaking honest, man, I wouldn't put it past me being able to freaking get that. What do you say, green for the four twenty, man? We almost freaking there and stuff like that. We almost freaking there. When is uh, how many days have we got till four twenty? Today is the 10th, so 10 days from freaking now, and you know what I'm saying, we rocking with it, man, you know what I'm saying, and look, if you celebrate, if you part freaking take, uh, enjoy yourselves, you know me, I will try my best to uh, stream on 420, we will, you know, celebrate together, uh, if, I, if, if I'm lucky enough, uh, what day is 420 on, let me see that, I'm hoping that gets a Saturday or something like that, oh! <laughs> Sorry, it's a Saturday, so listen, no excuses. I gotta, I gotta do it, and I'll, I'll be streaming at 4:20 my time PDT. Uh, pop up, enjoy. 
Hopefully, now look, uh, I will be looking from today on on until 420 and 420. You know what I'm saying? If you guys got good 420 centric vibes, all that kind of stuff, man, we want to try to get a little bit of a playlist going that we can, you know, run uh, at some point, you know what I'm saying, throughout the day and stuff like that. And so. Divide, multiply, transition. Yeah. Digital molecular transmission. Yeah. Destroy, manifest, transform. Yeah. Daredevil, Magneto, and Thor. Whoa. DMT's a deep majority test. Truth. Designed by Dakotas of the Moorish text. I dance so majestic in the twilight. Uh. I'm DMT laced, drinking my time. And then the vibes, come on with them, come on. Here. My time, yes, there you shine. go. The essence of love when I'm writing these rhymes to show you that lyrics is fine. When they be coming from I, I, one of a kind, never go blind. Give me your time. Hold on, where are the weed centric time? records, mind. right? Hold, Hold on. on. Please, this is the sign. No ceiling for me. We have... like a prime. Purpose is plain, rare. Though it might feel I'm insane. Hold on. Like on my queen, love, changing her name. Vision unchanged. Perfect approach is my aim. Part of my flame. I be the one without chains. I ain't no slave. I mean, the one without chains. Because uh, we do have, um, just to give you even more, like, because those were just, those, you know, one was a vibe and shit like that. But. Oh, yeah. But. But, but, but. It's raining outside. Just give it a sampler. Oh, it's fucking pouring. Man, we gotta stay inside. It's gonna be boring. Man. What you wanna do? I'm gonna just give you a sampler know, real quick. What you thinking? Of a few I mean, that I have guess made, we can use our imagination. That have made the playlist. <laughs> All right. What if I had superhuman powers? I was strong like the whole or fast as the flag. What if? Imagine if I had a billion dollars. I was richer than T'Challa, Batman, and Iron Man. Cha-ching. Me being a power ranger whenever I said change, I was mighty more for the time. Maybe I'm just really smoked out, no doubt, but I'm using my Continue back on in the free line as we freaking gear freaking up and something like that. I'm gonna uh, restart the uh, TikTok side in just a freaking moment or whatnot. So if uh, you get kicked out right now, just come on freaking back. We will bring you guys back in. Uh, see you in a moment. Let me see. Where are you? Excuse me. Uh, I didn't even read what it had just said. What did it say? What did it say? Bruh. Uh, okay. Let's get back in here. Back up in it. Matter of fact, I don't even think that I actually freaking tell all of your freaking that y'all could rap with me. Uh, Eric Stiffler, is it 90? 93. With six? I mean, both are numbers. 
That's why I love it when you dance, baby. What your plans is? Bottles of that That's not what I thought we were gonna hear right now. So high right now on Mars, I don't think I'm landing. Gas up in the woods, ain't going camping. She thick as a landing lace, she do that shit with no hands. She still got some bands to make. I turn to a fan, hit me up, baby, case you know Japan. See. She say I'm wavy, the shit is so ran. Rap, can't say that he get a fan. So how you might get you a tan? You got me stuck trying to stick to my plan. Hard I see no puck, I won't get tricked but again. Do not need love, do not need drugs, but I'm tripping again. No luggage, I'm bugging, I'm sipping again. Love when we fuck, she throw fits when I'm in. Make that ass jump just like Vince with no tank. You cannot see who is in if you squint. Paper my pockets, no lint. I'm in the air like a blimp. Tire phone, my coach, I'm rich. Dirty my water. Like Flint, you see the pain in my limb. I'm on that tree like a chin. Gonna have to laugh if I pick it. Or I said I'm kinda half and half. Gotta have it half with this. There's a lot of time when you figure to hear a dope beat kinda like this, and you have to spend a lot of time, and you gotta wanna make sure there's a lot of time when you gotta take for Sometimes figure artists to get up on a figure beat and half of them figure to get on with a fake flow. Also, I don't wanna tell all of y'all figure right now that I'm thankful. Cause people know if you got a booty all up in my face, I'ma spank yo. Shit, matter of fact, acid, tits, matter of fact, you just need to stop listening to this song and pour acid quick in your ear and acid, shit, matter of fact, this is kinda cool, but then not, it's whacking shit, not really, it's kinda got potential, sometimes figuring I think I've got you into freaking songs, I don't even know what to do, but you know what Tupac is, <laughs> nah, big, big, into the, listen, 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 uh, give your thoughts, Give your thoughts. Give your thoughts uh, to that song right there. Uh, what did I freaking think of essentially, man? Like, the beat is freaking dope, right? That's, uh, of course, as of right now, the best freaking part of it, right? You had some melodies within there and stuff like that, uh, which weren't necessarily freaking bad, but it did feel like there was something freaking missing, right? Like, you stopped short of finishing the song and you just kind of let the beat ride out by itself and do its own freaking thing. Good for me, but not for the actual freaking song itself. And uh, this is something that, like, honestly, it's it's close to something that if you were to get, a, like, a feature from Twister or something like that, like, he'd definitely uh, probably hop on there because I can imagine twister you know uh and his freaking style sort of like getting on there but i did feel like there's still more to more that needs to be done from you before it gets to that you know complete um you know complete song sort of like feel and stuff like that something that again we all want to really be a part of and you know embrace and freaking that way uh you know you guys give your freaking overall freaking thoughts one to ten any and all feedback is welcome if you are new to the freaking show you can send your music in to the show by sending it into my email it's that dorky review show at gmail.com we're streaming live right now at the same time across all platforms from youtube tiktok uh freaking facebook Twitch, you know what I'm saying? You name it, we freaking got it and stuff like that. Fan Lab, I did take off, but we're usually streaming uh, via freaking them. Um, and all that freaking good stuff and stuff like that. But yeah, let's go ahead and head back in the free line for you guys and stuff like that. Uh, again, we rate everything on a 1 to 10 scale. Sprite was freaking good. Welcome back, of course. Welcome back. Welcome back, man. You know what I'm saying? Sprite, what is your take on the Cole Kendrick beef situations? Let's talk hip hop real quick, man. I gotta get your info, Mason and Revis. Featuring Young Go. Serious. Uh, 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 uh
bottom, I know you witnessed it too. And I gotta keep my composure, they wanna see me fall through. But fuck that, I'ma keep it firing like ARs. Go against all odds for all of mine, bitch. I lay yours, I bring the chaos. They try to put me in the cage, they turn me into a beast. Can't ride back home in my zone. See no crease in my teeth, still got my grills though. Niggas wanna be weirdos, freeze them up like a scarecrow. Put them up in the airlobe. I'm they looking at my locs twice when they see us bang. Give a damn who watch you keep on doing my thing, I gotta They looking at my locs twice when they see us bang Yeah, if you know, you know that young rivers came from the gang, I'm so serious To share. Gotta stay focused in these serious times. Learn from the struggle, make me humble, but the curious mind. Even the genius asked questions, I was geared to be wise. Still, all the pain I held inside would put a tear in their eye. In my adolescence, taking losses like it was bad investments, having stressing. All the sorrow turned into bad aggression. Grab a weapon, fuck some more, robbing niggas. That was the cash selection. Quick draw, die in a half a second. School of the slum, in the city of Lum. When niggas grew up full of hatred, ain't no pity for none. But I'ma always love it though, cause that's the city I'm from. All I need is half a billy, then for really I'm done, I gotta Hey, rugged town, I grew up off of the sound Yeah, listen, you gotta be down, ain't no messing around, I gotta Yeah, look it, we top down, ain't no stopping this now Uh, indie music Really, I hold the crown, ain't no messing around So if you got all genres, all genres, but it has to be indie music Nothing that's on the the radio officially kind of stuff. So do not send. So don't send a record like rapping on a Drake beat, and don't send Drake basically to the show. That's that's you know the best way I can really like help you guys freaking see that. Uh, but big for the look. But the the goal I guess is to see how close you guys can get to records that we would hear out there, right? When we are listening to you guys as artists, um, you know, we should not hear or feel like we're listening to a artist who kind of just started and and doesn't have, you know what I'm saying, confidence or know like what where they're freaking going. Like we should hear the confidence, the quality, everything, you know what I'm saying, and feel like the song, the artist is out, like you have a team behind you. And sometimes it's not even the case. Like they don't have a team behind them. They just, you know, we're able to film a dope uh, and great quality music video and, you know, get good recordings and stuff like that. Like, you never know, but you do want people to take you serious and, uh, you know, just a uh, perfect song, of course, to play right in that, right? This song was called Serious uh, by freaking uh, Revis featuring Young Go. Uh, again, mix was freaking decent on here. And also, I had wanted to say, man, this is one of those records where, like, you could tell there was, you know, a certain amount of freaking reverb on the vocals, but the mix was still polished and it sounded, you know, good or whatnot. In most cases, we should never notice that, you know, oh, there's compression or there's, you know, this or that. We should just hear nice, you know, vocals, a nice, you know what I'm saying, beat, good mix going freaking through everything. And when it comes to the chorus, that sounded freaking nice. And I did feel like we got those in a lot of freaking areas throughout the freaking song. ET gave that a freaking seven, uh, freaking as well on that. And what do you say? Thank you for the freaking share. You send you my song. That's what's up. Shout out to Lil Yoda and stuff like that. Now, with a name like like you like you like, with a name like Lil Yoda, right? You know what I'm saying? How much of a Star Wars fan are you, really? Right? You know what I'm saying? That is the ultimate freaking question, right? You know what I'm saying? Because fans will always <laughs> fans are gonna freaking test you, uh, essentially. Uh, you know, fans, fan, fan, fan speaking and shit like that. Um, and so, uh, uh, you know, Star Wars fan or just the name? That's basically the, the, the questions that, that we freaking go to. Because sometimes it is just a name to some people with, uh, you know, even the song titles you guys will have. I talked about that a little bit earlier. Try not to just, like, title your song after an anime. If you don't even know about the anime, like, watch the shit. Make, make the song more themed toward the actual shit that you're talking about that way people gravitate towards it more especially the fans 
and they will be the ones promoting your freaking song, you know, almost more than anybody else. Um, he's like, I got room to play a song and stuff like that. There's a free line and a, as well as a paid line uh, if you're sending to the freaking show and stuff like that. Just make sure that you send it to the right email. Yeah, we take beats. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you where actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit. I'm thinking you were high like me when I'm looking down at a bird's <laughs> eye view when I'm cool but her right. Like you surprised Head to McDonald's I'm about to steal your fries He said my cousin gave me Look at women stick his tension All my niggas wallet Yeah Hold like... on man I've, I don't even know What we're gonna go through When we get into that right now uh, He said my cousin gave me The name, the nickname when I was little But I don't, I don't want to man Listen Wouldn't you wanna know What you were named after though Like you know what I mean Like watch the Cause Watch I'd watch it You know what I'm saying Like they're yeah. I'll say I'll put it like this, right? You do want to know it like information is freaking key, especially in freaking music, right? The more that you actually know, the more that you can actually talk about, the more words that you know, the more you can actually say on a record instead of the ABC kind of easy freaking, you know, the again, ABC one, two, freaking three and shit like that. Uh, 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 ball, tall, call. You know what I mean? Like, like there are more words out there than these standard ones that that you know are primitive brains can freaking think about. So the more that we sort of you know put into our brains, you know what I'm saying, in terms of like content, we can we can sort of you know use the uh, moments, characters, uh, situations, uh, items from those movies and shows and stuff like that and then make an even better song because we're able to go into detail about freaking things. Um, and so I'll freaking, I'll say that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, all right. Licking women stick his tension. All my niggas wildin'. Yeah, honey's fifty. She won't lick it. Bitch got brain for college. Wake up, girl, that glizzy. I get busy. Watch out for the piggy. Wake up in the city. I get litty. This bitch say she miss me. Keisha P like Diddy. Spinning, spinning. I was ain't got no sense. Broken and Joe stay flat. So yeah, I was thinking that baby ought to think. But again, all my enemies. More on bound to get. Doesn't matter if he doesn't watch it, right? my energy. She keep throwing fits. Switch up the flows and flex up in that hemi. Watch that block get bent. Turn that bitch for a tour, go to Bill Kennedy. Nigga, I ain't going for shit. Five, five, six, six, seven, point two. I'm sitting him and who he with. Nigga, I'm spinning. Star shit, then I finish. I side on my pitch. I'm super trapped out. Bitch ass nigga, cat that. I cut up, turn up in that moose ain't bendless. Shawty say she with me. I cut up, turn up on Duce and Henny. Twin that Draco mini. I turn that switch it on. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm gonna have to hit that freaking button and stuff like that, man. Here we go. Yeah. These rappers try to make a clever song. You know, no matter what they do, we'll never get along. She yeah. thinks the COVID now will never share a bone. You know, I've been yeah. trying to fix the rap game for the longest. I ain't gonna lie, man. Your rap's really garbage. Speak what's on my mind, cause I'm actually honest. You feel this in your eye, in your back, in your arm check. I got shaved right up. Um, needs a better mix and freaking recording. And I wouldn't like, you know, we're in this generation now where a lot of you guys tend to punch in a lot. And I'm going to just continue to freaking say it is not impressive at all. It's not like when you do it, it doesn't make you doper. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I would argue like you should only ever do things that people are going to think are dope. Right. You say certain things in certain ways. Maybe if you try to rap fast at certain times and shit like that, that sort of impresses people depending on, you know, how you freaking do it. Um, but you need to think about freaking that and stuff like that. And anytime you sort of like punch it, like it'll take me a little bit out of the, you know, th the moment for a freaking second, because before those times, you're hopefully sliding the record. Right. But then the moment that, you know, we realized that you only got through certain parts because you had to like, oh, let me come over here. And then you cut yourself off or something like that. It again, it kind of like affects the way that people listen to it and and depict whether or not you have sort of, you know, skills and stuff like that. So I just want you guys to take a little bit more time with sort of like how you get on some of these records and stuff. Uh, there was some part in there that honestly still allowed me to play it for longer than you know i kind of even wanted to though uh if you take this song and then you get a great mix on it 
and then you use it in a moment for something like the show ATL or like uh, Dave uh, with Little Dicky or something like that. And you know what I'm saying? For sure. Look at women stick his stitches. All my niggas wild. Tell me you can't hear this at the end of one of his Little Dicky's shows episodes. I get busy. Watch out for the piggy. Wake up. Like it's just, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe he holds an audition for some shit and then the artist or some some happens. And then, like, he gets into a, an Uber, and then the artist is playing their song, and it's that or some shit, right? You know what I'm saying? And then, uh, you know, this plays, of course, at the end of the show because it was a funny moment within the uh, the episode. Like, that's basically what, what would happen. Uh, but you have to have a better mix on it, at least in my freaking opinion, to sort of, like, get in there. Uh, what do you guys freaking think? You know what I'm saying? Give me the freaking thoughts. You either agree or you disagree. You know what I mean? KZ, you know what I'm saying? He's a the dog. Come on, is that it's also a, a, oh yeah, you were saying. What do you what do you mean the doll? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Et uh, eight and so that be more specific. All right, KJ Osama with trauma rhymes easy to remember, I suppose. My song go through. Yeah, you should be in there in the free line. Yes, sir. Oh my goodness, it's 11 o'clock p.m. Salute to everybody rocking with us tonight. If we get three more skits, we will hit that giveaway tier one on the show. Man, a lot of you guys be singing. It be hard to fucking cope, I'm dealing with all this pain I've been thinking about my grandma, she still fuck with my brain Ever since you fucking left, I swear it ain't been the same It hurt the most, like them, I'll never fucking see you again Taking losses back to back, I think I'm due for a win They ask me how the fuck I cope, I take that pain to the chin I ask the Lord, do he forgive me, even though that I sin All this motherfucking pain got me ready to crash Start reminiscing about my angels, got me ready to spy. I get so deep up in my thoughts, wish I could go to the past Been trying to fight off my emotions, got my heart racing fast Got niggas switching, man, you know you supposed to stick to the car This nigga used to be my dog, I can't believe that he told These niggas funny, man, you better watch who you call your bro That's why I stay up out the way just be my dog. And let me talk about these bitches, man, they sign me the words You put your all into a bitch, all time she doing you dirt That's why I'll never love a bitch, can't have me going out bad Man, I just fuck him and I go, cause all these bitches is trash I know some niggas who be stepping quick to go on a drill He used to be a fucking I mean, he's kinda doing that same thing I said he wicked, you got youngest really sorry for real He caught a body, now that nigga gonna be gone for some years Fighting all this trauma, got me going insane It be hard to fucking cope, I'm dealing with all this pain I've been thinking about my girl See, here's the pro- This is what I'm talking about, though Here is the problem Right, hearing you punch in so many times. This is why I keep freaking doing it. Hearing you punch in so many times does not give me confidence in your ability to then perform the song, right? Which then makes me the moment you add, hey, you want to buy a ticket to my freaking show? The answer is gonna be no because I I'm already gonna know that means you're gonna perform to the record. If you're not able to like go in and again make that perfect performance kind of situation happen, I need to know you can. And the the problem with you writing the record like that in the punch in style is that you don't see that it's not a good performance kind of record. You literally aren't gonna have time within how you're rapping it to like take breaths and shit like that. So you end up in that situation where now, okay, well now I gotta perform to my record. It's not gonna sound good. People are gonna be like, it's monotone, it's repetitive. You know, there's just a lot of aspects freaking like that. Um, but you just gotta, you know, better it, man. Again, I appreciate what you guys freaking do. And sometimes you just kind of do half the work and then you kind of stay in, you go, oh, that's good. Let me stay with that. You don't try to continue and do even more doper things throughout the record, right? So figure that out with every one of your record. Appreciate you as well and stuff like that. Fit, but figure that out with every record that you sort of freaking do, right? Think about every song that you have as like if your favorite artist was gonna hop on that same record with you tomorrow and you couldn't change any of any of what you did in the performance. You know what I'm saying? Are you gonna feel like, yo, hell no, nah, let me re-record my shit or whatnot, right? And if your answer is yes, I'm I need to re-record my shit. 
then my mind always goes to like, well, why did you make the song in the first place? Why did you allow it to only be what it was instead of thinking, oh shit, if Lil Wayne hears this and wants to get on it, and people listen to my verse versus his, people are gonna be like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? So essentially, it's just make sure that you make the best record to the, you know, the beat that you are, you know, acquiring. And, you know, hopefully, uh, uh, you know, people love it enough to want to do remixes and remakes and versions in different genres and a dubstep version of your shit. You know what I'm saying? All of that. All right. Let's get back in the building. Brayden. With I Love You. Let's see what this is. We're back in the free line right now. Back up in the free line. Back at Benito. There's a lot of time when I wake up, I'm like, where my Nintendo go? People like, yo, why you been so slow? I don't know what, man. I just don't know if I think that I can go bend yo ho. Over. Also, you know, I'm so sober. When I freaking rap, homie, it gets colder. I don't even know if I have to eight shoulders. Randomly rapping, I don't even know what the heck had just happened But all of the time when I be talking shit You know that half of that shit I say is capping You don't need to, you don't Don't spam the chat That's not how you get played on the show Check my, check my bio San Andreas, right? 
But yeah, big freaking salute in terms of that. Like, you know, fairly freaking standard or whatnot. You kind of just get in there with the, the drums and uh, a filter and, you know, a few effects freaking here and there. And, you know, get, get in with certain freaking records or whatnot. We know what we're getting into. Uh, and I do think that it would have been nice to sort of like hear that in a certain outlets or whatnot, right? In that live setting, of course, DJ doing their freaking thing, sort of plopping that, uh, as well as, you know, just the actual freaking song. Uh, and then, um, on top of that, like the skating ring kind of situation, man, just like for sure, I, I, you know, I love those classic sort of like, you know, themes that they'll do at certain freaking parties and situations. And it's really fits that like you, I could see that being a theme night where everybody is even required to like dress up and sort of feel like they're in there. Um, but yeah, that's that right there and stuff like that surge you know what i'm saying with a freaking eight electronic dance and, and stuff you know what i'm saying you said lighter would sound great et said it was a fun freaking track of course um in my submission you know what i'm saying get played by any chance nope not yet um let me see i believe i believe it did not freaking get uh played yet and stuff like that i remember at some point i was like it's our music i think but i don't know if i was just shouting you out or the freaking thing uh, was played. Now, it should be. Well, what was your email? Just so I can. Because I think if it was, if it was, uh, you might, you would have gotten an email, my brother. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Bless you, plus up, 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 bless you, plus up. Uh, information to send to the show is in my bio. It's that dorky review show at gmail.com. You do not request in the chat, you send to the email because there is a line. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, just think about think about how it would make sense. Would it really make sense that like you just pop up and then like, I just play anyone's music who simply requested in the chat how do i possibly make a line out of that when everyone would be asking the same question plus we are live on all platforms so i'd have to do that same thing for you youtube bandlab twitch facebook twitter so think about it right when you pop up in the stream information pops up right into your face if you don't look at that information that's kind of on you it's right there and then on top of that, if you look at my bio, the same information is right there. So with that you must send it to my email so that you can get in the uh, the free line at the very least. Otherwise, you're just sitting there. Yo, nonsense and Sir Mike, this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones yeah, in your eyes. Yeah, watch for it. I know, we'll Eddie Murphy. Yaddy, like. yaddy, yaddy. I'm yada. gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you or actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit, I'm thinking you were high. Like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view. When I'm cool, better act like you surprised. Head to McDonald's, I'm about to steal your fries. We're we'll driving back in the free line once again. Let's see what, what y'all got. Sprite DNC Fire Emo Fire Emo This is Ja Ryan Yeah With example featuring Big Sad Flash Everyone to know about your mama right, Let's go Yeah HT made the way I can't give you the whole thing But I could give your ass a sample <laughs> Yeah, turn your boyfriend to an example yeah, From the city where it rains every day But we keep a flannel And your toes look yeah. cute up in them platform sandals I can't give you the whole thing But I could give your ass a sample Hey, <laughs> turn your boyfriend to an example From the city where it rains every day But we keep a flannel And your toes look cute up in them platform sandals Hey, yeah. bitches out here lying on my name like Amber Heard what? And the homies plotting on my old bitches like scavengers I ain't tripping on nothing Me and little baby draped in fur You yeah. rockin' fox fur Tell them niggas stop speaking on me until we box first Scratch that Tell them niggas stop speaking at all Your what? bitch was front row at my show when she threw me them draws I don't know nothing about nothing if a shooting involved nah. But we be out here making niggas take they jewelry off right. It's Cave City, Bedrock Gang, bitch the big two and eight hey, You can't stop us, my little bro already got shot in his face I got Still face me every day, we invincible, nigga yeah. Till God call us home, cause we his children, my nigga See, Lee, I love you, cut he would stop playing the fence with my niggas Let them bums disrespect us in them comments like hoes Swamp stories better do they research I'm the best rapper in the West Cut he fucked the Pacific Half of these niggas is bitches The other half of them snitches They really tall Like Flesh, where the fuck have you been? You done got so cold Like you done really came out the snow well, I already know Yeah, ayy 
I already know. <laughs> yeah, they like flesh. Where you been? Where you been? I ran it up and disappeared like I'm supposed to do. <laughs> yeah. Hey, check K2. It's dead bodies on the local news. <laughs> yeah. Hey, and I ain't bragging. It ain't nothing for me to show and prove. Nah. Hey, I just do it for the rappers that was supposed to do. Nigga, that's what I like. Hold on, hold on, hold on, I don't know what the fuck you doing. You got better, nigga. I can't give you the whole thing, but I could give your ass a sample. Yeah, turn your boyfriend to an example. I'm gonna put this in the chat. It rains every day, but we keep a flannel. Your toes look cute up in them platforms. On the YouTube, Twitch, and Facebook sides. I could give your ass a sample. Twitter. Turn your boyfriend to an example what? from the city where it rains every day, but we keep a flannel and your toes look cute up in them platform sandals. Look, I thought you, you were already a mind. So you. you be out the way, I come and visit you. I could be your friend, you need someone to listen to. Thugged out, fuck, I look like kissing you. We can go out yeah, the way and take a road trip. What happened? Can't be local around this shit, cause I'm a known crib. Big booty little bitch, I make her whole dick. She be with me every time, I make her whole stick. Chillin' with my hoes, yeah, I'm on the boat with it. Every time y'all got shot, y'all know who did it. Then y'all disappear for weeks, it don't be no chillin'. I bring this shit together, you know I'm willing. Where them niggas put my name in they mouth. My niggas shopping and they came from the south. Big flat screens, white walls in my house. I took them trips, niggas know I took I can't the route. the whole thing, but I could give your ass a sample. <laughs> yeah, turn your boyfriend to an example from the city where it rains every day, but we keep a flannel and your toes look cute up in them platform sandals. I can't <laughs> give you the whole thing, but I could give your ass Getting a sample. Getting arrested for a song, hey, Turn your boyfriend to an example from the city where it rains every day, but we keep a flannel and your toes look cute up in them platform sandals. There's a lot of things that I can freaking think about my defect You know what man, I'm about to think I'm talking about him with a change Yeah, I wasn't prepared at all, so um, I'm just gonna load that up right there uh so this right here straight up freaking west coast vibes love the overall freaking feel of it you got in there straight up freaking rap had a good energy mix was actually freaking clean and freaking stuff like that you gave us a full song structure in the three minutes and 37 seconds of songs uh the beat was freaking dope had a vibe and again that west coast freaking flair something that you know feel on on a good day when you ain't gotta do nothing you know what I mean? You ain't going through shit. You ain't getting pulled over by the freaking cops. You ain't getting shot at. Ain't got to rob nobody or nothing like that. You know what I mean? Sun is out, palm trees, barbecues out and shit like that. This this song rings freaking true and it's freaking dope and shit like that. Those are the type of things that that feel good uh, to be a part of that, that sort of uh, side of the freaking culture or whatnot. Or at least it's it's what I remember sort of like growing up to um with a lot of the nwa uh uh you know what i'm saying west side connections badass uh, snoop dog east siders and you know what i'm saying different stuff like that um so i do i feel like make a video to this song for freaking sure um and uh you know rhyming and everything was on point man not bad boat bean sandwiches yes or nope uh what? yeah same thing for the freaking rules right freaking there and it was just freaking laughing, just sitting in. That's what's freaking good. So, yeah, I'm Facebook news. So, you're now a mod. You are now a mod on TikTok. Congratulations. <laughs> okay, that's it. Uh, let me see. And then what else? Uh, let me see. Was that like an 8 point? Was that an 8 or a 9.5 or whatever? But we can search. Big salute. Oh, shit. She created the voting freaking thing. Which then blocked the chat, and I can't freaking see. <laughs> I can't see what people are freaking saying anymore. Ah, hold on. Uh, I think it's probably better to do when, 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 and as we're playing the song. That way, people can go freaking through it as we're going. Cause now, now they gotta remember what. Hey, what did it sound like again and shit like that? Listen, if we gotta run it back to test it out, well, we can do that, and then I'll. Load up the next record, uh, right after. There can never be too many books, but living without the internet would suck and shit would get weird like too many cooks. If you're always getting robbed, there's too many crooks. Living without the internet would 
fucking shit would get weird like two mini cooks. Like, I don't know yeah. how this thing works or nothing. It's flesh. I don't know how this thing works. Snoop Dogg charges 500k. Yeah. HT made the way. For an hour. Thing, but I could get your ass a sample. Of that stuff yeah. you're talking. Turn your boyfriend to an example what? from the city where it rains every day, but we keep a flannel and your toes look cute up in them platforms. He'll do the music video though. Is that? But I could get your ass a sample. <laughs> Hey, turn your boyfriend to an example. Just be, just be prepared. Day, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No That's also why you want to be prepared, though, too, right? You can't go in freaking not knowing what the fuck you're about to do, can try to freestyle some freaking random shit and, and stuff like that. Be prepared so you can get a song done. You can get a video done. Like, know what you're going to freaking do. Be professional. And you know, you can knock a lot of things out, you know what I'm saying? With, uh, like freaking that, but you gotta still take time to make and perfect. Toes look cute up in them platform sandals. Like, yeah. bitches out here lying on my name like Amber Heard. Yeah, I don't know if homies plotting on my old bitches like scavengers. I ain't tripping on nothing. Me and little baby dragged in fur. You yeah. rocking fox fur. Tell them niggas stop speaking. Oh, maybe on he did me that on accident. Scratch that. Tell them niggas I don't know, stop honestly. speaking at all. Your what? bitch was front row at my show when she threw me them draws. I don't know nothing about nothing if a shooting involved. Nah. But we be out here making niggas take their jewelry off. Right. It's cave. Yes. City bedrock gang, bitch, the big two and eight. You can't stop us, my little bro already got shot in his face. Still FaceTime me every day, we invincible, nigga. Till God call us home, cause we his children, my nigga. See, Lee, I love you, Cuddy, but stop playing the fence with my niggas. Letting bums disrespect us in them comments like hoes. Swamp stories better do they research. I'm the best rapper in the West. Cuddy, fuck the Pacific. Half of these niggas is bitches. I mean, it, it, already, it already left anyways or whatnot. I don't think it uh, worked freaking properly or whatnot. I guess I was just keeping the freaking thing up. We're going to go back into the, uh, the actual freaking line right now. See what we got freaking next go from freaking there and then move on freaking uh we got about 25 plus any freaking lineup right now across all freaking platforms and stuff like that answers your question yeah. as much as i can give you it's a thought of me so tempting uh, uh, yeah yeah i've been feeling everybody around me and i wonder if they talk about it probably real question am i gonna let them down me but what i really wanna know is the thought of me making it so you don't wanna talk to me the thought of me making you nervous you don't wanna rock with me possibly i've been feeling so alone so i'm lost in me no one calling on my phone it's important me and i'm gonna be alone in this heart to me Feeling everybody around me And I wonder if they talk about me proudly Real question, am I gonna let them down me? But what I really wanna know is The thought of me Making it so you don't wanna talk to me The thought of me Making you nervous, you don't wanna rock with me The thought of me Making you regret ever talking to me The thought of me How y'all feel about that record right there? What a 10 and all feedback is welcome. All genres and sent to the freaking show so you already freaking know what it is and whatnot. Now this right freaking here is a little bit freaking different, right? It's a little bit more <laughs> and that like alternative kind of rock. And we kind of get these from time to time where it'll be like a little bit alternative, you know, rock in terms of like what you're freaking hearing. But the artist will be something that you can tell usually makes more like possible like trap kind of records and uh, more, you know, melodic records and, and that. Like, again, the auto tune and stuff like that is often used and or, you know, a little bit of mel melodyne, you know what I'm saying, here and there, depending on what you're doing. This record still needs an overall mix. Uh, in most cases, man, like you guys can make bank if you actually try to like not a, not sync license, but like use these as a reference song to actually um, you know, uh, uh, what do they freaking call it again when you 
um, sort of get a, yeah, get it. So you can get a placement, right? Like whether you're a producer and you're trying to sell a beat and, you know, sell it, sell a beat to Drake or something like that, or you have a reference song to a song that feels like Drake would have made it. And in most cases, you guys make your own songs and you're 99% influenced by Drake. If people say every time you send something that you sound like Drake, you have two choices. You can either try to feed off of Drake's fan base by sounding like him. That's what most artists end up freaking doing. Or I guarantee you'd make way more money actually getting those songs to Drake for him to put out. Even if he just takes the freaking idea from the chorus writes his own verses and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Whatever the freaking case. And again, I'm saying you'd make the you'd make faster freaking money in most cases, or uh, you know, you'd be able to get into some of those rooms that you only you you only dream about freaking being able to be in while you're, you know, they're having like writing kind of sessions and, and freaking stuff like that. Um, you know, in this case again, I heard some decent melodies and stuff like that, but I wasn't all the way feeling the performance but you know melodies were on freaking point and i was just like man if this was gave, given to like the right artist i think this would be you know as close to freaking a hit you know what i'm saying probably be a little bit longer and have an actual band playing the instruments but outside of that you had a 5.5 from uh surge you said i feel like the backing vocals might be taken away from the main i uh, engineer produced uh, my own beats, you know what I'm saying? So give me your honest, down-to-earth opinion about mine and stuff like that. That's what's up. Same here, man. You know what I'm saying? You already know what it is. Shout out to my artist slash freaking producers, which I know is a whole nother ball game right freaking there, right? Because listen, you know, that. in fact, that is often the most important, like, I think, feedback from that you can get from, you know, a person in the building, you know what I'm saying? And even like myself or whatnot. Because often, for me, when I am giving out a beat or making a beat for somebody, know that I rap too. So in most cases, I I have to sacrifice my dopest beats to allow somebody else to hop on those, right? And it feels like, it feels the worst when that other artist doesn't do a good job or some shit, right? Knowing that I probably could have done a better job, but then I sacrificed it so someone else could freaking hear it and get on it. You know what I mean? So you always want to make sure that, you know, you are, you are as an artist, every beat that you guys get on, again, make the best song possible. Otherwise, you're wasting time. You're wasting the listeners, you know what I'm saying, time. You're wasting the producer's time. And you're wasting your own time when you could have you know, in most cases done something a little bit freaking better. In this case, again, I just really have a, I need a little bit of a better mix in there and or uh, possibly maybe you could even feature an alternative rock sort of like an artist or whatnot, female or male, whatever you uh, sort of freaking think of. Like if it was up to me, I'd uh, honestly, I could probably have my girl shout out or hit up Owl City, maybe if you know who he is and shit like that. He basically made a song on the first wreck it ralph movie or whatnot if you listen to the, the the first song that pops up at the end of that movie uh that's owl city and shit like that some of you guys have heard uh, of him um you know she pretty much went to freaking high school with him she probably could hit him up and then like see if he'd be willing to freaking hop on freaking something that's as close as like i think you know you could get uh i used to know nickasaur for a freaking bit or whatnot i don't know what the hell he's doing freaking today but i'm curious if he still freaking makes music in that electro pop freaking genre uh you know he'd be another freaking uh, nice kid what's up king uh fit you know what i'm saying back in the building back in the building 100 percent royalty man indeed in Indeed. All right, let's go ahead and get back in the free free land. Oh, nonsense and Sir Mike, this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you or actual, actual worms like. Right. Don't like my old shit. I'm thinking you were high like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view when I'm cool, but her act like you surprised. Head to McDonald's, I'm out to steal your fries. Then my fingers. All right, we got Luke. With fault. Right here. Good luck, man. Good luck to all artists who send in to the nice freaking show. It's free to submit. 
if we're in the free line like right now, if people end up not liking your record that much, if, it, if it's like, bro, what are you even doing? If people feel like that in their mind, they can always hashtag Dorky Don't Play That. We'll always cut the freaking record early. However, if we, it is a skip and you pay to be played, you are safe from getting cut. I always know that. Hey, I'll put you outside for that. I'll put you outside for that, bitch. Do you outside for that? Do you outside for that? Yeah, six when we time out. Yeah, I see it. Put you on a leash yeah. like you did, yeah. man. Why the girls gotta be so fucking independent? I'm fucking in a Santa, yeah. Man, maybe yeah. I'll figure out I'm gonna blow, yeah. yeah. Fuck right. these stars, yeah. Too much going on right here, but let's see what happens. Actually, thanks for the dope ass beat. Oh, God. Yeah, fucking that bitch ten times. Ten times. Yeah, I know I got girls on my line. All them motherfucking time. Hold on, that's a fucking lie. I got bubble, I got tender, I got hands, man. I ain't getting shit. Yeah, I ain't getting shit. I ain't big. You know I should think about my ass. Come on, guy. Doctor, what it takes to be strange. I will hit you fucking rappers in the face with a cane while you want to fucking train watching snakes on a plane. I just. Listen to me, man. You know, it started out freaking good. Great freaking beat. Good, nice production freaking in there. I'm like, okay. You know what I'm saying? I always love a good sort of like, you know, mixture of the trap 808 situation with a hip hop based sample or whatnot. I feel like that's the best of both worlds, sort of linking two different, you know, generations sort of freaking together. Um, but you got to freaking, you know, get 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 in these on these beats right, man. You know what I'm saying? You got to slide the freaking shit and not really freestyle. Essentially, the moment that you get into that that sort of thing where we can just tell that you are freestyling because if you ain't and you're writing it then you really need to work on your freaking craft and freaking that side right so i'm going to jump into the frame of mind that you freestyle that and just remind you to like bro if you got a dope ass freaking beat please please take your time sit down write what you are going to say on the record practice that shit then perform the actual song that is the only and best way to truly get classics out of the records that you do other than that a lot of you guys are kind of just like blasting through breezing through these freaking beats like it's freaking nothing but not taking the actual time to perfect the records you're not going to impress a drake you're not going to impress you know what i'm saying meek or whoever whoever you guys mentally want to impress with your freaking records who you guys look up to and the reason why you guys make music you need to have the same standards if not more for those people to start you know what I'm saying like just think if they came across your record just randomly because soundcloud is a universal sort of freaking thing anybody can freaking get to it right just say like jay-z or somebody decided to you know you know what let me see what all this is doing today you know what i'm saying he just pulls up the freaking app your song freaking comes up what's gonna make him stay in the record what's gonna make him hit that like button freaking if, if they don't have an account and shit like that for whatever reason what's gonna make them want to create an account just to listen to the song hit that like button create a freaking comment in the chat share the freaking song on their timeline like at the end of the day you guys got to think about that if your song is good people aren't gonna just listen to it and say that was dope they're gonna be like hey where's the song let me get that link Hit that, they'll hit that like button, leave a comment, share it up. They'll let their own timeline know, hey, I fuck with this song, y'all should too. That's basically what anytime someone's sharing, they're freaking doing. And if people don't, there's always something wrong. The mix isn't right. The artist isn't doing a, a good job. So they're going to be embarrassed if we share the thing. And then people go, like, why the fuck did you think I wouldn't want to see this? You know what I'm saying? But y'all know what it is, man. Get your freaking thing in there. Let me see. Uh, shout out to freaking Manny. It was freaking good. He said, he said, you seem cool. You seem like a cool ass friend, bro. You know what I'm saying? Fuck with your energy, man. Hey, I appreciate that, man. I, yeah, I appreciate that. 
is to the fullest, man. You know what I'm saying? And welcome to the show. For those you are here for the first time. Bro, it's two in the morning, fell asleep when I'm yawning. Waking up on the lawn, I'm seeing blue and orange. Orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie, gnawing on a Nazi, probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you've been warned. My brain is so it's like a unicorn. Uh, and that is freaking, I thought I already told you I did, uh, my good friend, but, uh, okay, I mean, you can maybe, uh, sit, well, let me, let me freaking see, allow me to double check for two, um, Ashton freaking get, what is your, what's your email, Ashton? Just so I can freaking check or whatnot. And look, if your name, I'm telling you freaking right now, right? I'm telling you right now. If your email is not AshtonGale at gmail.freakingcom right freaking now. Yeah, you know I mean, already you are setting yourself up for freaking failure. Why are you in the chat under that name if your email is under a completely different one, right? Everything needs to be the same across the board. If you are an artist, that is the name that I freaking should see. That's the email that that it should be or whatnot. Where it basically tells you to put in your actual um uh da, 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 where it tells you to put in your name. Most people put in first and last name, right? Don't do that. Put your artist name where like the first name freaking is or something like that. Or again, if you have a two a two kind of you know, like a first and a last name as an artist, you can put that in the thing. But that's the first thing we see when your email pops up on the left side. It's whatever your name is, what you put in there. If it's the artist, that helps us find your record a lot easier to know if you've sent it freaking correctly. After that, we see whatever you put in the subject line. So if you actually put the name of the artist, the name of the song, the name of, you know what I'm saying, whatever, you know what I'm saying, you, you can do that there. Then in, And the description is definitely where you want to have any information about the freaking song, you know what I'm saying, whether it's, you know, unmixed, uh, whether you're going to release it freaking soon, if it's a part of a freaking album, if there's features, who produced it, uh, you know, your social media information, you can put freaking there too and stuff like that. But just a little bit of a heads up. Um, so you can make sure that you, uh, do that freaking right and all that good stuff. Appreciate that feedback. Uh, we're using it for it. But yeah, where is, uh, what did you freaking say and stuff like that? We don't read, we don't read the lineup and stuff like that. For everybody freaking trying to ask where they at in the freaking line, we don't read the line up because it does freaking change. We tend to get freaking skips on the freaking show that change exactly that lineup. So it literally does not freaking help. I kid you freaking not. I've tried. Trust me, I have tried. I was like, I, I was like, you know what? Let me read the next freaking five, the next freaking ten. We've tried those freaking things, and it all hell broke freaking loose because it was too much to sort of, you know, keep track of between freaking everybody and you know what I'm saying every single person. The mo the moment I say one person, every other person basically acts the same freaking shit or whatnot. But again, if you do not want to wait in that free line. Send a freaking skip, we'll play you immediately. And you can get multiple songs played in a back-to-back -back fashion, um, depending on what type of skip that you do put in. All that information is also in my, uh, you know what I'm saying, bio or whatnot. Now, Kilo Bergs, you do have to... Uh, you did not send a freaking link for the Kilo Bergs freaking thing or whatnot. So you might have to freaking send uh, a freaking brand new one that does allow us to get back in the building in the free line and move right on freaking up though. But I will credit you for a freaking skip so you can send that in since it was your freaking turn. Um, you know, so if you do want to do that, just make sure you send it properly. I'm talking about the specific person. Rio, what's good, man? I got a song I did last Sunday about the city of the young. It's the instrumental from ET Phone Home. Be sure to subscribe to all of our platforms YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Twitch. I like the beat though. It's a lot of freaking time when you know that I eat slow. 
just so freaking I can figure out all of the moments that I eat for Freaking I don't know what the hell I'm about to do But you know what, people be like calling me Negro I'm like, you know what the fuck is happening I don't even think that this beat makes me ever want to rap again I am a freaking guy with glasses but also an African People love freaking hear me say something funny then laugh at him when I freaking point it, I don't even think I'm freaking disjointed. I don't even really know if I'm anointed all the freaking times when I'm freaking flowing. I don't even know if I'ma ever go and all the freaking people talking shit. <laughs> Let me stop. What's happening here? I didn't like that last part. Nobody wants to wake up in the middle of the night, girl, to hear your ass fart. I just sit here and people also like, what if you were a midget who tried to sit in a big chair but couldn't get up and shit? People are sitting in the line for like 10 hours and be like, man, nigga, fuck this shit. Ain't no way I'm about to freaking wait and listen, dog. People want your songs to always sound real great, but they don't want to hate. A lot of times you freaking think that if you go up straight up to the zoo, it'll be cool, except for the moment when you see an ape and then it freaking hits your face with lots of freaking poop and shit. A lot of times I always wanted to go and talk to Snoop and shit, but then he took a poop on freaking the thing that I didn't even know that I don't even know what happened to DJ Clue and shit. Oh man, let me stop. This part, honestly, I don't like at all. And it's making me mad. <laughs> it's making me mad. But this, see that, that sounds better together a little bit. Turn it down though. Turn that. Oh my god. Oh, that was off beat right there. You gotta fix that. Fix that. All right, now. This is also an element. Let me talk about figuring this freaking real quick. Let's go ahead and do a clap real quick. <laughs> okay, real quick, just to give you the freaking deets. Uh, essentially, what you've put together is freaking nice from what we're freaking hearing. Outside of that, you know, those every, every like, other eight bars or four bars or something like that it just changes into this other section that i just kind of don't like by itself sounds a little bit better with the sort of you know the other part you know what i'm saying together but you got to turn that freaking down a little bit more it is kind of like overpowering and it is like i said by itself annoying it didn't even make it doesn't make me want to even be a part of that right if it's if we're doing a back and forth where two artists are on the same beat and every eight bars each one sort of comes in and um you know goes back and forth or whatnot that one right there does need um you know a little bit more on that uh those other freaking halves at least for freaking me but i love the production and you know initially how uh it sounds and the potential of what an artist can freaking do i know like a j cole you know and kendrick again them, them boys can get in there and do that freaking thing or whatnot i see you rio um i put your skip in right about now and so like that does he accept edm yes we do all genres are accepted all genres are accepted you said this beat sounds like lsd and shit like that man listen the whole beat just sound like a drug and so like that man retro vaughn you also said you sent 10 too so both of you guys sent skips we'll freaking check them out give me a moment give me a moment we got uh, Al Rio uh, coming up. You guys both basically sent the same type of skip, so you'll be put in accordingly. But look, who can you hear on that production? Who would you want on that beat? If you guys, look, if music was. I know diamond dirt and things Hold up. That you I ain't done yet, home. man. If music was, right? Let's just say the whole, the the industry said, you know what? We are gonna We're gonna leave it to the listeners to freaking choose everything, right? That includes the beats that all the artists hop on. So anytime you hear a beat, you have to match it up with the right artist, make sure that they get on that freaking beat or whatnot, and you guys get to vote on who that artist is or so like that. So if you're hearing freaking that, who comes to your mind, right? You know what I'm saying? No, not this part, get that out of here. Kanye, who y'all hearing?
Did you also send a freaking cash? Hold up. Look, we need to put these damn freaking cash apps. I know diamonds are the things that you wish that you had, but homie. So we got Rio coming up right now. I see grilled cheese. And Logan. So yeah, we should have it. Let's go ahead, take care of you guys. In order. In order. Uh, where's the... Where's the uh, real... Let me start all of your uh, freaking stuff. Let me make sure... Okay, so Retro got yours. Just trying to make sure that I... Uh, and Kevin was trying to freaking send his... Uh, Freaking thing that I almost did not see, man. I got you. Uh, okay, Rio, you did you send yours freaking to your uh? Let me see. I think. No, I think I'm still waiting on. Um, I think I'm still waiting on Rio's uh submission. Maybe. Let me double check. I think. Hold on. Yeah, Rio. Make sure you send. Make sure you send again. Email is that dorky review show at gmail.com. So next up from freaking Nat. Hold on. Let me actually add this so I can get out of this damn screen right here. Sorry about that, guys. All right. So if uh yeah, Rio is supposed to be right now. Followed by so I'll do. Since we don't have that one freaking yet, we're just waiting on that one uh, to come in. We will do grilled cheese. Grilled cheese jewelry. First. It's still activated out of the freaking way. Uh, and let me see. Did you send yours, you know, to the email? Again, that dorky review show at gmail.com is the actual... Or maybe that's a whole different thing. Maybe that's just the freaking cash app you sent from. What's the name of your submission? Who sent the grilled cheese one, right? Nick Ray is the artist for grilled cheese. Okay. Uh, but you can understand how that's a little bit confusing, right? Just for uh, future reference or whatnot. Try to create like a cash app that matches up with the artist name. You know what I'm saying? Like, again, across the board will help people remember the artist name to a T. Not ever mistake you for anybody else. All that good stuff. But I could get how you'd uh, want to promote different freaking things and stuff like that. All right. And then, okay. And then we got, we were able to get that real too. All right. So first up. D major, baby. He say no so much, sorry, I've been closed off Lately I've been popping all these pills till I doze off Feeling I've been anxious, trying to get it, I can't hold off Chopping, game for the green like it's coleslaw Listen, we got Nico Ray with No Luck right now. Rate this record in the chat 100%. Hey. He say no so much, sorry, I've been closed off. Lately, I've been popping all these pills till I doze off. Feeling I've been anxious, trying to get it, I can't hold off. Chopping, game for the green like it's coleslaw. On this cup of cognac, we pull up. And we big smoke, rolling more blood. Where we come from, baby, it's no luck. Where we come from, baby, it's no luck. It's no luck. Look, nothing was in hand and ain't giving a plan and a mission. I'm trying to put the fam in position. They never gave it ear to hear. Now when I rap, they gon' listen. Cut deep and severe from the damage. I glisten. Look, I ain't switched. I ain't switched. It's been a lot at stake, but I'm so sauce, baby. You could call me Holland Base. On top, they could've knocked like an 808. I'm A okay from all the times I made no pay. I still get this shit in my heart though, cause I made that way. But gold money and modern day got me wide awake. Concerned about they say I ain't tripping. I ain't keep no tabs on it. It was love, I just did it. You can't play me out this spot, I'm relentless. Without the gram, look, tell me is they really a winning off for the image I can see through with no x-ray I just hush and let it burn cause it's real don't fake they Ain't on so much, sorry, I've been closed off Lately I've been popping all these pills till I doze off Feeling I've been anxious trying to get it, I can't hold off Chopping, game for the green like it's coleslaw On this cup of cognac, we pull up And we big smoke, rolling more blood. Where we 
come from, baby, it's no luck. Where we come from, baby, it's no luck. It's no luck. Gotta get it, cause that's all that I know. Love is weakness, cause that's all that I show. My patience runs shorter than a puck. My heart weight quarter than a puck. No luck, no four leaf club with a pluck. No quarters that I flipped in the well. Still wishing you well, but oh well, learn to get it myself. With no luck, I had to get it myself. Had to get it myself. No luck, no whip on the bus again. No luck, hard work, plus it's hustling. And if I'm any part of family, you can call us. Lately, I've been closed off, like my walls up. And if it ain't between my teeth, I don't floss much. And I don't really like to talk, that's just gossip. Broke a back wood down, that just got stuck. Always tell me from acting like I ain't got no so much. Sorry, I've been closed off. Lately, I've been popping all these pills till I doze off. Feeling I've been anxious, trying to get it, I can't hold off. Chopping game for the green, like it's coleslaw. On this cup of cognac, we pull up. And we Big smoke rolling more blood. Where we come from, baby, it's no luck. Where we come from, baby, it's no luck. It's no luck. Also, roll up all the kinds of weed that you gon' just love. Okay, whatever. Uh, first of all, <laughs> let's go. Straight West Coast. Once again. So, uh, 100%, you know what I'm saying? Decent West Coast freaking vibes within there, you know what I'm saying? Fully freaking decent mix. Like, we heard the clarity within your vocals and stuff like that. The approach was nice. It was smooth. I always love beats freaking like that or whatnot because it just feels chill, right? Like, any kind of vibe basically relaxes the listener. You know what I mean? Like, you just want to listen to something like that, cruise down the freaking street, you know what I'm saying, on a good day while, you know, you heading to a freaking barbecue. Everything is always, <laughs> at the end of the day, about the family barbecue and or, you know, the hood function and shit, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, just making sure you have something like that to really, you know, ride to and, and you know, feel like you're, you know, of, of, of the culture and shit. Um, but yeah, that, that felt nice. Definitely something I would love to see a video freaking too, for freaking sure. Um, and I believe you said you're uh, from the freaking uh, 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 Bay Area, you know what I'm saying, potentially, or maybe you're just saying it's Bay Area freaking shit or whatnot. Um, but you know what I'm saying? Nice. I definitely could hear like Too Short, Snoop Dogg, uh, E40, um, uh, uh, you know, some of those freaking artists getting on that uh record or whatnot right and that is again what you want ultimately we are all artists the best artists are susceptible to being heard by everyone but also what do we do just think about what you do when you hear a song from a bigger artist that you like like be honest completely right when you hear a song from a bigger artist that you like, you then, oh shit, let me go try to find that beat and then do a remix. You either Whether it's one verse or you do a whole freaking song, just like rap into that freaking beat kind of situation, right? And like you're, you're paying homage to the artist, but also saying how dope that song was and wanting to get on it. Now, if your song is dope enough, other people will want to do that same thing. If it still needs work in certain areas, people will want to get the beat and then kind of make their own song, not really pay homage to what you did, but just, you know, go in a completely different direction or whatnot. But I'm saying the best ones, you there's no way around people, you know, like think about like a million, a million, a million, you know what I'm saying? Lil Wayne rapped a certain way on that freaking record and almost 99% of people who got on that same beat hit it up the same way that he did, but just like kind of said different words or whatnot, right? Because you had to pay homage to the, the, the style of rapping on there. And I think it was only Corey Guns who was like, uh, you know what, let me rap fast and shit. And the bit of the did it, you know what I'm saying? And he got in there and did it like that and changed it up, which then made it fresh, of course. But like, again, you want people to sort of, you know, hear your record and, you know, show it love in that way. And thanks for the feedback. Of course, uh, uh, ET, man, you know what it is, man. Hold on, let me make sure we're freaking good. We are editing for freaking Eddie or whatnot. Yeah, 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 I'm saying. Um, and yeah, yeah, the song is Nico Ray. Yeah, we got that. Once again, good job. Do a video. Please. I request it. Uh, 
a request. The potential of you doing a video for that freaking song, you know what I'm saying? Just make sure it's good quality. Uh, have a good freaking time with it. You can sort of uh, lump it in with another record if you need to, to sort of, you know, if any kind of extension needs to happen or whatnot. But like, honestly, what a family you can call us. You got this to two minutes and 44. It's just, it's just shy of freaking three minutes. It's not freaking bad there. Uh, I'm gonna throw this on the what, that dorky West Coast playlist and stuff like that, and put you a part of freaking that thing. Hold on real quick, let me add it there, and then we got Rio coming up freaking next. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me your fucking, 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 give me your fucking. West, that dorky West Coast. If any of y'all records make my playlist, by the way, uh, always take note of the records that do. Um, and know to eventually send the same record on other platforms, right? Like the YouTube, the SoundCloud, the Spotify. And again, on different episodes is what I mean. Like, you know, if you said that today, it got on the freaking playlist or whatnot. Uh, it could be tomorrow. It could be next week or some shit like that. Just make sure you, f you know, fill those bases if you want that, that song to be added to the other freaking playlist or whatnot. Because I tend to wait until I hear it again to go into those platforms. It takes way too much time to sort of like, all right, now let me go find it on YouTube. And then, like, I'm not going to go search for all those things and then individually do it like that. Uh, all right, so let me see what we got. Rio, no, wait, I gotta load it up differently. Let's put it in officially like this. Okay, I don't know what I just did right now. Hello? Where did I go? Oh, come on, and I'm stuck here. I gotta, I gotta load my freaking thing up real quick. In case y'all trying to send skips of your own. Sir Mike, this song's gonna burn like some hot sauce from hot ones in your eyes. Birdman will talk to an actual bird like I'm gonna chew through this beat like a termite. Don't make me put you or actual worms lie. Don't like my old shit. I'm thinking you were high like me when I'm looking down at a bird's eye view when I'm cool, but her act like you surprised. Hey to McDonald's, I'm about to steal your fries standing outside. Alright, let me get the the thing running again. I know diamonds are the things that you wish that you had, but homie. Oops. Go back. I know diamonds are the things that you wish that you had, but homie. <laughs> Who cares, man? Just put it in, damn it. Alright. Here we go. Jeez. Try to freaking go through freaking stuff. Alright, Rio. Uh, now something was ha I was trying to download this and every freaking time I do it keeps saying It's probably something I'm figuring my end or whatnot. There's no way though that I've exhausted Most of the space on my freaking shit if I have I, could, I need to upgrade my um, My thing or whatnot, but I'm gonna play it directly from the email We should be freaking good. It's called my lord by Al Rio Rate this in the chat, one of ten, and all feedback is welcome, of course. I put that on my lawn. Can't even have no trust in people. I put my faith in God. They're retro, we got you after this. To the death of me, you know my least of scars. Ain't even the bearded man, but place it on the arms. I look up to the stars, high up off of Mars. Free my niggas till it's back or straight up out the bars. Take the ball, 
There you go, Ashton. There's a lot of times you ain't got people you can call and shit If you freaking see a ghost playing with a ball and shit Half of the shit you go through in a rap game, you all a quit I don't know what's happening, but I will rap again I'm like an African, matter of fact, I don't even know Like even if you all legit, but listen man If like, why you, uh, you dropped the beat out to I ain't got the beat out to me <laughs> um, Alright, Big Solo, what do y'all think about that? Not bad, man. Now, Al Rio, this is the freaking thing, man. If you are hearing him for the first time, you know, you'll never freaking know the amount of freaking stuff that, of course, he does freaking have. Um, Any given time he sends to the show, and depending on it, on when you hear him, you know, it could be a vibe. It could be something that, you know, you'd hear, you know, little brother, common, you know, Kanye or something like that freaking on. Or it could be something, you know, more, uh, you know, young Jeezy-esque, um, you know, uh, Gucci, you know what I'm saying? So, certain things, again, it's more more trap-centric uh, or big body bands riding around the freaking corner in slow motion as you got freaking uh, sunglasses freaking on and are not into the freaking screen and... and you know, unison and all that freaking good stuff. This right here, fairly decent mix, still needs, you know, a little bit of work to freaking get there as you're still working on it, of course. I think finish that for freaking sure. Uh, a nice feature would be dope with an artist who gets in there a little bit faster, right? Because you take the slower approach when you sort of rap and get on certain things. Um, if you have someone, you know, that sort of takes the more chopper flow kind of, you know, route and has a different voice signature, it could be a nice contrast between, uh, you guys or whatnot, but I like the vibe, the beat does its freaking thing or whatnot. Again, sampled and trap mixed together for me is that nice middle ground between hip hop and, you know, trap or, you know, Southern, you know what I'm saying, rap and freaking stuff like that. So big freaking salute. What up, you said, hey, man, you know what I'm saying, sent you a beat, you know what I'm saying, of mine, it's brand new, that's what's freaking good, you know what I'm saying, appreciate you, Bree was freaking good, said, yo, said, this, that part was, uh, kind of off, you know what I'm saying, maybe a better mix would help, agree, 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 you said, unk slid on that, you know what I'm saying, it was just freaking fire, that's what's up, shout out to freaking Manny, uh, you said, only thing is, I would take out the girl part on the, uh, who's that, uh, in the freaking car and stuff like that. Um, let me see. You said the coke look good. <laughs> the coke look good, bro. I pulled it out of the freaking thing right now. Which one is it? Is that was that is that daredevil on the freaking coke too? How sway? Shout out to Marvel, man. Getting their finger shit. Out. I was just realizing, man, because the other one we had like just Deadpool figuring on it or whatnot. I like that they're they're making use of their freaking characters, I guess, or whatnot. But yeah, shout out to freaking Daredevil getting getting some freaking love or whatnot. You know what I mean? I think I think that deserves a little bit of a clap right freaking now. For shout out to Matt Murdock, man. Here's to Matt, everyone. Oh. All right, last uh paid skip for the freaking moment at least for what we can freaking see we should be back in a free line after this one which of course is the retro i know diamonds are the things that you wish that you had but homie I'm
Now this one says, this the opener for the mixtape I'm working on. I produced it myself. Promise this is different and so like that. Now it's all freak. Listen, whatever you want to freaking send me is all up to you guys. The fun of this show is literally just knowing that any given record can be anything on the show. Anytime we freaking stream and do this damn thing. Uh, hold on. Put that freaking right there. Also, uh, you, where are you at in the freaking chat right now? Uh, Retro Ron, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that part kind of freaking off. It's on there. Yeah, okay, so Retro, uh, I need a number from you, 1 to 10, because again, as I said, anytime an artist skips the line that gets us to or past 100, 200, or 300, we will always allow you to spin the giveaway wheel before everybody else. Like, everyone else in the building has to wait till the end of the stream if they want to participate to the uh, in the giveaways and or just hit the 100, 200, 300, you know what I'm saying, vice versa in there. So you hit the 100 right now, so that means we can, at least for you, give you the golden ticket. saying give me a moment because i gotta i gotta add the actual freaking thing over freaking here hold on da, 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 da. that is the wheel magically freaking appeared uh and so all i need is a number to shuffle you said yeah one to ten just one to ten i'm gonna shuffle the giveaway wheel and with that number shuffle is up there here are some of the prizes, right? Mm-hmm. And the show freaking skip kind of freaking thing. Uh, da, 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 da. And there are freaking more, of course. Let me see, you said four. All right. So just so you can see. Let me go up here. One, two, three, four. All right. And then click on the wheel. People are like, what are you doing? Showing your camera, you posting a social media video? Nah. We're gonna play your song right now as well. I'll explain whatever gonna gift you get. Uh, sorry, I can't bring you on the street. I'll explain what each freaking thing is. This one might be a combination. Okay, so this one, essentially, QS Dork Radio and or it's so, okay. So if you choose this one, right? This one essentially is a skip that works on both my stream as well as, you know what I'm saying? There, there's another stream ran by freaking Dave Hernandez uh, called QSJ Radio. Uh, essentially, he has his own app, um, I believe, on the uh, App Store and, um, you know what I'm saying, Google and freaking stuff like that. Uh, a dope uh, sort of freaking host. He doesn't necessarily review all the freaking time. I always uh, tend to look at him more as, you know what I'm saying, radio host. But then also, there will be some songs that will, you know, incite him to want to freaking talk about it a little bit. But he's a great uh, uh, freaking dude. And the skip would work on both my show and his show. Or... You can simply trade that in for a two song back to back skip, um, which would basically give you two skips uh, or well, no, it's uh, it's basically two. Uh, but yeah, it's it's two songs, one freaking skip or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? That you could use future reference up to freaking you. You just let me freaking know which one or whatnot. Now. Again, I still haven't made the sort of like the cutaway that will show you sort of like who who the other, you know, stream are and stuff like that. Once I freaking do, it'll sort of like help you guys sort of assess whether or not you want to keep that as that. Some of you guys have been to some of the other freaking streams that I might have combo skips freaking for and stuff like that. Jeezy Radio, uh, you know what I'm saying? When Uplifted was uh, freaking live, I had stuff for that. MDRS, I had freaking... Um, you know what I'm saying? Skips for Thunderground Radio. I also have 
Um, you know what I'm saying? Skips for as well and uh, stuff like that. So he said, I'll take that back to back. All right, so I'll credit you for a back to back. We'll get in, go back into the line up as we were. Again, it is a SoundCloud link. So we can just jump in there. No, don't throw it over that. Let me go back real quick. Let me freaking go for you to the blow. Me to be the blow. Me to be the blow. All right, Retro Vaughn. Lift off. You don't want me to go rip your freaking lips off. I like dancing with you, girl, because your hips off. People call me Chris, nigga, and Kristoff. Fur nearly a dick on a dick. See where he goes. All these bitches big as fumble got a disco. I got this whole bitch jumping, got a crisscross. But really ain't no beefy on your own. Ain't no problem, got a Houston bitch waiting for the lift go. Tell the issue, what it got a ride for it. Die for it, gotta die for it. I'ma have to pop out at the cut, tell him bitch what I love. Go that shit that he was sorry, he might die for. Sis to get his face lit They too basic, they can be the greatest And my bitch too bad, can't just take it to my room Gotta take it to the attic, got the basement In the regular heat, this shit hellfire Pandemonium shit, we build empires I'ma get it with you on my own set Regardless, I'ma make it four words, I'ma live by Kicks with all four bitch, yeah, cause you know I'm out of blow. Just watch y'all rock out the show. Ain't see me switch, I stick to the code. I gotta big figure King out where coming it's going. up now, I'm grown. Man of the house, bitch, big LV. Man of the house, you can't leave me alone to the go. Be a hoe, just not around me. Little bitch, that's big fast. Call him out till we end my did that. They be talking that shit, I sit back. Ain't slide, I'm just waiting for the get back. Ain't slots when the chop is playground. I'm stepping on shit, what you say now? Stay tan on the feet, what you want on the bitch? Two tens of my DMs getting faded now. Wasting my time, so I broke it off. I'm what you paid, I ain't broke it off. So that I'm what you paid, I ain't broke it off. Don't need a bitch, they made my focus off. Y'all be copy y'all. Can't accept that I'm next to the top. I told y'all that I can't wait no turns. I'ma let this shit burn, cause the ratchet too high. Okay, so there's a little bit, of, a few switch ups in here, which was unexpected, but nice. I think there's one more. I think it's a button I can't see. There's a lot of things to think about, or I dream about things that I just can't be. Also, too faded. Too faded. I be fashion, bitch, and I skate. I be cashing, not the whole bank. Ain't doing shit if I'm not raging. Bad bitch bounce to the cadence on my crash out too hard. Maybe someone lazy, I'm a blackout. Bad mouth, mama, no crazy. Make it act out, back it out, make it go insane. Little bitch that's big fast what? Call him out till we have my did that They be talking that shit, I sit back Ain't slide, I'm just waiting for the get back Ain't slots when the chop is a playground I'm stepping on shit, what you say now? Spend 10 on the big, what you want on the bitch? Two tens of my DMs getting faded now All of the time when you know that you know, you know I don't know what I'm gonna do when you know I don't I like this very 80s production here. Reminds me of uh, Far Cry Blood Dragon a little bit. It reminds me of Far Cry Blood Dragon. The soundtrack. Um, that was dope. Hey, chat. Now, again, different freaking sections uh, freaking within, which was an unexpected freaking change. But was freaking dope. And, and like that second half, I was trying to figure out like, yo, what is happening? Where is it going? Right? Like we had to figure out where, like where where and how the beat was changing because it did switch up almost freaking completely. Um let me get back in here. Yeah, like you you do a you go into like a whole thing and it makes it kind of freaking epic, right? So if you have the right sort of like visuals to something freaking like this, like this definitely would uh you know what I'm saying go off, right? And I feel like it has to almost tell a freaking story visually as it switches from one thing to another, right? Like and it almost should be 
a the whole video should take place as a old school kind of like video game situation or whatnot whether like you are in a noir kind of 80s um you know detective kind of i don't freaking know think of the shit like you visually like i have certain certain things in my freaking head or whatnot right and then like you know maybe as it's going to that second half it feels like you're getting to like a final boss or you're getting to like a bonus level like there's, there are certain things that that you can do with that that i just think will bring this one you know what i'm saying a lot but hold on let me get Trying to figure out what I was thinking. Can't figure out what I was freaking thinking and, and stuff like that. There was something. It's so one thing that I that I um, might have wanted to freaking change, but I don't know. Can't remember what it is and so like that. But not freaking bad. Um, you know, I just I kind of want to see the video and see what you do, how you elevate uh, that and stuff. You know, good luck, uh, of course. Thank you for so I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? That was my main goal. Really want to put the listener, you know, saying in the world and so like that. Hey, okay, well then, you know, thank you for putting in the time to put in that freaking work or whatnot. There are too many artists out there that kind of like they have no problem with being too simple, uh, and just you know really letting the beat be the main thing that you know elevates and takes the record to places or whatnot when again it always should be the artist at the end of the day you guys have to, have to be dope enough to where if we took out the beat completely and it's just you there's still a dope record there's still a dope artist freaking in there right uh and in some cases that's that's a situation that actually happens you guys will go and perform live at places and the records you feel the most right dj had cut off the freaking beat completely just have the spotlight on you the crowds yelling and and you know enjoying because they seeing you in like a a candid you know what i'm saying moment or you just really feel it feeling emotional about you know maybe like losing somebody and the song was about that or whatnot and you know what i'm saying the crowd loves that kind of shit you know what i mean literally you guys have no no idea how much you guys can just you know not even do your music and just talk to the freaking crowd and shit like that they just want to know you're a real person you go through things and then when you're about to perform your songs the records sound and feel even more better because they know that you've been through something um and even more again when they know for a fact you've been through something I'm telling you music hits so much freaking harder one of my homies uh that i had grew up with uh eventually we linked back up again you know he was still doing music and stuff um and he started coming in sending his stuff you know to the freaking show and one of the things that i absolutely love was that most of the things that he was talking about from you know when he was talking about you know maybe like uh, his uncle or things that he had went through when he was freaking younger and so like that like i knew what he was talking about and it was all real it wasn't no like let me rap to rap and just say some shit randomly because everybody else talks about this it was 100 percent uncut pure freaking you know again what i look at is hip-hop when you get in there talk tell your freaking story essentially and you know say it in a dope way so people can uh take it in so i felt freaking that now let me let you know for a future reference because you do since you won that um the two song back to back uh when you do want to send that actual freaking skip in on a future episode or something like that you have to make sure that you hashtag free skip and then hashtag two song back to back skip in the subject line of the email that you will be using it for. So always make sure you freaking do that when you win a skip on the show. If you're paying for a freaking skip, it'll help if you kind of freaking do the same thing just to, you know, uh, help us keep track of how many specific, you know, whatever it was, you know, PayPal, Cash App. Um, and or different things like that but yeah appreciate you for freaking that we're gonna go ahead and jump back into the free line as of right now bro it's two in the morning fell asleep and i'm yawning waking up on the lawn i'm seeing blue and orange people follow me to school and copy me until i stopped and put my music on i'm just crawling like a zombie gnawing on a nazi probably in his uniform born identity homie you've been warned my brain is always like a unicorn Let's put this in. 
What are you pouring in? Where are you pouring in? How are you prepping in? How are you pouring? Alright, what did you say? Why you said you got banned? Uh, banned up. This is Kevin. It's called I Will Love You. Oh, I will always love you. So I'll go. Sounds like a ghost. I I I'd be scared as hell if, like, I went into a supposed haunted house, turned on the machine, hit record, nothing came up, and then when I went back home to listen to it, this popped up. Are you serious? <laughs> I do not like this. Nope. We're hitting that button. I have to hit it. What up, car? Oh my gosh. Oh, hey. All right, that one right freaking there felt like, honestly, what an old dog goes through when they lose their owner. You know what I'm saying? When their owner dies and they're also a dog, but they're old. And then, you know, and it feels like if they could talk, that's what they would, you know, say and shit like that. But it's also a little bit of a ghost, you know what I'm saying, kind of situation. Uh, is uh, I'm curious about the choice though to even try to do that song in that way. It just didn't match at all. So I do feel like there's way more that you can freaking do to you know sort of better whatever you were freaking trying. But like you know that is a freaking challenge. To be honest, like I I don't even think like a rapper or could really flip that beat and make it into something yet. Like I've I've I thought about it. I was like, you know what? I want to challenge myself with with something that I don't necessarily at all really want to kind of sample that I don't think really could make something freaking dope. Uh, and that was always one of those. It's very specific. It, it's a ballad. It has many different parts freaking to it. And you could don't get me wrong. You could freaking sample it, but in a dope way, right? You know, I think Ye would be up for the freaking challenge for freaking sure. Um, but yeah, I just I just wasn't feeling that right there, all right now. Um, you know, I appreciate you trying to do at least something kind of different in terms of the, uh, um, you know, not just making the exact same freaking song per se. But I, I still think it was not there yet at all. Um, hold on, what did I do, man? No, what kind of what is this? Uh, hold on. Pull up real freaking quick. Real fit. Uh, unreleased drops 420. Hey, Lil Yoda. With Mob. Let me see if I play this on 420. Get the second 
this shit up, swear to God, like Harlem. Make this say like Harlem shake. Man, y'all niggas sweet like cake. I can't fuck with none of y'all niggas. I know some of y'all niggas work for Jake. Got hella clips just like a movie. Lil' bitch slurp me up like smoothie. All these niggas do is dick, right? I swear to God, these niggas fruity. Yeah, put me the ass like Uzi. Yeah, some of y'all niggas got mine on booty. Niggas know how we do it. Yeah, the money inside get right into it. They wonder how we do it. <laughs> Honestly, I got a little bit of a loop and shit. I don't know what the hell I'ma do, but you either rap by yourself or you in a group and shit. Every time that I do this shit, I'ma freaking like make a whole song and send it to Ludacris. Not a fact, man, when you can sit freaking down and you thinking that there are things that like you would. Uh... Honestly, I like the beat. That's what kept me in there mostly. Energy was freaking cool. It did sound repetitive, and you know, it didn't necessarily get me to want to hit that door key and play that. But I was just about freaking there. I still feel like there's a lot of work that needs to be freaking done, and I'm honestly, you know, you got you you got lucky. That's that's all I can really freaking say. You know, what I'm saying about freaking that. Uh, but there are uh, or is potential. Are you like what it? Free space, you know what I'm saying? Uh, there's no, oh, some features until, um, but see, that don't make sense. I'll just up on up freaking that. And then I guess I'll figure that out when we freaking get to it. Let's go ahead and jump back in the uh, free line. Uh, though, as we proceed, continuing, let me close some of these other windows. As well, close the window. Hey. Why didn't I close that one a long time ago? Uh, that one we can have out. All right, this is Surge with Bad Decisions. This is search with bad decisions. A lot of times, you know I'm wishing to be freaking talking about freaking the people that you missing. I don't even know what the hell I'ma do, but man, this isn't. We be taking the pain away, talking like it's Tylenol. Gotta lean on and gotta get away from alcohol. Back in the day, fucking slutty girls up in the bathroom stall. Walking around that bitch like I really fucking own the hoes. They ain't know the bills, but they hit your fifth. But I'm Drea, send some, send some fire. This one's oh. self-explanatory, man. It was just too, it was too repetitive and kind of monotone and stuff. You know what I'm saying? You have some decent melodies, but then that's it. Like when, again, when we're hearing the same thing over and over, it kind of gets boring, especially if you only stay down at that. You can't do that, man. You have to at least go from a low tone to eventually the higher, you know, octaves and stuff like that. Um, but I don't even know if your voice can do that, right? The yeah, but the but the do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but the but the like you, you got to be able to go up a few octaves to really bring the energy up in the uh, the room or stuff like that, right? Because staying in your comfort zone is not really going to impress. It's gonna be there. It's gonna be just all right, but you don't want all right. Like all right does not get you signed to situations. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's a label. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Or just simply getting, you know, picked up to perform at some place or something like that. 
Um, but we'll go back anything and add. So groovy, man. What's good, man? What's good? Welcome to the freaking stream. Uh, we got Rencore up next. La Luna is La Mint. Let's see what you got, girl. Quite a bit just to you know get it at a, a level that was you know sustainable to freaking listen to uh because it was kind of freaking loud you know what i'm saying as soon as all the instruments sort of came in but from what i was able to hear like the melodies and sort of like what you were saying was freaking dope it just needs that professional freaking touch when it comes to the mix again it's a little bit harsh right now on the ears um and on top of that it's on spotify already right now right so one of the things that I try to help, you know, at least get across to you guys is do not upload your record to all platforms like that until the record is ready. Basically, if it's ready for you to do a music video to it right now, then yes, upload it to freaking, you know what I'm saying, all freaking platforms. But if it's not, wait until you get that done because you're going to dilute the platform. It used to be that when, you know what I'm saying, we, when it came to like Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, you know what I'm saying, Tidal, freaking th different things like that, not everybody even knew how to get their music on all platforms like that. Like TuneCore wasn't a sort of like worldwide known sort of freaking thing. Uh, and, you know, at first there might have even been a situation where you had to sort of like hit someone specific up to get it, to make it happen. Then eventually TuneCore was a freaking thing. Then yada, 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 whatnot. Um but you want to have a standard right um soundcloud band lab you know the those are things that you know people expect the mixes to not always be there the freaking 
you know the performances still need work they they expect more indie stuff from those platforms so you can play around with that and everything else again once you're paying to have something on a freaking platform you got to put your all into that freaking first or whatnot so that's all i'm gonna freaking say in terms of that again one is freaking 10 give all your freaking uh, uh feedback we'll freaking roll through and you said hard to hear the vocal you know what i'm saying shame miss luck said man and that's what i was freaking saying that is what i was saying and what you say he said come on doug i want to hear i then I want to hear your version of I will always love. Nah, well, now I'm going to have to freaking make that freaking shit. We'll see what freaking happens. Is that nice smooth sounds? Uh, you know what I'm saying? From that so freaking groovy. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Is it order to play? Why? Uh, did it change? And stuff like that. So all music has to come to my freaking email and stuff like that. Anytime you come into the freaking building or whatnot, again, all music must come to my email. If you look in my description, you'll find all information freaking there. It's free to submit, but the line tends to be long because we are streaming on all platforms at the same time. It's not just you in the freaking building. Again, as I said, we have been streaming for about, uh, you know what I'm saying, six or freaking seven freaking hours. So we are running freaking through, uh, you know what I'm saying, a mod, you know what I'm saying, watch that as well. But yeah, make sure that you get in there and uh send it to my email so you can get yourself in line and when your song comes up pretty much we will freaking play it outside of uh that you can send a skip if you want to get played immediately or if you have more than one of your songs that you actually want played in a back-to-back -back fashion you can send a cash app paypal and or super chat on the youtube side and we'll actually you know what i'm saying run those things uh back to back we also have a skip called the skipping clip that will allow us to uh, record the full review and reaction, uh, you know, uh, it, to your freaking song and upload it to several platforms. Some of those you actually can see right now on my freaking TikTok and stuff like that. So go go check some of those out if you want to know what those are essentially freaking like. But right now, let me go ahead and get back in the line up for you guys. Appreciate y'all freaking time as we are. Still going into the freaking thing. And at the end of the stream, we will do a giveaway on the freaking show. If you guys are able to cry out. Uh, let me see. Armani Music, we got you coming up. We're back against the wall. Let's see what is good. Ah, oh, come on. Is it really going to freaking do that? Hold on. Let me re refresh. Let me see if it's actually freaking doing that. I can't. I might have to take and delete let me delete the stuff that i have in the download folder just to make i guess uh space just in case that's gonna affect something real quick so we're trying to download it right now and it all right go here uh let's see what we got oh right, yeah let me delete these yeah, that was quite a bit. All right. Send it to the trash can. What about this? I uh, don't know. Oh, no. I know what that is. But why is that in that folder is the question. So I'm taking over from cinematic. We don't necessarily need that one. Let's go ahead and... Give me a moment. Sorry about that, guys. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, there we go. Just had to elevate that. All right, now we should be able to save. Do not add it to Google Drive. I hate when it freaking does that. Do not add it to Google Drive, my friends. My friends and children, I will have you know your mother's foot smells. Jeremy Caesar. What a ten in our feedback is welcome. You already know what it is. Me in here. Not again, JC. Come on back 
against the wall. Only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life began hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. Started running from my problems, but I knew it had to finish. And I ain't got no time to waste, so I've been handling my business. Hardest thing about this life is how the fuck you supposed to live it. Conversations in my head, sometimes I really wanna end it. I can't focus on my losses, cause I'm the only one to blame. Been through hell and back so many times, I think I learned my way. Being broke just hurt my conscience, got my stomach feeling nauseous. Had to rap to make it out, I swear that was my only option. Used to hate the way I look, that's why I ain't never had no friends. I'm already featuring critics, cause I ain't never followed trends. Niggas think they know me well, but they ain't seen the shit I seen. My head's hurting every day, cause I'm carrying my dreams. It's my back against the wall, only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life began hard. Told myself that I'm a man. Make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. Put my back against the wall. The only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life began hard. So myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through I a puddle. Thank God for the struggle and what he did to get me through it. I spit words of inspiration, cause these kids listen to music. And I pray for my city, you know these young is gonna be foolish. Everybody want money, even a rapper gonna abuse. Tryna stay dry, but falling tears gonna keep my shirt wet. I sit through shit even when I know I don't deserve it I call for help and ain't get shit, I know you heard that Tryna be tough and take the punch, but got a bird test My nigga don't get it, some smoke and I call second hand Seem like the devil don't want me to be a better man Arrows between me and the streets and I'm the lesser than I hit my knees and I ask God for him to bless my hand Niggas be telling me to chill, I do this every day Ain't punch the clock in better year, I need a better way Guess I ain't caring about my future, living day to day I can't get high The wall. Only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life began hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. Put my back against the wall. Only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life began hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. You are just jamming with the hottest disc jockey. DJ Torque Genius. Alright, so first thing that I noticed that was actually figuring decent, figuring within here, you know, well, 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 no, let's, let's go with the, you know, first aspect that it's a life music record, right? You know what I'm saying? Anytime you hear a life music record, we got to hear one of these. You know, you always hear sort of like a piano backing in terms of the production on these kind of freaking records. Uh, the artists will basically often have no choice but to be real. Like, they can't bullshit. They can't do no, you know, talk about some funny shit. You know what I'm saying? It's got to be like, let me talk about my life. You know what I'm saying? Struggles, the problems I go through, the people I lost and stuff like that. That's all that it ever requires. Um, and you know, that did follow freaking suit. The mix was actually pretty freaking decent as well. Like, as soon as your vocals came in, I was like, okay, and he's not like oversaturating with auto tune and stuff. Like, we can hear, we can't, when, when you don't overdo things, we can feel your record a little bit more. We have, we have the full ability to like really believe what you're freaking going through. And to see your your actual conviction and stuff like that. So, you know, you actually were allowed to sort of, you know, get in there. Appreciate you for, you know, doing the actual freaking job. The feature on there did a, did a decent job, too. He had some layers and harmonization that sort of, uh, you know, brought it to another level. I love when you have a, a, a good feature to contrast, you know, with yourself to... Um, you know, elevate the record as opposed to getting the same exact artist on the record and stuff. Uh, but yeah, let us all know how you guys feel about that, man. Again, we run everything on a, a one. Ooh, Mr. Chilino had a run it freaking back on freaking that and shit like that. Listen, Chilino is often 
uh, someone who, uh, you know, is a hard critic. We'll just see if you can say that or whatnot. So often you'll hear things um, that, you know, he'll be on the opposite side. Complete dorky don't play that. You know what I'm saying? Just like straight up. Hell no. Nah. There can never be too many books, but living without the internet would suck and shit would get weird like too many cooks. So if you're just... always getting robbed, there's too many crooks. <laughs> So one more time, and then we'll be, we'll be back in the free line again. I don't believe so. My back against the wall, only man I fear is God. I was troubled by my past, it's from my life begin hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. Started running from my problems, but I knew I had to finish. And I ain't got no time to waste, so I've been handling my business. Hardest thing about this life is how the fuck you supposed to live it. Conversations in my head, sometimes I really wanna end it. I can't focus on my losses, cause I'm the only one to blame. Been through hell and back so many times, I think I learned my way. Being broke just hurt my conscience, got my stomach feeling nauseous. Had to write to make it out, I swear that was my only option. Used to hate the way I look, I swear I ain't never had no friends. I was sticking to myself, cause I ain't never followed trends. Niggas think they know me well, but they ain't seen the shit I seen. My head's hurting every day, cause I'm carrying my dreams. My back against the wall, only man I fear is God. I was troubled about my past, it's from my life begin hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. Put my back against the wall, only man I fear is God. I was troubled about my past, it's from my life begin hard. Told myself that I'ma make it, don't wanna see my family struggle. Just so many tears and I feel like I'm walking through a puddle. I thank God for the struggle and what he did to get me through it. I speak words of inspiration cause these kids listen to music. And I pray for my city, you know these young we gonna, gonna jump right from this into the next record. Even a rap and gonna abuse. Tryna stay so we don't get like a skip or something. I sit through shit even when I know I don't deserve it. I call for help and ain't get shit. I know you heard that. Trying to be tough and take the punch, but got a bird test. My nigga don't got it some smoke and I'll call second hand. Seems like the devil don't want me to be a better man. Arrows between me and the streets and I'm the lesser than. I hit my knees and I ask God for him to bless my hand. Niggas be telling me to chill, I do this every day. Ain't punch the clock in better year, I need a better way. Guess I ain't caring about my future living day to day. By the way, that's that tone I'm talking no about right there. Keep the away. Put my back against the wall. Only listen, man listen, I listen. Hold on, hold on. We're we going to end it freaking right there. But that's the stuff that I love to freaking point out, right? That is what I am talking about, right? You have two artists who take two different approaches. One who's like, just at the standard sort of back against the wall. Da, 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 da. He gets in there, has the sort of, you know, de decent melodies, even though he's in a more standard freaking state. And then the features able to go a little bit freaking higher, giving a variation on that record. So you have more to look forward to on the song. If both of them take, if took both like the same exact approach or, you know, had, you know, lower energy, like again, you kind of get bored a little bit with the song and their overall freaking approach, but you know, good job. <laughs> From both of y'all. Hopefully that record takes you to places where your back is not against the wall. But yeah. Shout out, shout out. We got Maze up next with Crash. Let's go ahead and throw this in. It's Maze, nigga. I come from that dirty side I'm from where they slide The same day they fucking brother died Showing no remorse You hit his hoe she from that other side Come on Baby, throw that ass back Smack all on the ass Thumb all in the ass crack If she leave with us No, she ain't never coming back I was 18 years old I seen my uncle smoke crack Every night I pray for God To get that monkey off his back So much built up anger A nigga tried me I might crash Ain't no squashing beef Boy, we forever on your ass I know a couple niggas smoke a wood, then get it done She got her hands all in my pants, it ain't my dick, babe, it's a gun Come on, struggle turn me to a monster Whole thing she gon' trick me, all my cheese, I ain't no sucker If your bitch actin' weird around that nigga, she done fucked him If all you do is drink all fucking day, babe, I can't trust him Now people she just don't like that nigga, dog. You hear that sound, that mean I'm sliding in that big body 
sticking out your chest, boy, I'm a man, I don't feel nobody. Dissing on the gram, I can't respond, I'm with your hope, probably. Cutting all my ties, I had to get my bands up. Pillow talking to them hoes, but that's gonna get you fucked up. Steady losing all my friends, I had to get my bucks up. It's maze, nigga. I come from that dirty side I'm from where they slide The same day they fucking brother died Showing no remorse You hit his hoe up She from the other side Come on Baby, throw that ass Daddy, back Smack all on the ass side. Thumb all in the ass crack Daddy, If she live with us No, she ain't never coming back I was 18 years old I seen my uncle smoke crack Every night I pray for God Daddy, To get, get the, the monkey off, off his back, back. Daddy, It's Daddy, mad, Daddy, nigga Daddy, Daddy, Daddy. Okay, really freaking quick. Um, vibes. No, not vibes. What the fuck am I talking about, man? Get your mind right. Get your mind right. Uh, beat is freaking dark. You know what I'm saying? Hard hitting. Uh, production is freaking nice. Uh, uh, overall approach to the record is kind of repetitive, but you have certain a certain energy freaking there that sort of like, you know, kept me in. And I was sort of like in and out. I didn't know there was something that sort of turned me off. And then just something that was like, but then, you know, I can tell you can rap. It's just a certain, you know, style that's being freaking used uh, on here, um, which I feel like just takes a little bit of getting used to for, uh, you know what I'm saying, certain freaking people or whatnot, right? And I do want to see like how that translates, you know, live, you know, how you perform uh, freaking things. And I want to see how you do on like different, um, you know, production and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Give your thoughts. Give your thoughts. Uh, you know what I'm saying? We'll try to play a few more freaking records. And then we will probably just gear up for the freaking giveaway. Head out for the freaking night. Come back freaking tomorrow. As per you, you will. Let's see what's up. Uh, next up, we got Your Love by RNS Mari. So let's see what you have. The arrival as a challenger, don't she? Yeah, too many swears, two point or two point zero. But every single night I send a call for you. Crying out for you, crying out for you. Freaking rap to your song. Can you freaking shh? Calm down, sir. <laughs> ah, ladies and gentlemen, the boys and girls. Uh, uh, 
So good vibes overall. Uh, uh, yeah, there are good vibes in there. Um, you know, you do hit a monotone freaking state, but there's variation in the vocals. So there's that. The mix does need freaking work. It doesn't sound professional, you know, saying just yet. I do feel like there were some parts where there could have been like, you know, an echo and of course some of the end parts, you know what I'm saying? Need ya, need ya, love, 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 you know what I'm saying? Uh, you need, anytime you're using auto-tune at all on a record, you need the right type of reverb and delay combination, period. That is the only way these records sound even better to the human freaking ear and stuff like that. When you hear it, like, you know what I'm talking about. It's sort of like a very atmospheric kind of, you know, feel like the artist is singing in space or some shit, you know what I'm saying? And it's not too much, right? It just has, it It, it, it needs that perfect amount, right along with the good mix, whatever, however you record and stuff like that. I always recommend artists, you know, eventually, like, look, test out your songs however which way that you want. As you guys are recording yourselves right now, uh, uh, maybe sometimes off your phones and you, using, you know, earbuds and different things like that. Record however you need to starting off because, you know, you need to practice as much as possible to see, like, what are the best approaches for you to take uh, in terms of performing your freaking songs and stuff like that. But when you get ready to, like, really professionally release the songs, right? do go and re-record them at a studio, right? Essentially, there are some times when we might add too many things to our rec. Like, if we're only recording our freaking self and we like we have nobody right there to sort of say anything, right? That we don't know what are the things that shouldn't be on the record, right? If you have that, if you have another engineer, they literally will be able to be like, you know what? I couldn't understand you right there. Can you re-record that part, please? You know what I'm saying? Can you, hey, you should say it like this because it sounded weird or whatnot, or you were off beat right there. Fix that shit. Like they will let you know right away all of the mistakes that you make so that you don't, um, you know, have really anything else to sort of freaking add and shit like that. They're going to freaking hear all of the you know, problems that other people might, you know, uh, sort of, you know, come a freaking cross or whatnot. And if you don't have, you know, the right engineer, they just gonna take your money, record you, let you do whatever you freaking want, let you walk out that freaking door and not say shit. But the ones that, that, that care about their freaking craft, like they know that the work that they do, you know, they only get paid if other people hear the mixes that they do and then like it you know what i'm saying so if all of a sudden you know they're not doing the the job and you know like it's it's one of those freaking things but yeah uh good melodies um i feel like harmonization on this the second half of the freaking chorus freaking two because you gotta go i need you need you you do that two times and then you do it another two times that second half have a higher tone i need you need you love you know what i'm saying have a you know, again, whether it's a male or female freaking artist or you going in a little bit freaking higher tone, I feel like that would be dope. But again, I don't know if I'm only hearing you guys in the lower half of the tone, you know, somewhat monotone sort of freaking state. I literally am not going to know what your capability is until you sort of freaking do it and stuff. So, but again, it's just something that I hear that could be freaking added. Do what you got to freaking do, possibly, or not to be. Next up. Let's go. Let's go. Solo, 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 solo,
Chasing the bag, never get told. I got the bags like a bag for the road. Time to go get it, wait, let's go. You only get some, 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 some. Well, I get the most. Fuck all the cash and give me the gold. Chasing the bag, never get told. I got the bags like a bag for the road. Time to go get it, wait, let's go. You only get some, 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 some. Well, I get the most. Ain't feel ashamed for the life I chose. I'm the only one who's close to the show. Cracking the code, hot like a stove. You mad that you broke. Solo, 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 Freaking jump up off of the freaking building like Batman. People always be telling me that they freaking trap, man. And there's a lot of ah oh, pieces of cheat. I, li- I like that. I went to remix, man. Remix. That shit makes me want to go on an adventure while I'm rapping. Uh, so there were certain elements freaking on here that I did feel like still needed uh, work in terms of, you know, your approach on that sort of like first uh, verse or whatnot. Chorus I freaking liked or whatnot. Very freaking simple, you know. Uh, but I feel like it grew, it grew on me and stuff like that. Beat grew on me. Uh, you know, the sort of effects and stuff like that. All of that, you know. Uh, 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 you know, a little bit of an acquired freaking taste. But I feel like it's kind of dope or whatnot you do need again i still wouldn't fix that like first you know first freaking section you know get everything freaking perfect or whatnot always think about things in terms of again it's got to be dope enough for for people to want to say your entire verse or whatnot hey you hear that song from rnf mark you know what i mean people need to well no that, that, that wasn't it i mean again you people need to be able to freaking hear your shit and again just want to like recite it and um you know it it, it has the potential of something that i think uh you know could be there uh that second sort of half you know what i'm saying went a little bit freaking fast for a second i think i i like the switch ups um and you know it does feel like something that would have been on odd future kind of freaking uh you know, situation or whatnot. All right, 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 man. Listen, you already know what it is. Uh, we got one more that we'll freaking roll in, and then we will uh do the giveaway. Freaking head out for the freaking night. I want to thank y'all for uh, you know, what I'm saying tapping into the freaking show, of course, this evening. And uh, let me just make sure I get. <laughs> I got the right freaking file and stuff like that. Uh, I am going to stop the TikTok freaking side so I can, uh, you know what I'm saying, gear up for the giveaway as well. So make sure you guys do tap in on YouTube if you do want to be a part of the giveaway. And uh, yeah, see you guys freaking over there. Whee! Everybody! At, at the YouTube. Uh, let me see, Zach Williams, Mister Zach. Let's see what you got. Oh my gosh, there's no freaking. Way. Listen, you better. Oh my gosh, what is even freaking happening? It's not gonna let me do it like that. All right, let's see what happens. Can I play it like this? I see and. I believe a beat. Zach Williams with happy. I wouldn't be happy. I wouldn't be happy. I wouldn't be happy. So please girl don't slap me. Hey, I wouldn't be happy. Yo, 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 yo. I guess this is part of the beat. All of you all freaking don't even know what to do, but all of you, what the hell, man? Honestly, didn't even know the beat started freaking yet, technically. Here it but goes. That intro was like way too long. What the hell was that freaking shit? Like, what the hell you make it freaking that long and shit? How the hell am I supposed to like make a song? It's a lot of time when I want to be able to feel like I don't ever know what the hell you freaking are, but freaking is a lot of time when I want to be able to freaking talk shit, then go up and get a car. There's a freaking spider all on my freaking TV and I'm trying to squish it. I don't know where the hell it went, but it left when I just tried to smush it. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck? 
There's a lot of time when I'm rapping and I don't even know what to do But like right now I really think I need a napkin uh, Let me stop it though There's a lot of time when you freaking talking about freaking dope shit And then it's in the topic so freaking people get and they lose interest You don't know what to do you in this Freaking people be like you sent this to the freaking show And they're like you uh, Print this of a guy who's kinda dope I let it tie, I don't know what the hell I'm about to say where I'ma go Freaking is a lot of times where I don't even know how to rap or the where I'm about to Flow, flow, flow Who can not hear on this? Who can not hear industry wise on this? I don't even know if y'all spit all the freaking time when I wanna rhyme I don't even really know if I'm awesome There's a lot of time when I run away Cause I saw a freaking big ass freaking cat Or is it a possum? I, I don't know I gotta figure it out Let me go Why does that piano sound familiar? I feel like it's a something I've heard in a commercial You've heard that psoriasis affects 1 to 10 people In a group of 8 million people One of those kind of, you know like I heard the melody I don't know what the hell you telling me I always want to choose a celery And then I freaking tell freaking that you don't know what the hell to do When you freaking go and why you go to jail Why you freaking cool and you don't even know What the hell to do when you do to jail I again Zach Williams was freaking happy So far so good man but that intro Was kind of long that's my main freaking review initially that's my main freaking review with shit, you know I'm cool with shit Hopefully freaking all the artists they are cool with this If you cool then freaking you will be able to freaking make sure freaking that you do just spit Also, where the hell am I gonna go with for y'all? So listen, we're gonna go ahead and hop in the freaking giveaway right now Y'all know what it is man, big salute How did y'all, how and what did y'all think of that production? As we proceed, <laughs> did you say not? What did you say? Not enough swears, we Uh Listen, in terms of that production, right, freaking there. Uh, once again, uh, you know, it was nice once the drums and everything freaking dropped. Um, I think you just need again, mostly, but most sort of like intros, four bars. Four to eight bars, and then, you know, right into, you know, verse and or chorus kind of situation, right? Um, that's at least the standard that I would use if it was me. And I almost couldn't tell what was going to happen. I assume that you think the artist is going to use that time to, like, talk shit for, like, the first half. Uh, and just be like, yeah, man, y'all know what's up. Y'all didn't know we was uh, doing this shit? Nah, ha <laughs> ha. We are in forever. We we been doing this, man. Where are you? Where you been? At? I think I've taken too many drugs and I'm in another universe. And I was trying to get buzzed in the studio and do a verse, but now I'm seeing an image of Coolio on Jupiter. If I was in the hospital, I probably want to do the nurse. Out of all '80s movies, I'm watching Ferris Bueller first. I walk right up to a bully and be like, "Homie, do your worst. If you don't got any gas, a freaking razor scooter works. This one ain't for the kiddies." So Super Steve, you can curse. I'm spaced out and I probably took All right, let's see. If you in the building, if you're in the building, all you gotta do is hashtag Dork Squad in the chat. I just realized how does that, because I put it like a whole green screen kind of figure thing, but how does that not? <laughs> That's freaking crazy, man. How does that not like get lost in the freaking? Oh, I guess it's because it's a different freaking green. I don't, I don't honestly don't know, man. And you have no idea what I'm talking about. No, whatever, freaking care right now, man. I'm tired. I am tired. If you're in the building, freaking out. We are about to freaking start the giveaway and stuff like that. And uh, all you gotta do is hashtag Dork Squad in the building. If you are paying attention. We'll hit a countdown for which, again, if you're trying to get on this wheel for free, all you got to do is hit that hashtag and we should make sure to push you on the wheel. Ferris Bueller, what'd you say? As you probably one of the worst 80s newbies followed by Breakfast Club and stuff like that. You bought this cat. 
You know you capping, my brother. You know that you capping. Right now, I really think that you are overreacting. I don't know what the hell is happening, but I'm gonna slap him all of the time. Speaking all of the freaking time when I'm back in the freaking day. Listen, a lot of freaking things that I listen to is like cool, but you know it, man. I'm a blaze and you crazy. What the hell are you doing and talking about? A lot of times I'll be like hoping that you will walk about. Cause what the hell was that? Ferris Bueller's freaking day off was dope as freaking hell. I would go right back and listen and watch to the freaking home. Let me, let me, let me stop. Uh, yeah, that, it's a classic, man. Now, it might depend on when you watch it, too, though, right? You gotta have a sort of nostalgia of, uh... I'll say this. What are your, what are your top 10 80s movies? If we have to be very, like, very specific, right? Top 10. And time is up, my friend, and we shall now go into the thing. Uh, to plop. Hello? Hello? If you didn't hashtag door squad in that time limit, you are not on the wheel. You know what I'm saying? Miss Luck, you got it. I guess you're the only. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that big freaking salute. What do you say? Revenge of the Nerds, you know what I'm saying? Was 80s right? That is a good question. When I think about it, I don't necessarily have. I think it's in between 80s, somewhere in between 80s and freaking 90s, right? But let's actually. Revenge of the Nerds, uh, 1984. Wow, you know what I'm saying? Woo! Revenge, bruh. All right, that's for that's that's kind of freaking dope, but when that I have that to freaking pull from. Um, Revenge of the Nerds came out in 1984. Honestly, I don't know why they haven't done either a remake or came back with a TV show or a movie or something like that. Like, af especially after Super Bad, right? Didn't that tell you that we? We could we could use one. Where's another freaks and geeks? Well, why don't they bring that back and shit like that? Literally, just bring back a you know another freaking. Se well, didn't they kind of do? Did they do that? Did they bring back freaking? Se I like I completely forgot. My mind is all over the place, but I kind of hope that they will if they didn't. Um, but no, those are freaking good. Like, look, we could do Ghostbusters, Gremlins, uh, hold on. Back to the Future, that's my favorite, 100%. No, that that's number one for me right there. Hold on. Um, I just kind of want to look up. Uh, let's go ahead and spin a wheel for Miss Luck. Top A's movies, man. Just want to see what they consider. So here are some other 80s movies, by the way, just to pull. So I just wanted to look up to have a little bit of a reminder of some, some that I might have forgot or whatnot. Uh, E.T. I did not think about when it came to 80s movies or whatnot. Um, and honestly, it's a classic. E.T. is a classic. You know what I'm saying? It's cinematic freaking history, I think. Um... I feel like it's a, you do need to watch, you know what I'm saying, at least, you know, once or once or twice, you know what I'm saying, maybe not one to five, you know what I'm saying, kind of freaking times. Uh, not a movie that I get excited to watch, you know what I'm saying, Back to the Future sort of freaking takes that freaking kick. Top Gun was an 80s movie, Breakfast Club, a freaking course, uh, Lost Boys, Full Metal freaking Jacket, Dead Poet Society, Short Circuit, man, how can we forget about Mr. Johnny freaking five? Um... Let's see. Star Wars, of course, man. Listen, my brother, 1983, my brother. Return of the Jedi. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It came out that year. Uh, let me see. 
Wait, technically, I think Star Wars was like somewhere around like like seventy nine or something like that, right? It was it was, you know, just on the freaking cusp and right under the the eighties, but you know, getting in there. Uh, short circuit. We already freaking said that. Goonies, man, of course. Big Trouble in Little China, definitely in my top five. Big Trouble in Little and Big Trouble in Little China. Once again, another one. I have no idea why there wasn't a sequel, why there wasn't a show, why there, you know what I'm saying? Please bring it back. If I if I get to talk to Kurt Russell, I'm telling them like, bro, please, please, please make it happen. Do what you gotta freaking do. Bring us, uh, you know, a sequel to Big Trouble in Little China. We need to see that. You know what I mean? Like they have the ability to make it even freaking doper and so like that. When they, when they did it, when it was practical graphics, like it was still freaking dope. Um, let me see uh, Bloodsport with uh, John claude Van Damme. That was a good one. Honestly, I forgot to even go to the side. So there was like way more. What the freak, bro? What the freak? I didn't even go to the freaking side over here. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Hold on. Let me miss luck. I need a one to 10 from you. What do you say? Six? One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, isn't top the same thing as popular? Yeah, Ghostbusters, Scarface. I did not think about Scarface as an 80s freaking movie. That's kind of dope. So Scarface is definitely a classic as well. Little Shop of Horrors. I remember that being a classic. Talking Plant shit. We also got Raiders, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, Indiana Jones. Gremlins. The Thing was also a freaking classic. Uh, I love that one. Um, what? You got a Takeover Skip. Six songs, girl. That's what's up. Akira, the, um, Akira came out in the freaking 80s, uh, Robocop, honestly, I didn't even know that Akira was freaking that old, uh, never ending story, man, <laughs> whatever, uh, all right, so you got to take over, skip six songs. That's what's up. Be free, thirst, be sure. Karate Kid, of course. I mean, look, we can go down the line, down the freaking list or whatnot. I'm tired. I'm going to freaking sleep. See y'all later. Terminator, Terminator 2. What else? Come on, man. We ain't going to keep going around freaking here, but y'all already know the freaking deal. Dune, of course. There'd be no new Dune without the old Dune, I think. And then what's that? Six songs in a row. Yes, it is indeed. Six songs in a row. When you're done in the dead, one day in the dead. If you're not in your bed, then it's off with your head. And the land of the dead, or return of the dead, or come with the wind. Wait, what's wrong with my head? When the dawn of the dead, one day in the dead. If you're not in your bed, Talk with your head in the land of the dead or return of the dead or go with the wind. Wait, what's wrong with my head? Anyways, big figure salute. I will see you guys freaking tomorrow. Thank y'all for freaking popping in and all that freaking good stuff. Uh, and appreciate you and stuff. I mean, look, I don't even know why. My thing is this like, why do we even have to? <laughs> why do. Why, why do two completely different movies or anything for that freaking matter? Why, why does there have to be any competition between it? You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, 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 you know, for me, like, I just don't kind of freaking think that way. Uh, I've watched Ferris Bueller's, you know what I'm saying? Day off like countless freaking times. Uh, both, you know what I'm saying, when I was freaking younger and, you know what I'm saying, sort of the recent, and uh, it's, it's, it's a freaking classic or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? When we were, of course, at a time when you're in school and all you could think about is like, I wish I was not freaking here right now. Why am I in this boring ass freaking class? And all you wish you could do is like ditch for a day and go do some crazy ass shit. 
that's why Ferris Bueller's Day Off was always freaking dope and whatnot because he actually did that. He played like he was freaking sick so he could stay home, chill with his, you know what I'm saying, freaking uh, uh, girl and, you know, a best friend or whatnot. And they took the, the car on the joyride, you know, went to a, a dope parade or whatnot. You know what I mean? There, there, there's a lot to sort of take from it if you look at it in a sort of different way or whatnot, right? And then again, if you are watching from a, like, maybe you didn't watch it when you were sort of younger in that sort of, you know, the, the school days sort of freaking thing. And again, like while he's trying to play sick, the principal is trying to catch him in the act, like knows that he's just playing home and he wants to get him in trouble. So he's over there trying to, you know, sabotage him and... You know, it's one of those, like, man, you know what I'm saying? It'd be crazy to freaking see all of that freaking happen in, you know what I'm saying, your own freaking life. So I can vouch for, you know, Ferris, Ferris Bueller at the very freaking least. What was the other one that you said? Uh, you said Breakfast Club, right? Okay, so, uh, you know, if you've ever been in detention, you know, you can kind of you know well for, uh, we'll put it like this right uh everyone who's been in detention you you know just sort of like uh you know you, you you've you've been you've been there right you know what i'm saying life sucks uh and so whatever you just wanted to be disruptive in class or or do something ended up freaking there or whatnot and how dope would it be to you know almost end up really good friends with the oddball group of completely different people like each of them are a different character and archetype or whatnot um and all of them sort of forced to be in detention on a weekend which nobody would want to freaking do right like so again different things uh having to do with school or you know what i'm saying like whether you're uh, freaking in college freaking high school or some shit like that but i think it's way more freaking high school right um and this again it's like watching them go through shit on that you know what i'm saying sort of whole thing and uh you know if you can't if you can't uh really i get it though i get it though that's it weird science is a classic freaking too but see like all of the movies we're mentioning are all classics for like different reasons right they all have that thing that you know man i actually like being in podcast freaking mode for a freaking bit or whatnot we are at the end of the freaking show submissions are freaking closed and stuff like that but if we can stick around just for a bit to freaking talk about, hold on, let me just, let me pretend we in podcast mode right here, right here. Hold up, hold up, abracadabra. In a second, eventually. Come on, man. Black Panther, there you go. Dancer, that man sure has cancer. Ask answers, get questions, big weapons, blast master, quick faster, mix master, zigzags in a big bag for the kickback. Let me hit that search, switch back in the Christopher. <laughs> Listen, man, there is no way in hell that you're slower than I am. I will donate a snail. This is why we're here, man. You're going to jail. Peter Griffin hashtag Grace I didn't. I, I don't remember it ever leaving freaking that quick or whatnot but yeah man uh big freaking salute man you know what i'm saying as we freaking know when i hold on i'm trying to get the background music freaking back and that thing is taking forever what if i click over here right and then click back over here if i gotta like restart the uh no nope, yep i gotta refresh the connection the connection. Anyways, uh, just to continue the small conversation before we freaking head out of one now, but uh, weird science, you know what I'm saying? Definitely cool. And man, listen, though, Howard the Duck, classic freaking too. Once again, once again, you know, and at the time, I think it was regarded as one of the freaking, you know, worst, um, which again, as a kid, I didn't need, I don't remember that. You know what I mean? I don't remember it being like, what the hell is this movie and shit like that? I remember being like, oh, let's watch, you know what I'm saying? Let's watch Howard the Freaking Duck and shit like that. Um, Who Framed Roger Rabbit? I believe that came out in the freaking 80s as well. Classic, classic, classic. Can't get no better, man. Can't get no better. What a chili, no. He said, I love all three of those uh, movies Breakfast Club, Ferris Bueller, and Weird Science and stuff like that. That's what I'm saying, man. Weird science. 
And also, that's another thing, man. All 80s movie. There's not one 80s movie out there that, like, I could say I didn't like the soundtrack or something like that. Like, there was just something about the sounds of the 80s. Everything that all the bands and artists would freaking use that just made it even doper. Uh, and people cared about music, though. Like, literally. They cared so much about music that whether you were a video game, a TV show, a movie, uh, you had to have something that felt like it could, it could stand the test of freaking time. And if you go back to most video games back in the day, all of the freaking soundtracks are dope. Like, you could get down with some, like, some 8-bit, you know what I'm saying, freaking shit. Like, for real, man. Like, they, you know, you kind of wonder, like, man, and you were just programming shit. Like, you probably weren't even playing it on keyboard and, you know. Uh, but, again, there were so many freaking things, man. Like, I, I cherish the, the 80s, like, you know, no other just because for, like, the industry in all aspects actually cared about the content that they would release and stuff like that. Even when, again, we got, like, you know, million, don't, like, we today we're in, like, the superhero craze, but there was a time when, like, uh, slasher flicks were that thing, right? Or uh, Western films or, or something like that. Uh, Kung Fu flicks, uh, you know, and, and things like that. And, you know, we'll get things in different variation. Today, of course, we have more superhero flicks uh, figuring today. Um, but, uh, yeah, man. Oh, Weekend at Bernie! Hi -yo. Now that is a classic if there was ever one right there. Once again, another movie that I do think they could possibly do a sequel and or a remake. Now the question is, and I actually want to ask the freaking chat that, would you rather have a sequel or a remake you know what i'm saying again no a remake will not involve any of the original cast may maybe even i don't even know if the the original writers would be there and shit like that right but if you get a sequel you know you you can get you know some of the original cast freaking there whoever is still alive to you know be able to get in there uh and then you also could um you know, uh, bring along new people as well and shit like that. Like maybe one of the main characters now they're dead and they have to, you know, be brought back to life by the whole freaking thing. I don't know, man. Break dancing, another classic. You know what I'm saying? Break dancing. Matter of fact, I don't even think that you're break dancing. Everybody bigger knows that it ain't tense and they can for game for the game and they can never think of it. All right, let me freaking throw this one on this side. Throw this on that side, and that on that side, and this on this side, and that on that side. Anyways, listen, I'm going to roll out. I'm going to see y'all freaking tomorrow, man. Thank y'all for, you know, hanging around for a freaking bit or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? I do want to make a more structured kind of freaking situation for the That Door Key podcast and things like that. But honestly, man, you guys see what happens, man. Like, I have That Door Key freaking podcast, That Door Key radio right essentially that dorky podcast or you know more talking segments and stuff like that maybe we'll go into like you know a that dorky news segment where we talk about you know different things that are happening you know between marvel um and uh uh you know marvel dc star wars music you know all, all, all things you know what i'm saying culture and stuff like that of course so that dorky radio is more geared towards the playlisted records that ha that come on the show Often you hear those during the countdown, during the beginning of, you know, that Dorky Review show and stuff like that. Um, but there are times when I don't have that the time to do certain things because it's like I just feel obligated every time to do the show. You know what I'm saying? Like Not to mention there's that Dorky Gaming. I almost forgot about that. Um, uh, which, again, you know... I have to be able to focus on the music that I'm hearing and getting on the freaking show. So I always try to just make sure I'm uh, running that. But I do, again, I want to add more value into that, the, the freaking show. So I will try to load, uh, you know what I'm saying, those ways. And then we may be uh, streaming on other platforms freaking soon and stuff like that. I'll keep you freaking updated. 
um uh where we'll be able to you know what I'm saying have more of a toe hopefully we'll see what we'll see what's up Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul or something like that. Ah, see what I'm freaking saying? See what I said? Wait, did it even, did it happen yet? Or is it is it still in the works? Did it happen? Is it still in the works? Like, what's going on with that? What's going on with that uh, specifically? Hold on, let me fix this. Let me fix my camera a little bit. Make it smaller. Not what you want her to say. Here. Uh, like that's gonna be freaking crazy. Um, you know, July twenty. Oh snap! So that's happening on fourth. Ah, uh, see, people are gonna be watching that. What time? Because I was gonna try to go live on freaking four twenty. No wait, July twenty, not freaking April. I'm so confused, dude. I'm so confused. I don't even know what the heck I'm going to do with that. You don't even know if I am so cool, but I'll for the peak and people know that I don't even think I am so cool, but wait, am I in the, okay, I'm freaking good. Anyways, as, let me, hasta la vista, dorky. Let me throw this right freaking here. I don't know why that was doing that. And why is that so small? That's what she said. And I said, listen, can you stop? Stop. Relax, man. All right, we're going to go. See ya. Pardon. Pardon me, sir. Paging Dr. Mario. Paging Dr. Mario. Bro, it's two in the morning. Fell asleep and I'm yawning. Waking up on the lawn. I'm seeing blue and orange. People follow me to school and copy me until I stopped and put my music on. I'm just crawling like a zombie. Gnawing on a Nazi probably in his uniform. Born identity, homie, you've been warned. My brain is so... <laughs> oh, hey there, you hosers. It's Arsenal the Beat Chef there, up there in Canada. When I'm riding on Mooseback, I like to listen to that dorky review show. Dork Squad, eh?